folks, welcome to another play on live stream, live and uncut, we call it. My name is Nicholas. If you didn't know that, I'm help. Tycho, the child of chaos. Some people call me Tau Nick. Well, so today I'm playing Tau. I'm playing chaos. Because we have the points out. We can finally talk about them. We have oh. the index uh, cards out. We can finally talk about them. Well, we still don't have ah. them. I mean, we still don't have them. Yes, so we're yeah. using paper. Sorry, we're using paper. rattle a little bit. No, uh, you're using paper. I'm using the app, which oh. we can talk about too. Oh, so jealous. I okay. want this app so badly. So, hey, so this is like legit. We've been trying it out. They gave us an early copy one of the app. They only gave us one copy, one locked one phone. Which means I've been trying to steal Nick's yeah. phone for it's days. Been yeah, yeah. It works really good. It does. And it looks really good. It works like it's smooth. Like, Building armies are clean and, and easy. And working good and looking yeah. good is not something I'm used to. Like, building yeah. lists is a hobby of mine. It's, a, it's as big as any other part of the Warhammer hobby for me. So, so far, <sighs> it's been super easy to make lists, yep. super easy to see the army list. Yep. If there's one detraction is, is that I gotta get used to how it thinks mm. the, the data's laid out. Yep. So once I get used to how it thinks the data's laid out, I can actually navigate it pretty fast. But you can get to all the special rules, yeah. all the war gear options. I'm liking it. Everything I'm liking it. is right there at your fingertips. I'm liking it. Boom. So. Uh, People, people are going to be asking like what I think about it, so I wanted to wanted to let that know. Oh, you know what? Nick is going to split fire all game long. I am sure of this. That's how he do. <laughs> yes. All right. So, a uh, few ground rules uh, as we go into this game. Thank you for watching. If you've never watched one of these live streams before, keep in mind that we're not here to play the most competitive game of 40k. We're here to have fun. And part of that is that we're going to have fun. We're here to roll some dice. It's always a good time. Yes. Um, and we are playing Chaos versus Tau, as yes. I said. We do have a sponsor of this episode. The sponsor is Frontline. Frontline, uh, Frontline it make, had made the makes uh, the mats, mats the terrain. terrain. Uh, they have pre-packaged terrain. Oh, pre, uh, pre painted Pre-painted, like it's textured amazing. terrain. Yes, Tyco did paint this and they I did, did two yeah. versions of it. Yeah, yeah. They, they sell miniatures, they sell all sorts of stuff. And you can help support the channel going to the affiliate link in the description below. And you can purchase your Warhammer stuff, including the Leviathan box set and all that stuff. Well, yes, Cario, you are point. absolutely correct. She has amazing taste in clothing in general. Uh, me today. Thomas, we didn't do a live yesterday. We, we didn't do a live yesterday. Victor, headed! Whoa! What's wow, going Victor? Oh, oh my! Okay, that is a great segue uh, because not only can you support the, the channel by buying your Warhammer stuff from uh, Frontline from the description below, from the affiliate link below, mm. but uh, we like to do this something, something to. It, it acts as a bit of fundraiser, but it's also a little bit of fun. You guys get to help affect the game. So traditionally, we do something, but today we're doing something traditional. Uh, Oh, that was good. interesting how I said that. Our oh my goodness! <laughs> oh. Our... Well, so far it's three sniper shots. Uh, no, that's a that's a, a that's oh, not sorry. That's not kid, uh, Canadian. I don't know dogs. what that means then. Um. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> oh, uh, uh, I want to know. Can Nick remember all the epithets at this point? I have no idea. Um. But we yeah. do have a sniper for those of you joining for the first time. We have a sniper. It is Steve the sniper. Steve. Oh, oh, really? We called him Steve You're the sniper. Putting that on. Him. Okay. Because of the amount of ones he tends to roll. Uh, but basically, once we, every time we get to a threshold of $50 in super hat donations, which goes towards directly keeping this show on the air for um, for providing, uh, cleaning, literally keeping the lights on, hiring editors, paying for equipment, that kind of stuff. Um, every time we get to a total donations of $50 from anybody super chat, you can donate $5 and still goes towards it. Yep. Um, every time we get to $50, the sniper fires and you guys get to choose where it goes. It will automatically hit. It will wound on a two up, and it does D3 mortal wounds to whatever target it wants. Last oh, 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 stream, whatever target you want. Yeah, whatever target you want. And uh, last stream, it was actually pretty effective oh, of winning it, you the game. I think it, it totally, totally. Yeah. Uh, you know what? Somehow people are afraid of Carnifexes. Who knew? <laughs> <laughs> So if you guys want to pick on Tau, you can pick a Tau, but I'd love you to pick on Chaos for a change. Oh, that'd yeah. That'd be great. Yeah, that'd be um, fantastic. So as we said, we already have, we haven't even started the game, and we already have at least one sniper shot there, and I don't know what NOK means for uh, for currency. Anyone know what NOK is for currency? I don't know how that translates to Canadian currency. But anyways, we will get to those sniper shots in a second. We will do it before we start the game. Hi! There's so many chats coming in. We have, we do have a chat here. Whoa. We want to hang out with you. We, we want to hang out with you. That's why we're here. Uh, please type at Play on Tabletop so we can South see it. South Africa. From South Africa. Welcome from public. Scotland. And Scotland. What kind of I would love to hear in the chat where you guys are all coming oh, from. Yeah. Please type in yeah, where yeah. you're coming from because we get people from all over the round, around the world. That's really cool. Jin. Jin's in it? Norwegian. Well, uh, well, Norwegian. Kroner. Uh, Ooh, actually, that's Germany, probably worth good. Norwegian. Who knows? Um, it's about 1250 Canadian. Thank you, Archer Minos. Uh, Thank you very much. So that puts us uh, almost halfway to the next sniper, sniper shot already. Sniper shot number two. All right. 
Before we go into those actual sniper shots, we do need to actually tell you what we're playing today. Yes. So you do know we're playing Tau versus Chaos. Yes, we are. Um, we don't know the mission. Taiko, ooh, ooh. what mission are we playing ooh, today? Ooh, ooh, missions. We're playing the um, the Leviathan box sets, the cards. We oh, both right. showed in fixed secondaries, but... So the deployment was Dawn of War, so that means that we're essentially setting up across from each other. Standard. Texas, um, Ireland, France. Wow. Germany, Germany, all the world. Hungary. So cool. Mercia. New York, UK, England. Oh, yeah. New York, lots of England. Welcome. Woo. Thomas Rose, thank you so much. My partner doesn't believe me about your insomnia treat treatment. <laughs> <laughs> hey, we're what fantastic that was, singers. That was Thomas with the lullaby. Oh, Thomas. We thank Thomas a lullaby. Well, thank, well, hopefully we'll get to sing to you again, Thomas. Alpha Legion Sniper from Georgia. Ooh. Ooh. $10. Thank you, Mako. It's, we're getting even closer. But we, okay, can you tell us the mission before <laughs> we get to the Oh, Russia. All right, so our primary mission is Vital Ground. This is pretty standard. We're going to be scoring points for capturing objectives. Uh, more points for objectives in no man's land than on our own deployment zones. And even more points for objectives in our opponent's deployment zone. So it's two in our own deployment, five in a no man's land, six in the enemy deployment zone. And the second player goes, sorry, per, the player who goes second scores at the end of their turn like instead normal. of the beginning in turn like five. Normal. But that's basically it for Vital Ground. Yeah, we have a special rule for the mission. Oh, it's Vox kind of Static. This is your favorite. I, I don't like know it. why. It's kind of silly. Yeah, it, 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 okay, so Vox Static <laughs> is going to make it so it costs two command points to do a command reroll. Yeah, so the command reroll. Oh, my deprived save. Oh. We do a little trolling. Oh, my goodness. We're trolling already at two sniper is. shots, almost at three. And he's hunting fish. Oh. That's what trolling is. No, we do no trolling. He, he's calling chaos. Chaos are trolls. Trolling. I'm bad at spelling. I don't think that's, that's I, I think I think it's trolling, meaning they, they want to do troll. You guys are ugly like trolls, so we're gonna kill them. Vindicar is definitely gonna be busy this match. Oh, right? my Absolutely. Uh, oh my oh, goodness! Nick. Nick. Thank Hello you. Hello, States. Party on. Well, thank you. We're up to three. Uh oh. Three, uh -oh. three and a half sniper shots already. Oh my uh, word! <laughs> Nick is usually entertaining to watch, but even more so live. Limited edition T-shirt. Oh, brain I oh, Hope you uh, get to check out the tournament coming up in Alberta. Yes. Uh. Well. Well. I don't. Yeah. Yeah, if you're from Calgary, we're doing a, a, a tournament at, in Calgary, which is kind of fun. Like, like next week. Next week, yes. Uh, me, JT, and Michael Buckler is going to be there. That's going to be amazing. Anyways. Narrative um, madness. Are we at four sniper shots? Oh, Did good I miss Lord. that? One, two, three. Do we? I believe Glowface. I really do. We might be at four. Maybe I missed that. Yeah, we're at four. We are at four. <laughs> all right, we will do that before we start the game, but we do want to tell you what's in the armies first. So, first of all, the Tau. Okay. The good guys, the best army here. What is that big honking thing you I'm playing a Storm Oh. So, hey, what are you fucking saying? We're playing 2,000 points! 2,000 points in 10th edition. This is like actual 40K this is, this right is here, right now. This is traditionally what a 40K match would be. Thomas yes. Rose, thank you so much. You made her break out that. <laughs> That's awesome. Um, we are playing 2,000 points. I have brought a smattering of Tau that I'm experimenting with. Because I've yeah. only played a couple games with Tau. It is very different. Um, I have not brought Shasso Kikasso like people were asking because there is no equivalent of Shasso Kikasso. There's no close combat Tau what? currently. No trans neutronic keys <sighs> projector, Nick? Maybe we'll get it in the in the, when we get a codex and get some Kayun and Farsight, but for now. No, no I'm, honor gauntlet. No, there's no honor gauntlet. No, there's no, no close okay. combat Tau. Fantastic. So I have brought some Kroot supported by Kroot Hounds. Okay. We're at the overhead there. So that one unit? No, it's a unit of crew okay. and two units of four crew hounds. The crew hounds get extra attacks when they're near the crew, crew okay, carnivores. Cool. I have brought a unit of crisis suits right. with a cold star commander because that cool. makes them uh, move 12 and makes all their weapons advance rolls. Nice. Uh, or advanced weapons, or, or, or assault weapons. Assault weapons, so you're going to advance um, shoot. Yeah. With no penalty. God, crisis suits changed a lot, and I'm not sold on them yet, so we're going to try it. We're gonna find out. You I'm know what? That uh, this is that sentiment is yeah. pretty common right now. Yes, everything changed. Everything. I think there's a lot of groaning and be like, "Oh, this sucks and this sucks." And like, you gotta try it first, really, because like, math hammer is one thing, but actual practical on the tabletop where the scenario isn't perfect with perfect range and the perfect scenario where you don't have to worry about objectives and all that kind of stuff. So like, play it, try it, see how it works. And, and guess what? Forty K is a huge game. Yeah. We're gonna find something you like in there. So yeah. keep yeah. searching. Exactly. That now is the time where we get to explore. Yeah. And, and find the, exactly. the janky combos, find the way too cheap monsters. You know, like this yeah. is the time where it's yeah. the wild west where you can really like find yeah. your style and uh, yeah, take All a right. photo. In addition to that, you need a crest suit right. with uh, a cold star commander yep. led, uh, attached to it. 
Um, yeah, Kick-Ass was on a secret mission. Oh, yes. He'll come back when he needs to, Ooh. when you least expect it. Oh, we have to have a Malie version of the sniper at some point. Yeah. kick oh. There we go. That's going to be fun. Yeah. Maybe he go, go, dons his uh, his breacher suit again. Nice. Um, anyways, I also have uh, a ghost keel. Ghost, ghost keels are good this edition. Uh -oh. Like, they got a huge glow up. They're yeah. tough to kill. And they have essentially the, you can't shoot at them. Yeah, they have ways. Infiltrator. Or sorry, a, a lone oh, operative. Just and fixed. stealth. Yeah, it's cool. And two times per battle, I can just say that damage does nothing. Two times. Yep, I've got two drone tokens that basically just say, nope, that does not no damage. Yep, that's no damage. It's really fun. That's fantastic. Um, and then I've got a unit, uh, two units of um, strike team right here. Okay. A unit of pathfinders. Uh, the one the strike team has an ethereal in it, okay. mainly to give me more command points, okay. which is really nice. I also have a storm surge. Uh -oh. This thing's huge. It's towering, which means um, line of sight isn't. As, uh, it's true line of sight. Ruins don't obscure. So for instance, I am hiding really hard. For instance. Hard. He can see, oh, you did good. I really tried hard. So normally, if we call this terrain ruins, it would go forever. Uh, but towering can see through that, so I could see these guys and shoot. Boom. <laughs> you awesome. For Shasso, just take a commander and give them no guns. Kill the Venom Crawler. <laughs> I hate those things. Yes, really. Oh, the Venom Love Crawlers it. are awesome They are now. really good. Yeah. We're they... getting to your army in a second. Okay. Fine. Let me finish mine. <laughs> I also brought some... <laughs> Some broadsides, two broadsides with railguns, because yeah. they're awesome. Okay. They might be better than hammerheads. Uh-oh. We'll see. So you're like, oh, I didn't bring any hammerheads. I was like, oh, Nick loves me. And then he's like, but I brought broadsides. <laughs> um, I also brought uh, stealth suits over here. Okay. Stealth suits are going to be really key. They're nice. forward observers. Yeah. They can take objectives, and they give you reroll ones to wound. Ooh. It's really, really powerful. Um, and probably going to be my favorite unit in the game of 10th edition so far. Ooh. Has breachers in a devilfish with uh with a fire blade Ooh. gives them an extra attack each and they already get two hits hitting on threes so i've got 30 shots with breachers that if i'm shooting at something that's on an objective which is are largely going to happen we roll wounds as well so often i'm going to be hitting on twos because of guided and wounding wounding on threes or fours for most things except for vehicles of course and uh we're rolling wounds like it's gonna be awesome breach is gonna be great and then i have units of vespid because i love vespid i think vespid are actually really good this edition too their guns got Great. Um, cool. That's my list. They're, okay. they're, they're in reserves, by the way. The Vespid? Are the Vespid the only thing in the reserves? The Vespid are the only thing in Deep Strike, right. the, and the Breachers are in the oh, transport right here. Right. What is in your army, Tycho? I got nothing in Deep Strike, nothing in transports. I've put it all on the map. Here we go. So, uh, leading the whole shebang is a Demon Prince of Slanesh. Uh, he has the, a, um, what is it? The Elixir of something? Elixir of goodness. The elixir of goodness? <laughs> I feel like the elixir of like putrefaction or something. No, like that. no, I think it's the, the elixir um, of corruption. Yeah, something like that. <laughs> but it's going to give him a five up, feel no pain, and it's going to allow his uh, whenever he uh, hits you, uh, yeah. you take a battle pick, a shot cast. Excellent. Uh, and that he's actually got a bolter now, so watch out, he can do that from rage. Very cool. Um, I've got two other characters. I've got a master of possession leading the possessed, which is amazing. Uh, so that's over here. That's a big possessed one. If you see some uh, some big mutants in there, they're playing possessed today. Uh, there's also the Disco Lord of Corn. Oh, the uh, master of possession and the possessed are Mark of Slanesh as well. Uh, the big deal there is that I have one CP strap that allows them to advance and charge, which is ace. So that's good. Um, the demon, sorry, the Disco Lord of Corn has the Talisman of Burning Blood, so he's going to get lots and lots of extra attacks and extra strength and do horrible, horrible things to Nick's stuff in melee. <coughs> Moving right along, two units of cultists. These are both marked Nurgle. So this army is actually a patchwork army. There's no mark of a Chaos Undivided. Everything has a mark of the gods, but I am actually sporting all the marks in one place or another. Okay, Victor, thank you very much. Thank you very much. That puts us like $10, I Whoa. think, from the next sniper shots. We're wow. almost at five sniper shots oh, already, no. and the game hasn't even started, and Victor wants to shoot the fish. Well, <laughs> fish? There are fish at this table. I mean, that kind of looks like a fish over there. Those broadsides definitely there, need to There's go. no fish over here. I'm not sure what he's referring to. <laughs> no I mean, there's like, looks like tentacles over there. That's kind of fish-like. Not at all. I mean, they're tentacles, and maybe, do those kind of look like fins? Okay. Yeah, okay. There's sure. some fish over there. That's fish fine. over there. All right. Uh, sorry. Two units of Nurgle cultists. Yes. Talked about, talked about, talked about. Two units of Nurgle um, Venom Crawlers. Yeah. Venom Crawlers are amazing right now. I am so stoked about them. They produce a huge amount of shooting. Yeah. And with Nurgle, I can pray to my dark gods <laughs> and give them sustained hits on fives, which is going to be incredible with 12 shots each. 
expensive. Can't wait. Oh, uh, and here's one of the piece resistance, the four obliterators with mark of zinch. So this means that they're going to be able to uh, do lethal hits uh, on fives when they're Oof. afraid of their gods, uh, as well Oof. as be available Oof. for the skin shift stratagem. So for one command point, they're going to heal D3 wounds and a model. So brutal. So brutal. So on these big nasty models, that's pretty powerful. Uh, another awesome model to talk about is my uh, Hellbrute. Uh, he's got a really cool power which allows anybody who's doing dark yep. packs around him to get both of the powers rather than just one. So that's yep, going to be really powerful. Oh, you. chance boy! For, for chaos. Is this all for chaos? That's fine. All right. So if you're just tuning in, uh, Super Chats, Fire the Sniper. Every time we get to $50, so we just got over $50 with chance. Um, that means the sniper is going to fire at a choice of your target. So far, a lot of them like chaos. So, um, yeah. Um, hey, Owen, do you want to put up a poll for... Uh, for uh, <laughs> the shots are going to go. We should split it up fairly even. I mean, they're a couple, definitely at least two of them are going to chaos. Um Hey, Tate, put up a poll for if it should be three against Tau and two for Chaos, or it should be three against Chaos and two for Tau. Right. Uh, Slaneshi Chosen, uh, 10 strong. They're going to be fun. And some Nurgle Bikers. Uh, they are going to be fun, too. Oh, So okay. another thing about the Nurgle is that they have Dark Ops creation, so if I use that on a Nurgle unit, they get lone operative, essentially. You can't shoot them without a 12. So that's going to be really powerful, on especially my light units, oh. that can basically Victor! dodge a whole storm surge. Victor, what are you doing? Go, Victor, go! Right, thank you, Victor. I appreciate that. <laughs> uh, we're all already on our way. I think we're um, I think we're $20 into uh, a bit more. Probably 15 actually. Uh, sorry, probably 25 So we're halfway through to the right. next sniper shot. Okay. <laughs> Woo! Three against Tau, two or three against Chaos, two for Tower. Or two for chaos, three for yeah, I'm so confused. Yeah, basically, does the cow, the, the the chaos get more shots, or does the tau get more shots? I think that's up to chat. Yeah, that's, that's why he's putting a poll. I see. Excellent. Owen is manning this the, the switcher. Thank you very much, Owen, for doing that. You do an awesome job. We're glad to have you. Uh, sure welcome to the studio. Mm -hmm. And with that explanation, we're going to start this first turn. Um, as soon as that poll shows up and is finished, we will fire the sniper shots at uh, probably mostly tau. I'm guessing. <laughs> Because we have six shots loaded, and it's insane. Pew, 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 pew. People are wonderful and beautiful, and thank you. Uh, yeah, thank you very much. It goes a long ways to supporting the uh, uh, for supporting the channel. So far, three against ta Chaos, two for Tau, 100%. Oh, everyone wants to shoot you. Oh, it's going down. It's going down. Uh, it's going down. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. People, people, people like it. Ah, uh, well, you know, like you know what it is. Well, we wait. Shirt. Well, we wait for that poll to finish. Thank Why don't we roll for who Lisa. goes first? Yeah. Ooh, okay. So we're gonna, we've already deployed. We've, we've already, already picked deployed. sides. Yep. We're gonna roll for who goes first. All right. Good. You know what? Good luck, sir. Good luck. Man. Good luck. You want to go first this. or second? This is interesting. You know what? There's not a lot of targets, and the range of everything has been way down. It is. I would be totally okay with you going first because you'd come out of hiding and then I could shoot you. That's true. So with that in mind, roll for the dice. I am orange. You go first, sir. Oh, my three Good comes luck. through. And let's stop that poll and see where we're at. All right. So it looks like that's 62% uh, people want three into... It's three. Uh, three into chaos. Two percent. Oh, Plus no. the extra one. So there's actually six shots. So we're actually going to do an equal. Three, three. Three on three. All right. Sounds good. So um, I haven't actually seen any specific targets. Everyone just said tower chaos. Right. So I haven't... I, unless, unless Owen noticed something different... I guess you can choose, unless we see some shots, uh, some text coming up. But for instance, for right now, why don't you shoot one, and then I'll shoot one, and we'll go back and forth. So Broadsides! You want to shoot the broad? Of course you want to shoot. I got a two! So you hit, that means, so you automatically hit, two plus to wound, yep. does D3 mortal wounds. That's two. That's two! You've taken two wounds on the broadsides already. Good thing they have a shield drone each, so they're down one, uh, two wounds on this this drone, this broadside so right how here. how many do they have total? I will look that up in a second! <laughs> And in the meantime, uh, I will do mortal wounds. Oh, yeah, yep, yeah, broadsides. Shoot the possessed. Yes, against the possessed. That is a wound, and it does two mortal wounds against the possessed. Two mortal wounds. Uh, ouch, says the possessed. Yes, indeed. He's got one wound left. Excellent. Um, let's see. Oh, wait, actually, hold on. I have a six up, feel no pain on my possessed. Really? Because they're being led by a master of possession. I save them both. <laughs> Come on. Oh, the chaos gods right, are with me. another one. Is that another super chat coming in? What was that? Yeah. Whoa! How much was that? Tau good chaos bad. Oh my goodness, we have seven, 
And he said, tell good chaos back. <laughs> yes, he wants to help shoot the chaos. Well, since you shot my possessing, I'm gonna shoot your broadsides again. Okay, broadsides do have. Wounds. Oh yeah, three mortal wounds. Nice stop. Oh, I have a field of pain against mortal wounds. Well, boo. So that was two. Total of five. Three, four, five against the broadsides. And I saved one of them. <laughs> so the broadsides, broadside battle suits have eight wounds. So that is four wounds. So one of them is down to four wounds remaining, but he actually have a shield drone. So it actually is nine wounds. So down to five wounds remaining. I can't believe they made it that confusing. Well, I just said it really confusing, <laughs> but we got more sniper shots. Um, so uh, that was two sniper shots, three sniper shots I, so far. I've done one. I don't want to get some possessed one. again. Possessed are scary. Right. Uh, that's a wound. And it does two mortal wounds again to the possessed. You better not roll all of these. All right. So finally, I'm down. Yeah, I'm down to all right. wound. And then you've got one more. I've got two more. What? Yeah, because they added another one. Oh, man. On for you. Damn it. All right. Uh, let's whittle away at those drops. eight shots total? Oh, oh my. my goodness. So we've done one, two, three, four. Two more on your broadsides. Two more on my broadsides. On fives, I stopped them. Ah. I stopped them both. All right, and then another one. You know what? Let's possess. Sounds great. Let's right. be possessed. That's a wound, and it takes two more war wounds on the possessed. Yep. Ah, let's kill some possess. Awesome. Possess is ah. terrifying. You get, um, you get the mutants first. So you have. So that you've done three shots against the broadside. So you have one more shot, and I have one more shot. Broadside. Oh no. <laughs> you broadside fast. And then against you know what. Uh, I'm gonna go into your bikes. No. Oh. Against the bikes. No. It wounds and it does two mortal wounds. Ow. That was fun. That was fun. Thank you, chap, for doing that. That was eight. I believe we did eight shots there. Um, thank you so much for for helping support the channel. It goes a long way. If during the game we get more uh, super chats coming in, at, uh, every time we get to a threshold of fifty, the sniper will interrupt the game at the end of any phase and. Uh, Fire away. Ooh. So you guys can actually affect the game quite dramatically, as we saw in the last game where you killed all my Carnifexes. No, no, no. Chat killed all that's your true. That's true. Actually, that's not true. I killed the rest of them. Actually, Adam killed all my Carnifexes. Adam! Adam! <laughs> <laughs> uh, so, I'm one first, it sounds like. Well, um, if you want us to uh, respond directly to a comment there, please type at play on tabletop. There's a lot of comments. We'll try to catch it they if come we can. They come in thick and fast, yes. They come in pretty fast. Um, uh, yes, uh, it also highlights it, uh, not to put too fine a point on it, but it also highlights your comment if you super chat. <laughs> um, but oh, anyways. It says four plus 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 on your broads, not five. You are correct. It is right. against a uh, four plus against mortals. Maybe correct. I shouldn't have been shooting at your broadsides, but we'll figure that out next time. Yes, broadsides can be quite tanky, that but like you it. have first turn. I do. Let's see your moon phase. All right. So turn I go one. up to one command Can we see point? that cool turn one graphic? Yeah. All right, uh, Tycho's going first with his chaos, and I'm. Oh, I should mention my secondaries. Right, we haven't even talked about secondaries. What sec we've done? We've both chosen fixed secondaries. What have you chosen? I am playing chaos. I'm trying to kill you to the last man. Assassination and bring it down. So I'm just trying to kill, kill, kill. K kill characters and kill all my vehicles, which, yep. which in tenth edition, all my battle suits are vehicles. Yep. So you got a lot of them. Um, I have chosen uh, engage in all fronts. So okay. be in be in the corners or be in the quarters of the battlefield. Okay. And I've also chosen. Uh, I think it's Overwhelming Force, is it called, Owen? Um, What's the other one? Overwhelming Force? Let me just throw up both of mine and we'll see what it is. Uh, basically, I've got to take your objectives away from you. Basically, if I take new objectives every turn, um, that uh, that gets me points. Awesome. Um, so, with that in mind, do your move phase. My movement phase. What is your movement phase there, sir? Hmm. I'm not going to be able to get into melter range. Sure. What? I said uh, I'm not... Is it overwhelming force or attempting target? What was it? Oh, what is it? Was it? Oh, and what was it? You put it up there. I don't think oh, I well. have any command phase shenanigans. I will find it while you keep uh, doing your movement. Nope. No command phase shenanigans. <clears throat> Storm hostile objective. That's what it was. Storm hostile objective. Control one or more objective markers that are controlled by your opponent at the start of your turn, or the opponent did not control any objective markers at the start of your turn, and you control one or more objective markers that you did not control at the start of your turn. So basically, take objective markers away from Tycho. Jenna the Sheep, if there's enough super chat during the stream, can the whole uh, play on tabletop team go on a week vacation? 
That would yes, be nice. Technically, sure. That would, uh, well, uh, to, to be honest, a whole week, no. <laughs> the whole team to go in a week, the price for that would be like pretty well, astronomical. Well, we have we have a schedule to keep. Yeah. So there's at yes, least going to be something upload. The even YouTube if we did beast has to has to be fed. Oof, the beast. <laughs> <laughs> but that is very kind of you to think of us. That is yes, very kind of really you. Appreciate it. We have been to be honest. We've been working very hard in fed. We have, and we've released almost every something every day, if not a couple day, times a day. Um, sound is low. Everyone but one. Now, who's that one, Tack? <laughs> okay. Uh, bikers are off to the races. Off they go. Fast bikers. Zoom, zoom, zoom. It's always weird when we do live streams uh, because when we film, I have I'm I'm often the one filming, and when we film, I'm often um, I'm often every time we do a movement, I'm grabbing the camera to come do shots of it. So I have to fight the urge to do that. It's almost like habitually in me. I see a movement, I gotta go grab the camera to take a close up of it. Um, even when I'm playing tournaments, like I went to a tournament last weekend, and uh, I, I had to keep fighting the urge. Malatok! Shooting fish in a barrel represents the gods well, Tycho. Death to the fish emperor. Malatok! Death to the fish emperor! Well, I appreciate emperor. your awesome donation to the channel. I don't appreciate you targeting the Tao. <laughs> What's your favorite pizza? I'm partial to um, meat lovers. So, as, uh, so... A Malat Malatok, as soon as the movement phase ends, we will interrupt and Tycho will shoot something something fishy. Um, I will do so. So, And if you have time to do it, please type what you would want him to shoot at. Yes. Uh, advancing of the Chosen. Chosen. Point to where the Chosen are? Chosen. Right there. It's a big unit of Chosen. Big honking. It's like a giant unit of Chosen. Pull to find out who stays behind. <laughs> <laughs> Only if you can make the poll. It's just Owen for five choices. <laughs> Tao good, Chaos bad. Go Tao Nick and get some kills, Nick. Oh, I'm counting on it. I'm tempted to even do an Overwatch right now. 24 inches. Overwatch is a cool stratagem now. Flee! 24. Oh, it's almost in range of my Tower Storm Surge. <laughs> Try to hide from that damn Storm Surge. Because I could Overwatch with all my Plasma shots right now. Really? Okay. Oh, we have one command point each uh, at the beginning of the round there, uh, Owen. We should both have one command point. I leave it up to Tycho's discretion, Malatox says. Look at that. I appreciate Fish that. Fish are friends, not food, unless you're chaos, then they're food too. <laughs> so you're moving up. What's that there? Venom Crawler? Venom Crawler. So you've moved on to the two center objectives. You're hoping to get some shots on my Pathfinders or my, my uh, Fire Warriors here. Obliterators are really slow. I think I'm just in range to get one in. Do, 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 do. Thank you, Nick, for the book recommendation reading Damocles. I hope you like it. Uh, Broken Sword. A couple of the Damocles ones are kind of like, eh, they're kind of cheesy. But the Broken Sword uh, book was really, really good. I really mm. like that one. Uh, Nick would be better off if you were to guard at least only Tyranids and Cannibals eat those. <laughs> we did play a guard stream for Patreon and YouTube membership earlier this week, and it was a lot of fun. Are these guys hidden from your Storm Surge? You can be hidden. I mean, I can still move the storm surge, and I can move him over here to see you. But then he doesn't. He gets better when he doesn't move, right? Uh, I believe his weapons are heavy. Yes. So I can double check that. Uh, -ba. Battle Forge. Oh, I love this app. I'm playing with a new Warhammer app. It's really great. Uh, I can actually recommend it. Um, I was concerned about it. I was like, eh, is it going to be any good? And yes, it's actually pretty decent. The rules seem accurate. I haven't encountered any rules errors so far. Um, I'm hoping if they were are able to keep it updated with changes and stuff like that, that'll be great. But uh, that'll be, yeah. Uh, what are your thoughts on new Burst Cannon profile? Well, it's different. <laughs> <laughs> to be honest, the Tau Codex in 9th edition was like, let's give... Tau everything and the kitchen sink. So I was kind of expecting it to go back a bit. But I, if there's one thing I really don't like, it's that they put fusion blasters to 12 inches rather than 18. That was kind of our thing. It's not our thing anymore. <laughs> so a little bit sad about that. A little bit sad about that. How fast do things move? I don't know anymore. Yes, yeah, so all my weapons are heavy. So I will definitely want to stay still. Anyway. Wait, the new app is there? The new app is not out yet, but we the embargo has lifted us by being able to talk about it. They gave us an early access. Nick, have you seen Midwinter Mini's Chaos Tower prank job? I have. I even commented on it saying this is heresy. Uh, it was beautiful. He did a great job. 
I've been tempted. I don't want to do a Chaos Tau army, but what I would like to do is like a Ravaged Tau army. Like they're very like ragged, maybe like a fourth spear expansion. Basically, they they're out of supplies. They're barely hanging on. All their armor is rough shot. They're running out of ammo, um, and so like really dirty um, Mad Max style chaos, or, or not chaos, a uh, Tau. Um, I don't want them falling to chaos, but I wouldn't mind them being at the edge of chaos, just right on the edge. Right on the edge of chaos. The app is not out, but it is really awesome. Um, if they if they the caveat is, if they manage to keep it updated, it'll be very, very useful. And building a, a building an army is really easy. It's just it's super easy, especially with how tenth is with, with uh, almost everything is free. Like point, like there is no point upgrades. So like building an army is like boom, 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 boom. I, I can do it in like five minutes. It's very nice. There are some units that it gets a little funky because they've got so many different options. This is true. This so is true. it can be a little bit. It was I, it was mystifying. kind of fun because when they they gave us access to it, Victor Hendon. Whoa, what's the difference between Patreon and YouTube membership? Practically nothing. All, they get access to all the same stuff. Um, really, uh, practically the only difference between Patreon and YouTube membership is the fact that uh, how you consume the exclusive stuff and the uh, early access is different. So in YouTube membership, if you're into YouTube, you get it on YouTube. It's a little bit easier to find. Uh, but if you do Patreon, some people like Patreon better. Um, you have to go through Patreon to get access to the stuff. That's, that's the main difference. But we tried really hard to make them functionally the same. Um, the, I guess the only other difference is that Patreon has a few different tiers to give you a few extra bonuses. Like there's the producer tier and the special character tier and stuff like that. But but uh, but they both get access to Discord. They both get access to the same the same stuff. But uh, yeah, thank you so much. That actually puts us. Does that put us over? Yeah, we're five bucks away. Five bucks away. Yeah, thank you very, very much, Victor. That was very kind of you. Um, so five bucks away from another sniper shot, and we already have one loaded in the barrel. At the, as soon as you finish your movement phase. Done. Perfect. You've moved about everything. It looks scary. Um, you. Uh, he said you could choose where it goes. So. Ooh. Yeah. Ooh. Where do well, you want it to go? Um, I think I don't like the cut of the jib of your crisis suits. Crisis suits. Three mortal, Three mortal wounds in the crisis suits. Ugh. All right. Well, the crisis suits each have shield drones each. Two of them each. So they actually have two extra wounds. So actually six wounds each. So you've done three wounds to one of them, which means he has three wounds left. And I have no feel of pain on those guys. Uh, I need a dice. Where are all our wound dice? They get two, okay, cool. They have four wounds normally, and each can take two drones. I've taken two shield drones on every single one. Limited average, put us five bucks over, there's another shot. <laughs> Nathan got to try Tau, and now they're my favorite army, but more importantly, your content helped me through a rough time recently, so thank you. You're very welcome. Voidforge Minis also here's the last five, which actually puts us five towards the next shot. Ooh. So another shot's Ooh. going right now. You, uh, the, uh, so I think from- Where was that shot going? I, I, I th he said Tau is nice, so I think it's in my shot. I think it's mine. You just shot! I, I wanna shoot again. Oh, I'm shooting. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna shoot at your, uh, I'm gonna shoot at the bikers. <laughs> no! I don't like the bikers. They they wound, and they do three mortal wounds. Oh, that's bad. That's bad. Uh, okay. Did I kill a biker? Yeah, Biker's yeah, gone. Excellent. Thank you for the pop goes the monkey stream. Excellent. I love Victor that. Henderson into the fish. Oh, Victor, <laughs> Victor, Victor, Victor. Why are you doing that to me, fur boy? Oh, thank you very much, guys. Um, Just did, Nick. I gotta go. No worries. And oh. Adros, blood for the blood gods. Rip oh, we're so Nick, close. Nick, CEO, look, it happened. <laughs> Justin, thank you for declaring Nick Since CEO. Since you're going to be on vacation, we plead to approve more t-shirts. Yes, all the t-shirts are approved. <laughs> all of them. All of them. <laughs> Love the Riptide must fall. Ooh, I like uh, your cut of your jib, Adros. Adros, pardon me. Um, Ad okay, so we I think that puts us like something like $10 from the next shot. What? Yes. Okay, so you've taken... So I, I'm just waiting on $10 for another shot on you. Excellent. You, you go to your I shooting phase. I love that. Go to your shooting all phase. All right. Shooting phase Ooh, it Thank is. you, everyone, for all the donations. It goes a long way. Helps the channel. And it's a lot of fun. It's kind of fun to bring you guys into the show. We can't have you guys in here physically, although it would be fun to have an... Wouldn't it be kind of fun to do it in front of an audience? Like it live, would. like working with the people? This is kind Actually, of like we, we have done that. We have done that with a few people. Yeah. I guess we have. People have been around. Yeah. You know. I, I can design stuff, Tack. You may not like my designs, but I can design stuff. <laughs> I'll do more drawing designs like you just did. Tack has a very Barbie gun. I really want a Barbie gun t-shirt. Barbie gun. There's also a t-shirt I want to make uh, have happen that was um, uh, that uh, Tycho made for me. Oh, so yeah. So Tycho drew me a yeah, picture right when we started. You keep shooting. All right. Um, Prince is going to shoot at your... Um... It was a manatee. 
What did, did Swab Preacher. Walrus, blood for the blood god. Blood for the Put blood god! Over. As soon as Psycho's finished his shooting phase, the sniper's gonna shoot again. And it's gonna, it's gonna shoot a Tau, because he's going fish hunting. Come on! <laughs> Three wounds! Something cool about what that. What are you guys? shooting at? Uh, minus one. I'm shooting at your uh, preachers up here. Oh, these these are uh, these are fire uh, pathfinders. But yes, cool. They had shotguns, so I said. Yeah, they're, they're fireworks. They look like shotguns. Or sorry, pathfinders. Um, so how many? Three. Yeah. All right, here minus, minus one. what? Minus, minus one. one. They have piece. cover, so it goes back to their five. And I hit you none. Pew pew pew. So that kills three uh, three pathfinders. That's right. Pew, and I believe pew, with my pew. intoxicating elixir. Battle shock test, please. Hey, Taya. Oh, right now. Battle shock right now. He okay. just causes battle shock when he hits this. All right. Uh, battle shock. They are battle shocked. Battle shock. Uh, a battle shock sucks. token. Where's the battle shock token? That's this can be a battle shock sucks. token. Yeah. We, well, we actually have uh, these tokens. These would be perfect Ooh. for that. All right. Well, it's your guys. We just have. We're just gonna need a lot of them, right? Huh? And you only have one of those. <laughs> I got more. <laughs> we need to make actual battle shock. Tokens. We we do. I think like, little skull tokens are where it's at. Something like that. Yeah. Okay, that yeah. was fun. Cool. Moving on. Oh, thanks for the quality content. Who is who is that? I just missed that comment. Who's that from? Yeah. We thank you very much. That puts us thirty dollars away from another shot. We're still we've got one in the can for the end of your shooting phase. Keep shooting though. <laughs> All right. Um, this so, obliterator can only see that those guys as well. That obliterator over there. Just this guy in the awesome. corner. He's trying to hide from the storm surge and shoot, but he's only one guy, he's still in range. <laughs> yes. The so one obliterator is going to open up with his be rough. fancy, fancy good because he's not going to actually dark pack yet. Or maybe he should. Oh boy. Should I dark pack this, guys? Always. Always oh, dark pack. Always dark pack. Of course. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Obliteration. Dark packed. Uh oh. oh. Takes D3 mortals. I take two mortal wounds on my obliterators. So, down to three wounds left. Okay, it looks like I can still do greater good even if I'm battle shocked. I just can't be the recipient of a greater good um, if I'm battle shocked, which is good. Ooh. Oh, yeah. Uh, D6 plus three shots. So, that's going to leave me with. Uh, Who's this against again? This is against your. Fire Wars here? Pathfinders. I don't think I can see the Fire Wars. I think it's only the Pathfinders. Pathfinders, got it. Um, you like all these Pathfinders, don't you? Kind of. Yeah, yeah. you don't like them. Yeah. They are pretty good. They're pretty. Like, they do good. So that's Void nine. for minis! You guys notice the red dot of a sniper sight trailing across the bottom. Oh, boy! Oh, no! When will 10th edition review of Admech coming out? I don't know, Tack. When will 10th edition review of Admech be coming out? Yeah, Tack. <laughs> 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 oh, the child of chaos. I'm not referring Can't to the fish people. That. You're referring to the fish people, Jacob. They are not fish people. Oh, my. Okay, so... Oh, my goodness. I'm not going to have any Pathfinders left. That's one miss. That's going to be three Pathfinders hits. are four up? Are they four up save? They are four up save. I forgot that. Yes, I'm so used to them being five. So, because I am... Thank you. Thank you, Connor. Oh, that's what I forgot. This is only my second game with Tau okay. in 10th edition. There's a lot to learn. So, they're Mark of Zinch, which yeah. means that when they're firing uh, and they've got the lethal hits added, yeah. because that's what I do when I dark pack, it's grab lethal Fantastic. hits. Um, so, they did take, he did take two mortal wounds for this privilege. Oh, great. Because he failed his dark pack. Great. Or his, his leadership test. But it means that on fives, I critical. Oh. And this weapon also has sustained hits one. Oh, my goodness. So. <laughs> so, you, that's a lot of extra hits there. So, I've got five extra hits. And so, uh, these, and these poor pathfinders. I got five extra hits and five wounds. <laughs> so, there's the five wounds. And I just roll uh, all of it. Uh, um, Admet content or paint content? I don't know, folks. Would you rather see a, a content of TAC talking about Admet, or would you rather see content of TAC talking about how he does his painting? Good question. Yeah. All right, that's going to be nine wounds at minus one. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Well, as someone pointed out, I do have a four up save, which goes to oh. three with cover okay. and back, back to, to a four. Yeah. So on fours, you might have killed the squad. You've killed one, two, three, four, five of them. Hey, they're still alive. They're still alive. Awkward. Um, I've got three left. No, I've got two left. Two left. I think I can handle that. Yep, you probably can. Two, two Pathfinders two, left. Two, two poor two. Pathfinders. Oh, yes. They're still in range. <laughs> 36 in range on the Venom Crawlers. Fine, come into it. They're Adam Locke, thank you very much. That puts us even closer. I think we're like, what, 20, 30? We are. Woo! That was another day, so it's only, it's a 45 left. 
Four, oh, because we are we ticked over. So that, that puts us $45 from firing the sniper again. Oh my goodness, Banshee! Aha. Time to let the space cows do some shoot back. Oh no! So I get a shot and you get a shot now. I think that's where we're at. Okay. Yeah. Uh, the help group can't fire, he advanced. But the Velen Crawler in the back is going to do a dark pact and take out the last two. Well, what do your Pathfinders actually do? Uh, they, they really, they're just buffers. They buff my army. So be, but having two is the same as having 10. Yep. Hey, I just need one. Fair enough. Okay, you know what? I don't need to dark pact here, but I'm gonna anyway! Dark pact on the Venom Crawler! Uh-oh. He takes D3 mortal wounds. Uh-oh. D3 mortal wounds? Oh, no. <laughs> You've been killing yourself a lot here. I have. This, this is uh, not working out the way I was hoping it would. This is a really <laughs> silly move. Because... <laughs> But now I get all the things. He's going to get sustained. Double sustain. Oh, it doesn't double. Actually, it does because he's around. Sustained and lethal. Is uh, this this one or is this this one? That's back one. That one back there. So this back here, Venom Crawler, is firing into these Pathfinders, the two remaining Pathfinders That's up here. That's right, yeah. Yeah. Okay, and on fives, sustained and lethal because the Hellbrute's around. Yep. So the Hellbrew buffs guys around him. The Hellbrew has an aura that turns, um, when my dark, my dark pact, it yep. allows both things to be chosen rather than just so the good. one. So that's really awesome. Uh, oh. And I selected the Nurgle, so that gives me a crits on fives. So that's going to be an amazing amount of uh, seven extra hits. Or seven extra wounds. Right, and then roll all this again. Right, six. Two, Matt S. He actually used on those two. really man for an upcoming 40k and 40m. We played Necrons versus Orcs. That's coming out soonish, maybe next week. Yeah, pretty cool. Pretty soon, actually. Ah. So that's 15 wounds on those two guys. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, forty, fifteen. Can I make 15 four ups? I'm not even gonna oh, look. That's minus two. I'm gonna take them off. I'm not gonna look. Actually, maybe it is only minus one. All right, close. They're gone. Venom crawler. Where's my venom crawler? Regardless, I didn't get enough. I got, there's at least one, uh, two twos there. Okay. So, and Pathfinders are dead. Bye, one Pathfinders. more Dark Pact on my good old guy here. Wait, you haven't shot this guy yet? Nope. I thought you shot both Venom Crawlers. No, that was one Venom Crawler. Oh my goodness. <laughs> I thought I was a shooting army. Can you be done your shooting phase already? All right, you <laughs> silly... I'm going to do the um, Crisis Suits. Into the Crisis Suits, got it. So I think that's my best bet. Bring it on, bring it on! Well, I guess you're going to try and rush this with Fire Warriors, aren't you? I don't know what you can do. Let's see what I do. I don't know. I don't know what I'm going to do. Hmm. It all depends on what you leave me at the end of the game here. Hmm. Maybe I should do the broadsides. How many wounds does the wounded five. broadside left? He has five left? Five left on one of the broadsides. All right, into the broadsides. Uh, Dark Pact. Again, he takes the three mortal. I failed every I'm single okay dark pack so I'm far. Okay with that. <laughs> Dude. I'm okay with that. So he's got. You're getting some right. good buff from it, though. I am getting some yeah. good buffs. I mean, that I didn't. I kind of wasted it in the last one, but. Do we need? I, do you painter? have all the damage dice, Nick? Oh yeah, I do have them. Would you like some? Yeah. No, actually, I don't. I'll just not damage my units. That'd be great. Here, in fact, I'll give you black ones so that make it nicer. There you go. So he's down to seven, I believe. I'll double check. So this one's down to seven because you damage yourself. Oh, I can kick that out. Do I only have? Nine? I've got a storm surge that wants to kill you. Yeah, that's going to be interesting. This is going to be very, very interesting. Hmm. I shouldn't have double-sided these. You know, Sheep, is there a talented young painter? Are you, are, you, are you saying you're a painter? Is that what you're saying? I don't know. Is that what you're saying? I don't know. Oh, uh, interestingly, this guy now Who's has, this guy? Okay, my Venom Crawler who, obliter who killed off your Pathfinders. I thought those obliterators that obliterated. Nope. It was the Venom Crawler who finished them off. I'm just trying to do But when things. I kill stuff with a Venom Crawler... Yeah? He gets an extra attack on all of his weapons till the end of the game. He, I thought that not, in, not just in close combat? Back Whoa. Up the That's nice. But it used to be that it was in close combat. Yeah. Uh, no, cool. it never happened at all before. At the That's end of any phase. New... At the end of no. any phase. That's fantastic. So my my shooty Venom Crawler back here yep. is now extra shooty. Excellent. So that means he's going to do seven shots with each gun, and he has seven attacks in hand well, to hand Well, come combat. on. Bring it on. <laughs> what else you got to shoot? All right. So this is the front Venom Crawler going into your... Crisis suits. Crisis because suits. we're saying this is not a ruin. These are just uh, armor containers, so it means he can see over top, and he can shoot. This oh, my goodness. We have three sniper shots as soon as you finish your shooting phase. 
Oh my goodness. Thank you very much. Chaos hurt itself in confusion. Oh, that means there's two chaos, two shots against chaos and one against Tao. I love that. There, uh, Flexor, we did, the points are now released. You can go see points for all the armies. Uh, and, uh, so we are now able to talk about points. We have the points. What's your toughness? Uh, the, the crisis are toughness five. Okay. Um, yeah, it was fun. Uh, I am obscured, so we'll get cover. You will. Against you here. So that's kind of nice. That's going to be 13 wounds minus one. 29, 10, 11, 12, two damage 13. 13. 13 at minus one. Yep. I got cover, so it goes to be a two, back to a three. You have a two up save on your crisis? No, three up. But I have cover, so it goes to a two. It doesn't go to a two. But you beat Because it. of your minus. Yeah. It doesn't go to two, you are correct. But uh, functionally, it does. Mm. Um, so I, wow, 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 what was that? Uh, that's 16 damage under your crisis suits. Are you serious? Two each damage one's... Piece. Whoa. Okay, so each one's two. That's right. So this kills one of them. That kills another, and that kills another. You killed all three crisis suits with that one. Oh, so both my venom crawlers have leveled up. <laughs> what venom just, crawler doom. What just happened? <laughs> the dark gods. They 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 took wounds from me, but they made oh. sure it was worth it. Oh yeah, no no no, it doesn't matter. Yeah, I, I, even with my invuln shields. Wow. Okay. I sure miss having shield drones that could take damage. Bye, Crisis Suits! I'm not wow. sold on Crisis Suits yet. Ugh. Fine. Duh. <laughs> I want to try them, man. I slayed the fish. Now I have a shot here, dude. Do I don't know. Okay, so now you're, you're done your shooting phase? I've done my shooting phase. At the end of your shooting phase, we are going to fire the sniper. So, so the sniper is going to shoot. And we have three shots loaded in. One of them is against the, uh, the Tau, and two of them are against Chaos. So, against the Tau, who would you like to shoot now that you've killed all my Christ suits? Stealth suits. Like the meanie you are. Stealth suits. You wounded. You did three, three more wounds. One of the stealth suits is gone. Bye. Wait. Oh, look at that sniper go. Ugh. Wait, well, I get two shots. What? I I'm going to kill some That's spikers. terrible. All right. I think. No. Seven wounds on that Venom Crawler? Die. No, I don't need the Venom Crawler. Storm Stormster is going to take care of him. Um, <laughs> yeah, let's kill those bikes. First shot into the bikes. It wounds, it does. Take three mortal, three mortal wounds. Oh, no. oh yeah, and let's fire into the bikes again. Thank you all these sniper players. Uh, it wounds and it does. One mortal wound. That's all you needed. Excellent, you killed the bikes chat. Well done, you're winning the game. <laughs> and now I, I guess hey, I don't get so, the, hold lucky, on, did lucky, I claim the objective at the end of the shoot, end of the movement phase? Uh, you claim the objective at the beginning of any phase. But I guess I don't keep it. Well, it's not stickied. So no, you don't have it right now. No. Yeah. Um, uh, Clucky Bubba, that's a, that's a little premature. I haven't had a turn yet. So, yeah. <laughs> yeah, Clucky Bubba, let's, let's hold up. <laughs> it's a little let's, premature. Let's, let's see what the storm surge is up to first. Yeah, so maybe stealth suits aren't as good as they were before. Fair. But they're also a lot cheaper. You know what? And actually, that's something we all got to remember, folks, that with points changes, is different. any yeah. any stat can be awesome. Yeah. If it's pointed directly. Yeah. So, yeah. Yeah, exactly. So, but now my crisis suit's all by itself. But yeah. So, like, th th those crisis suits in ninth edition, that would have been like four or 500 points. It's not. It's yeah. not even close. It's yeah. like half that. Yeah. Um, so, yeah. Do I, I, I need to hide way better? Yeah, I could have hid better. I, I honestly could have put probably the crisis suits here, probably hid better. I still um, could have gone at them. Yeah, you probably could have gone better. Maybe I could have put the crisis suits here. Now, but you I know gotta what? say that the crisis suits, okay, to be cl clear, mm -hmm. the crisis suits are not necessarily your damage dealers. Nope. In this, they can do damage, and they could, could be decent at damage. From what I'm reading, the crisis suits are really your mobile, like deal with threats force. Like they, they, they're mobile, so I have a lot of mobility with them, but uh, not right now. <laughs> Cause well, they're dead. Well, just down to a commander. Yep, commander now is a new unit by himself. He's all alone. All alone. He doesn't matter. All by That's okay. Himself. You can do great. Um, are you done your shooting phase? I am. Okay, so we I killed the bikes. Great. Um, let's go into uh, my turn. No charges. Is there anything within 12? Nope. Pooey. Pooey. All right, so at the beginning of my turn, I get a command point going up to two. You didn't use any command points, did you? I can, yep, I go up to two as well. Excellent. Um, and let's uh, what do the your ethereal phase. do? My theory, oh, my ethereal in the command phase gives me an extra command point on a four up. It does. I'm actually at three command points, Owen, to uh, his two. Ooh. And we still have no points. Did you score any secondary points in your turn? Oh. Uh. I've got to kill stuff. This is vehicles. These were oh. all vehicles. Oh, I scored lots then. Yeah. Battle <laughs> to are now vehicles. So I'm up to six is it, points. Is it minimum two? That's two minimum, yeah. 
Crisis suits give up secondaries nicely. Uh, bring it down. Monster it. vehicle scored Flight two Marines and points. 10th done dirty, five 10 man squads and only sold in seven pack standard. It's a little odd, yeah, I agree. But yeah, I guess. You, you know what? Uh, let's hold off just slightly on the Death Guard. I, I do feel a lot of pain regarding some of the changes Sorry? as well. Oh, he's got six points? You yeah. got six points? I yeah, do. six to zero. Okay. But we don't know how they play yet. In my tests, I've been frustrated with the speed of the Death Guard, but not their damage dealing capability. So yeah. Yeah. Let's, let's, let's hold off on getting, but you know what? There's a lot of salt out there and yeah. I think a lot of it's justified. The, uh, the Death Guard have been done a little dirty. All right, so my, my, uh, my, uh, hmm. my crew are just gonna run up. Uh, uh, they can't really do a lot. They're gonna advance. The crew are gonna advance. And they advance three inches. So they advance charge. They cannot advance a charge, but they don't need to. Cause my problem with these guys, oh, and the, the ouch puppies, the crew towns are also gonna advance. Um, and the other ouch puppies, cause they have three ouch puppies, the two ouch, units of ouch puppies there, crew towns, as factionally known. So they're basically all moving the same and they're all just gonna pile right here. They're not able to get in the objective though. Okay. To be clear, but that's okay because the ghost kill is going to get the objective because the ghost oh, kill is no. awesome. Oh, <laughs> no. Um, or do I want to put him on this objective? I think the ghost kill... Ugh, because you killed the crisis suits, I can't actually get on this objective. And I didn't take an objective away from you, unfortunately, so I can't get my secondary there. Not yet. Not yet. Yeah. Um, I can, however... I can advance and charge with my Devilfish, and the That's guys, sorry, advance. I can advance with the Devilfish, and, and then the guys out can move. get out. And then move. Yeah. Yeah. So I think what's going to happen is I'm going to say no, no to the Lord of Sword in there, and my Devilfish over here is going to advance. <laughs> what's going on? Yeah, they can't feel very much pain. They, 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 yeah, they feel pain now. One inch. <laughs> One inch, which means nine. Oh, nine. 10, 11, 12. Ah, I can get an objective. Excellent. Boom. And then all the breachers are going to get out with their fire blade. Now, the one thing I failed but to do with this uh, low advance roll from the Devilfish, which kind of sucks. Actually, no, I'm going to spend a command point on that because I want to see this stratagem in, in play much better. Okay, good. So this, what this allows me to do is the whole point is I'm trying to be able to hop back in the Devilfish because there's a stratagem to allow me, if you declare a charge against them, I'm like, nope. Bye. See ya. It's kind of fun. Uh, so they're going to hold the objective tenuously. What's your OC there? <laughs> it's very... Oh, my OC on Venom Crawler is three. Three. Perfect. Great. So well, I still own it. You still own it for now. Okay. <laughs> um, yeah. Okay. So they're going to stay here and hold the objective. My Fire Warriors here. We're gonna move up. Holding objectives is tough. Can just, be. Just moving up the guys here. Just putting the guys from the front, back in the front yeah, to yeah. make it work. Um, broadsides can see your Venom Crawler. They're gonna take out the Venom Crawler. Right. Uh, is gonna stay still, so his heavy weapons are great. And he's gonna shoot those Hell Brutes and possibly the Venom Crawler. And he can't see the back Venom Crawler. He can't see guys over there. He can see guys over there. And this guy, this... This, uh, go, uh, what is he called? Cold Star. Cold Star. Gonna move up here. Excellent. Excellent. Uh, has Gino mentioned anything regarding boarding actions? Uh, meaning what? The, the boarding actions are still legal. They're still fine. You can still do it. I guess it's great. Boarding actions are awesome. I like boarding actions. They're fun. I wish I'd play more. We could play some. Um, okay. So I've moved everything I want to move. This is dear. Uh, oh yeah, these Guardian Drones are kind of fun on these guys. Oh, these guys. I've got um, the stealth suits here. Maybe I should fire Overwatch. Yep, this is a great time to fire Overwatch if you want to. It's only one command point for a firing Overwatch? Uh, it's one command point for firing Overwatch. All do right. you want to do that now? Because if I can take out enough of those Breachers, I might be very, very happy. Oh yes, you might be. You might be indeed. Mm -hmm. So, I think it's on the Venom Crawler. So I'm going to go down to one command point. Yeah. Overwatch the Breachers. Yeah. Dark Pacts. 
course he takes another D3 mortals. <laughs> I failed everyone so far. You take one more mortal. You're down to six wounds. Actually, oh I, I boy. Yeah. Down to six. Down to six. Down to six wounds. Where's I love it. Six? I love it. I'm very happy with that. Uh, all right. All right. That's not great. But now you got to Overwatch. Are you, I'm assuming you're Overwatch the Breachers or are you yep. doing the Pathfinders? I'm doing the Breachers. Breachers. All right. Uh, but they do get Dark Pack. They do get all the gubbins for being Dark Packed. However, they have injuries. they have a drone, a special drone, a Guardian drone. Right. And that Guardian drone means they're minus one to be wounded. Okay. So instead of twos, threes. Yeah, it's kind of fun. All righty. Um, critting on fives, getting all the goodness, lethal and sustained. Here we go. Shooting at those pathfinders. I'm looking at the breachers. Oh, uh, didn't roll hot like I used to. How does Tycho feel about the Blight Lord Terminators? I think like that they got cheaper. Yeah, I think Blight Lord Terminators are great. Pretty straightforward. Yeah. I mean, you are nothing Stengler. spectacular. The problem Two with them is they're, for that reroll from the for the Devilfish, right? Uh, oh yeah. You do go down an extra command point. All right! That was your idea, oh, too. Oh, man. Okay, down to one command point. Thank you, Jordan. Thank you. Appreciate that. And that puts us a little closer to a next sniper shot. Uh, I think we're at probably 40, I guess, for the next sniper shot. Where seven is? wounds, minus two. How did you get seven wounds on Overwatch? Oh, right. I and it's minus one to wound. And you hit on sixes. I'm going to start all over. Were you rolling hitting normally? Yeah. Yeah, you were. Like, come on. I got to watch this guy like a hawk now. <laughs> You so know what? I shouldn't do it if it's just hitting on sixes. It's hitting on sixes and it's minus one to wound. Because I guess even if I crit, it doesn't mean a hit. Even on Overwatch, I just have to hit on the six. It's natural sixes only. Yeah. Uh, I think that the six still counts as a crit for this. Well, I guess I'll spend the command point. Let's do it. Okay. It's still standing the command point. Uh, Don't hit. No sixes. Okay. So, Whew. waste of a command Whew. point. Yeah. Ah, boo. Yeah. Yeah. Thank you, Dennis. Thank you, Dennis. Yeah, I think Tiger just forgot. That's so all. I took mortal wounds yeah. and spent command points I love it. on nothing. It's great. Can we shoot now? Can I shoot now? Yeah, shoot. Excellent. Uh, well, last before I move, I do need to decide what I'm going to do with my stealth suits here. Ooh. Stealth suits are really good because if they guide a unit, they get reroll ones to wound. So uh, I'm just going to move over here. They have to see the target, though. So they're only going to see these denim crawl here. I can't see them. You got a tank in the way. OK, fine. So instead, I don't need their shooting, so I'm gonna advance them. One inch. They this guy's here. Up. Why can't they go up? Because one inch is a lot more than what you have. You have to measure. Yeah. Oh not, yeah. Yeah. Go angle. They're fly. Uh, they can angle. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They, they can fly. So I'll go like that. Fair enough. Now I can see a venom crawler. <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh, because they can advance and still spot. Yeah. Nice. Oh no, they can't. What? All right, so spotting rules are interesting. Mer, mer, uh, Mr. Furnoid, Nyx Tau, and Tekka's Death Guard, my favorite two armies. Interested to see what you guys can do with 10th edition content. Keep the amazing work. Thank you very much. Oh, and someone, did someone donate? Uh, Matt. Was that Moselia or Matt? It was Matt. Thank you, Matt. I you appreciate rock, that. You rock, Matt. Uh, that was kind of you. For those of you just uh, joining us on the membership, check out some of those uh, exclusive games. Check out the Discord and join us there. It's a lot of fun. We've got lots of exclusive stuff for you to check out. It's a lot of fun. And some early access right now. Like, you can go see Age of Sigmar. We released our first Age of Sigmar game on the early access right now, uh, as well as we'll have more coming soon. Uh, but, okay, so, to clarify, we're at For the Greater Good. We're at For the Greater Good is the army switch rule for Tau. Basically, you pair units off, and the uh, you one is the guided, guided unit, and one is the spotter unit. The spotter unit has to be able to shoot. <sighs> they, they, oh wait, I can do it, because they have a marker drone. That's what the marker drone is for. Marker drone allows you to be able to spot even if you advance. Okay. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Nick's stress level dropped three points. So his drones the, are effective. The, it's gonna take me some. It's gonna take me some getting used to, of how this how, how this thing works. It's, so it's a brand like, new game. I have to partner units together. Yeah. So for instance, over here, I'd like the ghost keel to be able to shoot over here. Does the crew can't spot? No, they well, cannot. Auxiliaries cannot do for the greater good. And the spot E. I choose two units. They both have to see the target. One is the spotty, doesn't get any bonuses. The guided unit gets plus one to hit against the target it's going for. So basically gotta like pair up units. So for instance, over here, I'm gonna pair up the the, the 
I'm going to pair up the Stealth Suits with the Storm Surge. Okay. Uh, ooh. No, I'm not. Because the Storm Surge really wants to split fire all his attacks. It's true. And when you are a, a guided unit, you are minus one to hit anything that's not your target. I see. So I'm actually going to pair up the Breachers with the, uh, with the, no. Railguns. So broadsides. So broadsides are pairing up with the stealth suits. So stealth suits are going to be the, the, the guided, the spotting unit. And the gui a guided unit is the, the, these guys, whatever they are, the uh, broadsides. <laughs> Too many words. <laughs> oh, Nick, you're going to hate my next move. All right. So they shoot now. You have to declare all your spots first. No, but it's going to be easier to do if I do this now. Okay. Um, because I, I got to get it in my head about how the, all the pairings work. For instance, I'm going to pair the Devilfish with the um, the Breachers up here. Um, and then I'm going to pair the Fire Warriors here with the Fire Warriors. No. And like, the who's, fire warriors who's here? the spotter and who's the spotty? Uh, the Devilfish is, is the spotter. spotter and the Breachers are the spotty. spotty, the guided unit. And these Fire Warriors over here are going to spot for the Ghost Keel over here who is going to be the guided unit against there. Because there's one big unit, right? They're at that pop. They can see. Oh, because I have a flag. You have a big giant flag. You're holding it up in the air saying, I'm proud of chaos. Boom. I'll see him. <laughs> so, Tau 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 and 9th edition were pretty much, uh, uh, they were an autoplay unit. There, were, there weren't, there wasn't a lot of subtlety to it. It was basically just like, run forward, shoot your guns, and Yay. often win the game. Tau and 10th edition, you got to do a little more thinking. A little, a little more thinking, a little more planning. You know what? I appreciate it. I actually don't mind that, but it's going to take some time for uh, getting used to that. So, that's all my pairings. Ooh, Nick I've, and Steve I've, Tyco and JT. That's not a good I have no one really to pair the the uh, this guy with, so he'll just be fine. So, have let's a good fire. bedtime story, Jim. Um, Ox can spot and be guided if they have a ranged weapon. Uh, are you sure? Oh. They don't have... I don't think they have for the greater good in their... Uh, in their uh, their data sheet. Good thing to check, but uh, from my understanding, I think I'm out of luck for the... We do not have an Iron Warriors army on hand. Very sorry. Our Chaos, can... Plus, there isn't technically an Iron Warriors rule set at this time. Yeah, Crew Carnivores do not have for the greater good. They cannot do that. I knew I was right. I knew I was right. Aha! What is Ox? Ox. Uh, auxiliaries. These are auxiliaries. They're not Tau. So, and they advance anyways, and they can't fire. So, anyways, let's do some firing. Shoosting time. Shoosting time. So, I'm going to declare the Breachers into your Venom Crawler. I'm going to spend one CP for Dark Obscuration. What does that do? Uh, it means that I have stealth, and you can't target me outside of 12 inches. Good Picking thing you target. Good thing these are within 12 inches. You can target your... your uh... Yeah, that's what I'm doing right now. Okay. I'm targeting the Breachers into this thing. Oh, I thought you said the broadsides. No, I said breachers. Uh, I well, pointed to them too. I, I, do you I'm still want to spend a command point? I do. Okay, so your minus one to be hit. Right? Yep. Because yep. you have stealth? Yep, and I have cover. However, uh, sorry, stealth gives you benefits of cover. Nope. Stealth gives me minus one to hit. Right. Right. I have cover because of the building. Right. Um, broadsides. Uh, broadsides wouldn't be able to shoot you, but broadsides do have um, battle uh, battle suit support system. It basically ignores all modifiers to hit rolls. Cool. So, but the outside of 12 is not going to help you here. So, anyways, breachers, let's see if we can kill you. So, I will get... 30 shots from these breachers because of the fire, uh, fire blade helping them out. 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30 shots. <laughs> and because you are in range of an objective, I get to reroll all my wound rolls. And because they are being guided, get plus one hit. I get plus one hit. So I'm hitting on twos. Hitting on threes now because I'm stealth. It's really annoying. <laughs> Hitting on threes, uh, uh, yeah. Oh, one fell down. Hitting on threes. Come on, get the dice of the carry. Hitting on threes, getting rid of the ones and twos. Hey, yeah, I rolled pretty good. That was a pretty good roll. Very good. And then... Toughness of nine. Toughness of nine. So, wounding on five. Five we're rolling. Fives, we're rolling all failed wound rolls. Does it just fail? Any fail? Any fail. Oh, that's good. It's fantastic. Because you're on a, because you're on a duck murder. Hey, that's a pretty good amount of wounds there. Already, and then I get to reroll all of these. Give me more fives and sixes. Let's see it. Ooh, yeah. I'm hoping you fail a bunch. 
One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. AP of minus one. Um, I have a save of three, and I'm in cover, so that'll just be three. You get no cover. Why? Because you have a marker light on you. A marker light ignores your cover if they are being guided. Okay. The mark. Oh, the the devil fish has a marker light. No, no. Um. Uh. Sorry. Let me reread this. Let me reread this here. Sorry, it was eleven. You said there's eleven wounds. It's a lot to uh, keep keep up with. Um, that I don't get sustained hits yet. Come on, Venom us. Crawler, survive! Uh oh. If their observer unit has a marker light, then ignores cover. So the, the devilfish does not have a marker. That's what it was. So yes, I just got the blister skill. I could not get the ignore cover. Okay, so that means I take six wounds and die. Excellent. Where didn't help ya. So, Excellent. Yep, yeah, that was a wasted, more wasted command points. Uh, do I explode? The demise on a six, but it is a it is a live stream and a house roll for live streams. You must reroll those explode results. Five. It's all. Six, it's, it's always six. Yeah. However, there is a weapon in the Imperial Guard arsenal. Uh, one of the Bane Blade variants. If it kills a vehicle, you explode on a three. It's kind of fun. I like that. That's fun. That is fun. Um, okay. Good job, breachers. Well done. They've taken the objective. They feel good. Um, now let's go with the Storm Surge, who wants to kill a lot of things. Um, he's going to fire his big giant gun at your Hell Brutes. And he can't see those guys. He can still do those guys. And all the rest... Oh, he's also going to fire his Destroyer Missile at your Hell Brutes. And all the rest of the missile... Uh, all the rest of the guns right here. A few of them are out of range. So I'm split firing. Split firing because I stayed still. They're all heavy weapons hitting on threes. So first of all, the big shots into the Hellbrute. Gotcha. So let's go with the Destroyer Missile first. It's a one-shot weapon. Uh, hitting on threes. But I've got four of them. It's not a one-shot weapon anymore. That's true. Uh, okay. So i got to look up the Storm Surge because he has a lot of guns. It is a whopping 400 points for the Storm Surge. Um, oh, we hit the button. Right. Enough. Hit the button. Thank you. So, Tycho, I'm doing what's called a... Uh, Split we both do it, it doubles up the audio. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, we have, we have cool little buttons, it's fun. <laughs> so, the range weapons. So I am doing the destroyer missile. It hit on a five. It is strength 16. Uh, I am toughest nine. Oh, so it only wounds on a three, not a two. It does wound, however, at minus four. Uh, minus four, I have a two up save in cover. So that'll give me a five? Uh, it, uh, yeah, yeah, it will. No, it does D6 plus two damage. Oh, it does eight damage! I have eight wounds. I killed so one! I don't explode. Are you going to roll again? Yes, live stream says you must roll again. Um, and then it is the big giant. I uh, miss because it doesn't fire. The Hellbrute is dead. Isn't there two in the unit? There's only one Hellbrute. What's this thing? That's an obliterator. Oh, I'm sorry. I thought that was a big unit. Um, yeah, I guess, they, is I guess they declared everything as a Hellbrute. All right, cool. Sorry, I thought that was a unit of two there. No, no, there's uh, the Hellbrutes are just dreadnoughts. I, I mean, it's good to kill the uh, Hellbrute, but... I, I, was, I, I thought he was hidden. Well, I, if, you're if you're saying he's hidden, well, I, 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 if yeah. the intent was a hide him, that's fine. I'm, I'm asked if he was hidden before. You, yeah. you are correct. I thought it was a part of a fair unit. Yeah. I apologize. Uh, so now all the rest of the shots into those Marines. Cluster rocket system might be at a range. Nope, 48 inches, we're in range. 4d6 shots. Uh, 6, 7 at 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15 shots. So that's five, that's 10, that's 15. These are gonna be hitting on threes for the heavy. Uh, that was not great. Um, missed a lot there. I like the thought of that. Um, and then these are black. Oh, these are blast. How many guys are in that unit? 10. 10, so there's two, two extra shots. Uh, hit one more. And then it's strength five. Toughness of four. So on threes, one, two, three, four, five, six. Six wounds at no minus. That do one damage each. Saving up. Sorry, six so you get full save and you get cover. Cover's not going to help me here because I already have a three up. There you go. Then he ones and twos, so just one damage there. Okay. Great, great, great. And then the the uh, flamers are out of range. The smart missile system is in range with four shots. How far is the smart missile now? 30 inches. 30? Uh, it's always been 30. I hit you once. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. And I wound you once. No minus, one damage. Okay. All right, and that's all of him. That's all of him. You you didn't he didn't get to fire his big giant gun. He didn't. Well, he 
did, but the, it was already just pieces of Hellbrute raining from the Yeah, side. there we go. There we go. <laughs> All right, so that's the Storm Surge. Storm Surge did great. I wish I could have used the big gun, but um, it's fine. He killed the Hellbrute. Hellbrute needed to die. Um, we're gonna... The Hellbrute did a lot of damage. He you. did. The Hellbrute was terrifying. Yeah. So we're going to go next with the Ghost Keel. The Ghost Keel is going to fire everything into this unit over here. Okay. It is being guided, so we'll get plus one to hit. Okay. Um, and let's go to the Ghost Keel here. Ghost Keel weapons are pretty decent, actually. So I've, I've went with a Fusion Blaster stuff on him. So first of all, he has a Fusion Collider. That is two shots. Pineapples. On what? Oh, the shirt! Yeah. <laughs> that's two hits. And uh, strength 12. So that's two wounds. Okay. At minus four each. Uh, I don't think... I, do I, do I, I guess... Depends on what you got. Um, I can put this guy in cover. Sure, you can put that guy in cover. So that's six. Sorry, two wounds? Two wounds at minus four. Nope. First one does d6 plus two damage. That's a dead, that's a dead one. The four. second one does d6 plus two damage. So that's a lot of damage. And then I've got two more fusion blasters, also hitting on threes. Hit once, and wounds once at minus four again. Nope. D6 plus two damage, because melted two. Yep, another five, six, seven damage. <laughs> good job, Ghost Keel. Ghost Keel's really good. And then, last, uh, oof. Got no targets with the second player over there. Yeah, I think both could see through the Ghost Keel's legs there. Yep, yep. Yeah, okay, so my uh, broadsides are going to fire into these Marines over here. What are they called? Chosen. Those are chosen. So the broadsides have two railgun shots each. So that's four railgun shots total. Uh, they hit you on fours. Uh, no, they're going to hit you on uh, fives because they are being guided. Mm. But it was into this this thing over here. Mm -hmm. So And that's dead. So they... So uh, that's only one hit. So it's only one hit, yeah. Um, it Strength 14. So dead to wound. Um, at minus... Four. Range weapons with a heavy weapon. Minus four. You How get, much damage? Uh, D6 plus one damage. You get cover, so you get a six. What do I get cover? Uh, yeah. That's right. Oh, yeah, you definitely get cover. All right. D6 plus one damage. It does three damage. That's just enough. <laughs> All right. The twin plasma rifle, am I within 24 inches? No, I am not. Out of range of that. All right, so almost all my shooting done. The only thing I got left is my commander. Mm. This is not Chasso Kikasso because he's on a vacation. And we'll see if he comes back with a codex. Vacay. <laughs> uh, so my commander in my broadside, uh, or in my Cold Star battle suit, first of all has, he has a cyclic ion blaster that I'm not going to overcharge with three shots. Hits all three. And that is strength seven. So wounding on threes. And I wounded you twice at AP minus one. They won. So it does one damage. And then he's got um, he's got a fusion blaster. Oh, two fusion blasters. Hits. Hits once only. And he wounds at minus four. Okay. Uh, From here? I guess I have cover. Our guy gets cover, sure. That guy too. Yeah. Oh, you have to take it on that guy there. So I, I don't. I, yeah. He dead. He, did. he made you dead. Okay. That is all my shooting. That was, you know what, that was decent. I could fire the, you know what, I could, I could fire the Devilfish. The Devilfish will fire into your Lord Discordant. Okay. He'll get, uh, he'll get drone shots. Devilfish here, into your Lord Discordant. That is a Lord Discordant, right? That is, yeah. And he has hit you, actually, quite a few times. Look at that. Hit you four times. Strength of five. Uh, tough as more. So, sixes or fives? Uh... At least one wound. Do I have a toughness of ten? I'm hoping it. it sounds delicious to have a toughness of ten. Yeah. There we go, and the Devilfish is, has the accelerated burst cannon. Yeah, so that's six more. Cut us nine. Cut us nine. All right, so that is two wounds, no minus. I take one. And then the accelerated burst cannon hits you once and wounds you once at no minus. He's okay. All right, and then lastly, the two seeker missiles. This actually has a decent chance. So hitting you on fours, hits you once, and strength 14. That is not a wound, and I do not have the command points to reroll. No oh, wounds. no. Uh, that sucks. All right. That was my shooting phase. Right. That was my ability. I killed two big units, which was good. You did um, kill some good stuff, yeah. I you, did not you get killed, any. You've I, killed bikes. You've killed Hellbrutes. You've killed. No, Chat killed the bikes. Chat killed the bikes with the sniper. 
through, but it did take me off an objective. It did. It was very nice. <laughs> uh, which means I've taken objectives away from you. One. Yep. Uh, I, I, I took one objective away from you, uh, which scores me my secondary. I did not get engaged in all fronts. This guy's just within three inches. They are within three inches. Yeah, within one guy's within guy. three inches. Um, so I've taken an objective away from you, which gives me a uh, storm hostile objective. And that gives me four points. Uh, four points for storm hostile objective. So I have four points. I did not get engaged in all fronts because I'm only in two table quarters, not three. That finishes my turn and finishes the battle round. And I believe I'm winning by one. No, you're winning by two points. Did that? Did someone just give us more memberships? Ooh. Is that more chats? Are we? Are we in another shooting? Michael Jackman, many shillings for tack. Also, oh, please let me see the pattern on the shirt. Cool. It looks epic from Lincolnshire. Think uh, Frodo's hometown in the UK. <laughs> Whoa! Cool. We just wow. got another shot. Okay, Michael, as the person that put it over, where do you want to shoot that sniper shot? Oh, let's shoot some tow. Let's yeah. shoot some tow. We're gonna we're gonna do this. We're gonna do. <laughs> You've got, the, you've got the cool I've got the cooler one, yeah. yeah. Mine's only green. Well, mine's supposed to be for rail guns. You're supposed to be for Necrons. We haven't changed it. Oh, well, that's how <laughs> these things go. But, uh, Michael, where do you want to put that? And uh, score is now six to four. I've got one command point. Tycho is zero. Um, oh, my goodness. Uh, how do you feel about the Tau shooting? It's pretty good. Yours is pretty good, too. Mine was just awesome, too. Yeah. I, yeah. I, I, I think that it's really hard to say so far. This is a pretty thick dense map yeah it is so, oh no adam oh adam, adam. <laughs> one to the stormfish another one to the fish transport the two dollars for the reroll <laughs> I, that was, that was I, smart that was i like the reroll all right smart. so i got two shots to make right oh my here goodness. so there's three shots uh we're still waiting on where the one is going so into the town oh come on okay so three shots <laughs> well, sorry one was to the one to the storm surge one to the devil fish and one of your choice all right so uh, you have one wound Why? left on one of those broadsides? Is that what that says? Uh, back there? Uh, no, sorry, this should be five. I got bumped. Oh, okay. uh, five wounds left on the broadside. Um, all right, so first on the Doublefish, wounds for oh, two. I for, actually, these guys should have these guys here. Uh, wounds for two. Uh, oh, so oh, there's two damage? On the Doublefish. On the Doublefish. Doublefish taking two. Oh, and then boy. the other one misses. Ha! But Matt did pay for a reroll. You deep did it. <laughs> <laughs> sorry, what was the other one on? The other was on... The Storm Surge. Storm Surge. So it does... Three mortals to the storm surge. Well, fortunately, the storm surge has something like twenty-two wounds. Um, so, devilfish has thirteen wounds. So that's down to uh, eleven wounds remaining on the devilfish. Right. And the storm surge, I believe, has twenty-two. Um, so that's going to make it down to because it starts with twenty. It's down to eighteen wounds remaining. Eighteen wow. wounds remaining. Well, thank you. Oh, and you get to choose one more. Oh, right. Yeah, because everyone uh, loves you and no one loves the towel. For nobody no loves Nick. All Let's... These, whenever we do sniper games, I, I seem to get picked on. <laughs> it's because you play towel. Tower awesome, though. They are. Tower, a lot of fun. Uh, Ghost Kill. Yeah, I'm having fun. Fails. Oh, no way! This was not one of the ones he paid for. No. So you don't get to re-roll that. I don't have any command points. I would spend my command points for you, chat, <laughs> but I cannot. Hey, Owen, do you need copy? Jen says... Coffee would be great. Um, is Jin, are you the one that keeps sending us coffee to the office? Because if you so, you're awesome. Yes. Nick said he'd get you some. I did like to say he'd get you some right now. You want me to just leave the game so you can like do weird things. Weird things, the weirdest. <laughs> <laughs> All right. right. So, so that's, the, that's finally the end of turn one. Right. Epic things have happened. Epic. Um, the score is close. The score is close. Um, and but you're about to come attack me with a lot. I'm hoping that I've managed to kind of speed bump you here a little bit. I'm hoping that you can kill this and then I have all this to kill you with. Yep, you've given me some wonderful things to charge, which uh -huh. took me across uh -huh. the map. I love charging. Uh -huh. This is my favorite. Oh, Justin McFarland! Justin. I don't want late, so I have no idea what's going on, but it looks like money is power, so use this to help the tau. Thank you, Justin! <laughs> Can't wait to get some secret missiles everywhere. Justin, you're awesome, because I've been picked on this entire game. Oh. And I'm guessing the 102 is for two rerolls as well. Yeah, yeah. That's for one reroll. Two bucks for one reroll. Oh, no! Oh! There's another reroll from Bam. What's going on, Zach? Who wants coffee? Uh, apparently, Owen wants that coffee. They're trying yeah. to convince me to go. I already have coffee. To go get coffee. Yeah. I got coffee. Oh wow. Okay. Well, thank you, Justin. We Let's do this. We have a big, beautiful coffee maker downstairs. We do. We have a very good. So there's been a patron, um, uh, two patrons actually, have been sending us coffee, and it's some of the best coffee I've ever had. I I want to know where it is so I can get it myself. <laughs> yeah. Okay. So More fish I get two shots. Incoming, my friends. You know who needs to take them? Um, that Venom Crawler. 
One into the venom crawler. You're looking at me with this like daggers right now. There's no daggers. It wasn't me. My eyebrows are just raised. That's all. Chat. Don't get mad at me. <laughs> I'm not mad. It wounds against the venom crawler back I there. I bet it did. And it takes three more oh, total wounds. Lordy. You're down to three. Three. And Jordan Strangler, could the Bronzos have a different spotted unit? It seems like the server spotted declared one selecting unit. Yeah, technically it could. That's that's actually a good point, Jordan. But I, how I did it, I, yeah, I probably I probably should do it sequentially. You, you should do correct. it the way it's supposed to be. I should done. do it the way it's yeah. supposed to be. Thank you, Jordan, for reminding that. And thank you for getting us closer to yet another shot. Um, so, and then the next shot, how many wounds does that Venom Crawler have left? I have a few more t shirts to show you, Mike, just so you're fully aware. Actually, not t shirts. I have you know what a few more really cool t-shirts. is a play on logo with um, with uh, overlay of the, As a pattern. Of the, of, of the, the, the pineapples as a pattern. You want pineapples? And play I love that'd be, it. That'd be fun. I'm into it. We can just we can change the backgrounds of all, all pineapples. The pineapple team would be great. Please uh, don't kill my venom crawler without allowing him to do anything. What are you talking about? It killed the pathfinders. It has definitely done stuff. Okay. Um, I'm gonna One go into time. the no into these legionnaires. Those aren't legionnaires. Whatever they are. What are they? Chosen. Cho oh, chosen need to die. Onto the chosen. It hits and it does. Two mortal wounds. Oh, thank my lucky stars. Did that kill one? Nope. They're three wounds each. That's why they're chosen. Ugh. Okay, okay. Can I just pretend that all those crude are equipped with flamers? You can. <laughs> I can also pretend that I'm immune to flamers. Yeah, there we go. Uh, <laughs> all right, so thank you very much uh, for those those uh, shots. Uh, Got to be a, be a hunter-gatherer. Have fun, Jen. Um, let's go. So turn two. It is now turn two, Owen, and uh, you have first turn, so go ahead, uh, Tycho. All right. Are you feeling overwhelmed by the Tau Firepower, or are you feeling in a good place? It's it's a fun place. Yeah. Uh, you know what I'm more scared of than the Tau Firepower? What? Chat. Chat. That's <laughs> devastating. <laughs> Thank you, Chat. Yeah. Yeah. Still to run. No, it's turn two. It is turn two. It is turn two. Yeah. Uh, okay, so in my command phase, I get a command point. You get a command point. I do. I'm up to two command points for myself, right. and you're at I'm, one. I'm at one. All right. So um, you score primary. I score primary. You hold one here. And one here. I want so to I score two for the back one. Two and four. I think oh, we better okay. touch it. Where is that mission objective? You have that over there. Vital ground. Uh, yeah, I score a total of seven. So two for my home, five for the mid. And then it, and if you take the opponent's one, it's six points. Six points. Yeah. So I bet you're coming for that, aren't you? With your Do little you know best Oh, yeah. Yeah, can you come off that uh, that back there? and? Uh... Well, it's sticky because actually my cultists have sticky. Cultists have sticky? Oh, that's Only cool. ca all the cultists in different armies have different abilities. So actually, interestingly, this is a Death Guard thing that I might need have to, to start playing with. But Death Guard cultists yeah. get scout. Oh. So all of a sudden, the cultists can run forward six before the game. Problem is, is that they don't have dark ops creation, so you can't really protect them from being shot. So I'm not super sure how that plays out, but I mean, it's a speedy can... choice yeah, for okay. the Nurgle, which is what they need. So yeah, and it's know. true, you have some struggle with that. Yeah, I, I definitely yeah. have struggled. Yeah. At points. Chat identifies as Eldari. <laughs> Chat identifies as Eldari. I bet they do. Uh, Tycho should design play on button ups. We thank our patrons for how much they keep us caffeinated. They do. They do. Next balance day, uh, data sheet will nerf chat. <laughs> <laughs> chat is unnerfable. Uh, Takuana, you have been Discord messaged. Caffeine is amazing. I want to know if I can have more than one enhancement for my army. I'm playing Thousand Suns and I'm short on points. Yes, you can have up to three enhancements for your army, but yes. you do have to pay points for them. Yes. So go check out the points that have been released today so you know how much. I have two enhancements in this army. I have zero enhancements in the army because I actually, because I put two units of crude in it, uh, crude hounds. Ah, uh, the units of crew towns. I didn't see any that really jumped out of me for this army, so maybe in the future. So this is the Lord Discord, and this is probably one thing I'm really terrible at. Are all these about. marker blitz? Oh yeah, they're all gone. Okay. They're all gone. Um, could you bring your wounds with you? I want you to not forget that he has nine wounds remaining. I will not forget. <laughs> I'm going to rub that in there a little bit. Yeah, yeah, I bet you want to rub. Anyway. Let's stop talking about that. <laughs> which copy? I can send more if it is ours. Matt, okay, yeah, no, I think you're, I think it is Matt. Both of them were awesome. But Matt, which company was it? Because I want some at home. My copy is terrible at home. I want to buy some for home. Where where did you get it from? <laughs> did you, like you guys didn't make it, did you? If you did, how can I buy it? Because it was good. All right, I'm gonna move through the ruin. I'm gonna be on the bottom floor. I'm gonna take this off just so I can. But I'm gonna put them on this floor. So everyone can I, yeah, see. Uh, Reckless, I do I do agree. It's kind of weird that there is not a single Tau weapon with anti-anything that I can find. I don't think there is any. Um, yeah, I couldn't see any. Tau have a lack of anti and don't have much devastating wounds. It's really just the railguns. Possessed. 
All right. Keep in mind, I don't want to gotcha. As soon as you declare a charge against these guys, they can hop in the vehicle. <laughs> dum, da dum, dum. Hmm, that's interesting. Yeah. Isn't it cool? I can actually overwatch you and then hop in the vehicle. Okay, so I'm actually going to advance them from that position. I might shift how they moved a little sure. bit. Do you want to get on the objective? I'm going to get them on the objective and probably go for a charge that on makes sense. both. We'll yep. see. Because uh, they can advance charge if I spend a command point. Ooh, that's pretty beautiful. And you have one command point to do so. Four more inches. Oh, that's worth it. That's worth the advance so charge. They started here. They started right behind, so they could go a total of thirteen inches. It's pretty true. Uh, to be fair, this guy got bumped. He should be with the bigger up there. Fine. Be that way. Dum dum dum. They're scary. Possessed. Yes. When we get to close combat, it's just like it's. It's terrifying. Yeah. Do anti-fish weapons exist? I don't know. There's no fish on this table. <laughs> None at all. Uh, did I miss a response from Matt? Did Matt say where the coffee was from? Because I want to know. It's an excellent coffee. For play on? Ooh. 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 There are technically EMP grenade launchers for Pathfinders and something for the crew parts. Yes, EMP grenade. Great. Oh, I can't. Forget about grenade launchers. I can just do like mortal wounds on you. That's it's fun. Um. Oh, I gotta think about Overwatch here. Do I want to Overwatch anything? How'd you come up? These guys can actually Overwatch on fours. That's. Um. Yeah. I think that's actually, to be honest, I think that might be worth it. No, I'm not gonna do it. I want those two command points. Thank you. Thank you, Nick. Uh, thank you, Matt. I appreciate that. Uh, awesome. He said it's his coffee. Okay, once the Tau Codex comes out, uh, we can do play on Custodes versus Tau. Ooh, that'd be fun. Uh, Nick, how are you finding list making now that it's harder to hit that perfect 2,000 sweet spot? It is difficult to hit that 2,000 sweet spot. I think what you're going to be doing for those extra like points is probably doing enhancements. Um, but yeah, it's it. I haven't actually had a trouble. Like five, ten points is not going to be game breaking. It's not going to change the game. The grenade launcher does one damage. Yeah. Nick. New tail rules are garbage. I'm sitting out 10. Why don't you try it first and then find out? <laughs> the worst thing you can do is sit it out. Because to be frank, <laughs> then they don't know what you think. Nor do they care at that point. Not only that, but like in a vacuum maybe. But hey, this is what people need to realize when they're looking at the armies. So I am a little sad that Tau don't play like I'm used to. I I, I will admit that. I I... I was used to playing uh, a high-risk, high-reward, mobile, uh, aggressive Tau force. Tau in 10th edition with the one detachment we have don't seem to be played that way. They seem to be played as more of a castle. So I can understand people not wanting to play that play style. However, to say Tau are garbage, I think is... I don't think that's that's accurate. I think the Tau have much play, but I think they're going to be harder to play. And I think you got to get used to how it plays differently. So, Yes. If you're Frank, you're not Tycho. That's true. <laughs> so that's, that's actually true. Hey, we're missing a light. I'm going to go turn that on. I just realized we're missing a light. Ba bum There. Tycho's will be a little brighter, and that corner of the board will be a bit brighter. Shiny. Yay! Uh, can I double check something, Nick? Yeah, what do you want to double check? I want to double check that your Storm Surge can't see my Venom Crawler. Uh, you got to go this way a little bit. Yep, no, I can't see it. I could move and see it. Yeah. I it wouldn't have to move much, to be clear. And I can still see your fireworks. Want to see these fire fireworks? But I might shoot the breachers. Yeah. Um, hmm, Overwatch. These guys are better at Overwatch. Yeah, as you did that movement, I'm going to spend one command point on Overwatch with these guys right here. So the breachers are going to Overwatch into your uh, into your guys here. As, as they move forward. As you they have move to forward. do it as they move Yeah, you they have to do it as they move forward. I hope you're, you're okay with that. I am totally fine okay. with you breaking sequence to make good things happen. 30 dice! Hitting on sixes. Oh, uh, boy. Four sixes. And then uh, your T5 or T4? I'm T5. Oh, I wounded you four times. Four times at minus one. And uh, the I, I forgot to fire the Kydra Fireblade at you last time. Okay. Kydra Fireblade also fires and hits once. And doesn't wound. But you're on an objective, which means I reroll wound rolls. Mm, I wound you. So that's four wounds, five wounds. Uh, four at minus one, one at minus nothing. 
Uh, they all count as minus nothing because I'm in cover for a lot of my guys. So. Oh, yeah, if you take them on the cover, guys. Um, that's going to give me a three up save. Will you do any more Middle Earth Bat Earth videos? I would love to do more. I actually had one scheduled to film last week. I had to cancel it because, unfortunately, we ran out of time with all the 10th edition content. I was going to do a Rohan versus East Wing game uh, versus a local guy named Jind. I'm excited to do it. I will try to do it when I get back from Calgary. Yeah. You killed the possessed, Nick. I killed the possessed. That's exactly what I wanted to see happen. So I feel good with that. That was a, that was a CP well spent. I agree. Um, yeah, it's really hard to critique a game that hasn't really come out yet. Uh, did we miss a super chat? Did another one come in? Nick has the answer. Nick has the answer. Did I have the answer? Can you scroll uh, up here. I'll scroll up. Our chat's over here, so I'm gonna go scroll up so I can see what we missed here. Oh, I just answered it. Yeah, Morgan Bale. How about the new power level system and not having customizable sizes? What about Death Guard Plague Marines? They're sold as seven models, but only be taken at five or ten. You could do seven, but it costs. I mean. I, there's an edition change, right? So the rules change, but the box sets were designed for a different edition, right? And, so, and to be frank, those seven models are exactly what's in the combat patrol. That's true. So yeah. that is something that you can think about because that's definitely going to be a way to play. I like combat patrol. Yeah. yeah. Michael Jackman, can you use this to help the guy who looks like Gandalf if there was a Gucci outlet in Bangor Forest? He's making the other... <laughs> oh, you were talking about Tycho. You are talking about Tycho. <laughs> Thank you, Michael. <laughs> oh, Tycho. Okay, so I introduced my boys to Harry Potter oh, last excellent. weekend. Excellent. Uh, so they watched the first Harry Potter movie. They're not quite old enough for the other ones. Right, I think right. the, the other ones are a little more they, dark. They definitely grew uh, up a little bit. But yeah. we watched the first one together. And um, the first thing that happened to me is we we saw Dumbledore come out, and he looks identical to you. <laughs> if your hair was white, you have the same nose, the same face, the same beard, and the same hair. So what I should do is get cast as you, young Dumbledore, you look like Dumbledore for a, a, a Harry Potter prequel. You just need white hair. <laughs> Does he not look like Dumbledore? The, like the first original Dumbledore, not the, the recast? Right, right, right. right. Yeah. <laughs> uh, I'm just sad Nick ignored my blue milk comment. What blue milk comment? It was confusing. Dr. Rhino. What did he say? Well, you, you fi fi fight it for me. And meanwhile, you could finish your movement. I think I th they're going to move. I think we're $40 away from the next shooting from the stuff that come in, by the way. Going to advance. I think we're I think we're getting closer. Yeah. Yeah. Do they need to move? I don't know. Nope. They're, oh, just gonna, they're just Dr. gonna hate. Rhino, I just I couldn't see it. I need Owen to tell me when it comes. We love you, Dr. Rhino. We're sorry, Mr. Tom. But blue milk is delicious. Have you had it? Yeah. Hey, yeah, yeah, yeah. Back yeah. back they used to have bubblegum milk. That's gross. I definitely and like on, the milk at the end yeah. of the Fruit Loops, which has definitely got a blue cast to it. Maybe it's more purple than blue, but Fruit Loops okay. definitely make Blue milk. Bluish milk. <laughs> they, see, they agree. They agree. It looks like Dumbledore. Doesn't it look like Dumbledore? Okay. The best wizard of okay. them all. So, so an aside, um, I lived in Ontario for about four years of my life growing up, and the the, uh, the local milk company hmm. had a promotional going on when I was like a kid, like a yeah. young kid, where they had a whole bunch of flavored milk. One of them was blue bubblegum flavored milk. They had banana milk and strawberry milk and a whole bunch of things. They didn't last very long, but I remember the bubblegum milk being very good. It was blue. So anyways, that back to the game. Your shooting face. Disgusting. So you put the cultists over here to this objective. These cults are still holding that objective. Yep. You you kept the whole, the, what are these, uh, obliterators? Yep. So they're just sit, sitting back there still. They're That's trying true. to hide from your storm surge. That's fair. That's fair. Uh, uh, and your venom crawler is still hiding, and you've moved up these guys. Your, your old discordant and your demon prince yes. is uh, coming up the field very scary like. Yes. I've done my overwatch. Shoot away. All right. Uh, Lord discordant doesn't like your stealth suits. So he's going to breathe fire all over them. Oh my, Dr. Rhino, since Tower Blue and also Cow People, because who's our Tower the... St sure, take <laughs> Blue Milk, why not? Let's do it. <laughs> bag, bag milk. You know what's the new thing? Beef milk. It's like soy milk, but comes from cows. Beef milk. See if anyone gets that reference. I like my lactose-free milk. <laughs> okay, so that's going to be a total of eight hits on your stealth suits there. Uh, they're minus one to hit. That's nice. Your torrent weapon. I am. Yeah. <laughs> this is not a big good stealthy guys light them on fire uh strength six to your toughness of less than that uh yep come on in shoot him uh i believe i dropped one for a total of seven wounds uh what's your toughness probably uh five. probably four four yeah so that's a total of seven wounds and minus one minus one okay so this guy's in cover but he's wholly within this terrain feature I think your whole unit has to be. It's uh, that's that's a crater. Crater counts for oh, that. Oh, per but model. But per model faces with with ruins. Okay. So uh, starting on him, it, is this two damage or one damage? Two. It's two damage each one. <laughs> Save it. 
Bale Save Flamer. it! Save it! Save it! Minus one? I gotta check if he has a three up. Because then it would have it back to a three up. Because it, it does ignore cover? Yes. Oh, you killed him. Wait, double check that he has, uh, if he has three wounds or two. Uh, they have two wounds. All right, you finally killed him. That was a lot of saves there. Uh, and you then our fourth. Got two more to make. Yeah, the four, fourth for the other guy. Save them both! That was an incredible amount of dice. Well, maybe I'll have Dicemanship, to I will say. It was like, I, like, I've been practicing my throwing arm. I'm just like, oh yeah, just like get that right spin on the dice. And... I watched a really scary uh, YouTube video that had a pit boss from Vegas yeah? talking about how people cheat at craps. Oh yeah? And showed off, he's like, call a number. And he takes a regular, unmodified Vegas dice like Vegas and rolls dice. it. Oh. It, there's ways with techniques that you can force roll. It's a lot harder when you have to bounce off a wall or off anything else, but it yeah. was it was eerie and uh, or when you have to take thirty dice. Yeah, you can't do it. Either. There's no way to. He had he could do it with one. You know one, I guess so. But keep in mind, I have no idea how to do that, and I wouldn't even bother. To try. It's like <laughs> I'd be shocked and amazed if Nick went for anything quite so silly. Okay, um, Nick, your thoughts on stealth suits as chaos spawns? I'm trying to save money as chaos spawn, like yeah. versus chaos spawn, or are you right. using stealth suits as chaos spawn spawn? I well, think stealth suits in a tower army, I think are going to be must. I think I would want to run like two or three. They're amazing spotter units. They're they're cheap too. They're not very expensive. I think the Demon Prince is going to try and finish off your last stealth suit. Okay. Daka daka daka. In a stealth suit. Yep. Minus one to hit. Uh, he hits twice. And straight five. On threes. Oh, oh look at that. What's the minus? Uh, minus one, I believe. Oh, he's dead. Is it, oh, unless it does two damage. It is two damage. Oh, then he's dead. Yep. Hi, ah, cell suits. Okay, all the cell suits are dead from over here. Yay! Killed stuff. Yeah. All yeah. right. That was do? a terrible shooting. Yeah. Uh, yeah. He yeah. advanced. So he actually cannot shoot. Oh, it shouldn't be turn one. It should be turn two. Uh, yes. to Owen? Well, I just realized I should remember when. Uh, to... Nick, with the punishment of split fire with guided units, will six man crisis suits be overcome? Like, there's a simple stratagem to let you split fire. It's not that hard. So, boom. Split oh, fire. I'm Done. sorry, Nick. I'm going to have to rewind just a little bit to the movement phase. Why is that? I want to spend that command point to allow my um, possessed to charge. Oh, yeah. You, you, Technically, it has you, to you, happen you, in the You had already said that. I know, but yeah. like, no. I just went, I was like, ooh, when do I That's have to enough. use but it? But you had already declared that. Yeah. You'd said that. Not a problem. Not a problem. Thank you. Besides, this is not a competitive stream. This is not a tournament. We are here for fun and rolling dice. If you want a good competitive stream where they play like by the book, Thank there are some God. great streams out there. In fact, I can recommend some. Yes. Tabletop Titans oh, is probably great. one of my favorite streamers. They're I think great. they have the streaming nailed down. They do. And uh, Liam Dembski from, uh, well, I think it's Liam Dembski, um, has a really great stream as well. Both of them great places to check out. Yep. But if you're here to have fun, hang out with us, and you love what we do and, and just want to hang out playing, play, rolling some dice, playing Warhammer, uh, you're, you're in the right place. Um, that said, if you're just joining us for the first time, I want to reiterate what our, the special thing is because you might have noticed that Super Chats fire the sniper. I believe we're like $30 away from a sniper, a sniper shot. We have this little sniper here. He is called Steve the Sniper because of the amount of ones he rolls. Um, and uh, it's a way for you guys to take part in the show as well as support the show. It's a way for you to support the show and take part. You, uh, if, you if, if we get to a full $50, to, for every $50 that comes in of Super Chat donations, so it doesn't, you don't have to donate $50. You can donate $5, $10, whatever, uh, $2, $1, uh, $0.50. Cents. Um, every time we get to $50, it fires, it does uh, mortal wounds to, to the target, and it's it's killed crest suits, it's killed bikers, it's killed lots of things. Dark Pact on my Venom Crawler. Oh, I'm going to risk it. Yes. I could just kill himself right here. Yeah. I don't know how this works in terms of whether or not I kill myself before I shoot. I probably do. Oh, I'd still shoot. Um, Whatever. Yeah. Oh, oh I fine? passed a dark back test. Well, what is the test? Is it a Battleshock test? Yeah. What is? Oh, it's oh. a leadership test. Okay, fair enough. And if I fail to take D3 wounds, the actual, the buff happens either way. Okay, fair enough. But when it's I pass... Just, you just get so overwhelmed with the dark fever that you <laughs> might like stab yourself a couple times? I think it's just the dark gods are taking their toll. Yeah, fair enough. <laughs> The dark gods giveth and the dark gods... Whoa, Victor Hendon! Whoa! Oh, the fish are falling behind. Here, shot the fish. Uh, shoot the fish. Why? Shoot Why the fish! Why do you want to shoot the fish? Shoot the fish. Shoot the fish. I mean, uh, there are no running. fish at the table, but those possessed do look fishy. Onto your breachers. Uh, 50, 50 and okay? That's about... $5? We're about 10 to 15 bucks. We're about $10 away from a, super, uh, from a, from a fire? I've got a currency converter. 
That's awesome. Owen is awesome. He's converting oh, the currency. You're so much better at this than I am, Owen. Um, so we're at we're so ten dollars away from the next sniper spot. shot. Woo! And you are toughness three on your breachers, so here come for twos. Dark Pact is a straight leadership test. People are hungry. I'm playing Salamanders against Custodians of Sunday. First ever 10th edition match. Just finished my army with friends. Any advice? Uh, experiment. At this time, throw anything at the wall. See what sticks. 11 wounds in your Pathfinders. Minus one, you are in combat. These guys or these guys? Uh, oh, sorry, the Breachers. The Breachers here? Okay. Uh, minus one to wound, though. Sorry, I, I, I didn't realize you were shooting at them. I apologize. They, uh, they have a Guardian drawing, which is minus one to wound them, which is fantastic. So eight. Eight, four, five, six, seven, eight. At minus? Minus one. Minus one? Uh, who's it from? So I have some guys in cover. I'm going to take those covers. Okay. It looks like about three of them. I just, you're in cover. Sure. All right. Uh, so that means on fours. Wow, I failed almost none of them. Uh, five guys are dead. Yay! Just like that. Bam, 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 bam. Whoa! Oh, wait, I got another shot. Two more shots. Oh, because of your... Yeah. Because yeah, you killed guys. Killed the units. Um, so that's f wow. Ah, can you just stop? Stop it! Tycho, just stop it! Stop it! Stop! Um, I played against Iron Hands over the weekend or oh, last yeah? weekend. How was that? The amount of fives and sixes that guy rolled for his feel no pains was just like I couldn't do anything. A little obscene. <laughs> you know what? Feel no pain can be a little rough. I remember playing against you with a model that had a four up feel no pain that really caught. Hey, we can actually talk about that now. Oh, we can Team too. Cards are fun. Ooh. Team oh. cards are so much fun. I'm scared of Gene Sealer cults. The aberrance of the Bominance is just like, I love the, I love the army. I want to play it more. He just pops back up and murders everything. Oh does like massive damage. It's, it's amazing. Anyways, keep going. All right. So uh, my next shot is going to be my obliterators. Yep. They are going to obliterate your Crutey boys. That they can do. Then there's three different units of Crute. There are two units of, uh, of Ouch Puppies and one unit of 10. So two fives and one 10. Sorry, two fours and one 10. Okay. They have stealth. So minus one hit. The whole thing has stealth? Uh, to be fair, let me look at the, the, the hounds. The Crute themselves have stealth. So the the Crute hounds have... They do have stealth. Everybody has stealth. Oh, they have a scout nine. I missed that. I could have made a free nine-inch move. Victor Hendon putting us over, I think. Why shoot the fish? They're delicious. So Victor... Okay, so Victor, I think you need to tell us, you're kind of waffling here back and forth. Who do you want to shoot? Tell us wh which model you want us to shoot. Uh, Victor has put us over the red. As soon as we are finished the shooting phase, the sniper is going to shoot. Please tell us who you want to shoot, Victor. I have no idea what he said. Why he's... shoot the fish? They are delicious. But he's also said, shoot the fish. And then he said, shoot the chaos. So I have no idea what you're saying. He's a brilliant man. He's brilliant. Tactical chaos. Okay, so I'm going to possibly shift my focus yeah. here and possibly go after your... Crisis Commander. All right, so you, yeah, you, I can't, you shoot can't shoot him because he has lone operative. Right. Um, and I think now that you, you've killed the bodyguards, I don't think the commander has lone operative. So yeah, feel free to fire at him. Okay. Um, yeah. So uh, he's a multi-wound guy. Does he, has, does he have the ability to shrug? Uh, no. No, he does not. Okay. No. He has a shield, so he has a four-up and vulnerable. Right. And he has a three-up save normally. And he has two shield drones, so he has a wound total of eight. Eight wounds. All right. Well, I will do my focused mouth. Prime aesthetic. Fish are friends. They are food. Does that mean you want to shoot them or not? That means we're prime aesthetic. It's, it's US dollars. Man, that's like hot $40 hey, billion, dollars, right? There's yeah. like three sniper shots or something. Uh, they um, are going to dark pack. So I, think oh, I think that probably puts us at $40. That means we're $10 away from another sniper shot. Did you just wound yourself? Yeah, yeah. Yes, yeah. you did. The dark pack goes off and the obliterators have wounded themselves as you shoot at the commander right here. Yes. So I get... 43, and our fives are auto. <laughs> two wounds. fins good, two fins bad. <laughs> <laughs> I have so much fun with this. One, two, Narrowly three, speaking, four, what five. is a Melta? Is it a laser or something? Uh, Melta is from. Okay, every video game we've played, a Melta is almost like a heat gun, like a superheated ray of heat um, that it just melts whatever's in front of it, which it's is why it's so short range. Base doo doo gun. It's a science gun. Yeah, it's, it's, it's a gun. <laughs> uh, hitting on threes. The sixes are auto wound, and these are some misses. And your toughness is which? Toughness is uh, five on the on the commander there. All right, I wound you on twos. All right, so it's a total of five wounds at minus three. Minus three, so four of a vulnerable save. I save three of them to go through. How much damage? Eight. Are you serious? Four piece. You kill them. <laughs> like two the man. Ah, uh, yeah. Bye. Shasso Kickasso's brother. Obliteration! He's, he's coming back with a vengeance. You just killed his brother. Ooh. His brother. Ooh. 
his brother. Now it's like a Quentin Tarantino movie. Yeah. <laughs> They're going to do a whole game on the, re the Revenge of Chasseau. The Revenge of Chasseau. All right, that was cool. Shot no, was it wasn't. They have not shot. <laughs> they have not shot. <laughs> okay, so. Victor Hendon, the towel, they must die. Free shoot at the towel. Victor. Victor. He just put us over again. <gasps> Victor. So that means there's two full shots. Two shots at the towel. And he wants both of them at the towel. All right, let's do it. The tower cows not fish. Thank you, John. Ghost keel. Is it? Oh, is this the? Oh yeah. We're both of the ghost keel. Yeah. Goodness. Total of three mortal wounds. Goodness. Come on. Okay. Didn't ghost they keel. Ring him before? Nope. Oh, right him. He's free. Ghost keel. I don't think has any feel no pain. So you have just damaged the ghost keel. Well done. The the chat has damaged the ghost kill. Go chat go. And that uh, that shucks. Uh, he has a total of twelve wounds, and you've he's done down to nine. three, so he's down to nine wounds remaining on this ghost kill. All right, so that is, that has been the worst. snipers. Uh, thank you, thank you, chat, for damaging the tau. I love how much you hate the tau. It's it just feel fuels my rage to kill right. everything non tau. Oh, he's turning, guys. He's turning. Chaos is he's rising turning. within him. Carl Cacasso. <laughs> Carl Cacasso. Scott, Scott says, oh, yes, the brother was named Carl Cacasso. All right. Uh, over here, I'm going to fire all the bolters into the... I guess the crude hounds are scarier. The crude hounds are scarier? How many, how many four, models? There's only four, four crude hounds. There's two units of crude. But they do a lot of attacks, don't they? Uh, they? I believe they get three attacks. They get plus one to wound if they're in range of the crude carnivores, which they are. You know what? I'll just shoot the crude carnivores. Okay. Crude carnivores, there's... So the, the upright guys. So they're minus one to hit. Okay. They have one wound each. They only have a six up save, so you're going to kill them pretty good, quickly. Uh, heading on fours. Okay, yeah, fours with minus one. Yeah, not too many. There you go. Not like five. Shabby. Five hits. Five hits. And wounding on threes. Threes. I, I don't know. Your T, what? Three, four, five? Strength one. Strength one. Yeah, so wounding on threes. Three. Three. Uh, any minus on that? No. On second guys. Fail the first two. Fail all three. You've killed three car crew carnivores of ten. I have seven remaining. One, two, three. It's a start. It's a start for sure. All right. And that is a shooting phase. Excellent. So it's time for my favorite phase. We're going to do this a bit favorite. better so you can actually tell favorite. what's in this group here. It was a ye olde pile. It was a ye olde <laughs> pile, that's for sure. So I'm just going to make this a little nicer. Um, and they're not if, on the objective, right? Uh, no, they weren't able to get the objective. The ghost kills on the objective. Yes. Yeah. Ah! Uh, so, charge phase. Declare your charges. Do your carnivores do extra special stuff on the charge? Uh, I don't believe so, no. Okay. Nor the hounds? Uh, no. No. All if right. I, if I manage to kill you, I get a 5 plus feel, no pain. That's handy. <laughs> Plyon, Tycho, Nick, others in the background. Was. Kyle Finley. Oh, hi, Kyle. Hi, Finley. Hey, Finley. How's it going? How's it going? <laughs> all right. Charging of a disco, Lord. Everything but the models. We're getting the data sheets. Go to Warhammer Community. You can find all the data sheets. So, uh, disco, Lord, into the Delphish? Yep. Yeah. Uh, same thing with the Prince. Prince and the Delphish. Yeah. Come on. Oh. Ooh, even on ones. And over here. Are you going to declare the Breachers? So, I can declare the Breachers, yep. and then they can... They can pop into the transport. And then I can declare a new charge. Yes. Yeah. Uh, ooh. Let me double check that. Uh, the I, I think that's likely you get to declare. In the charge. meantime, my chosen are going to charge the ghost key. All right. Um, okay. Combat embarkation charge for after the unit to declare a charge. Uh, your opponent can select new char new charger. Yep. Yep. To be frank, I think the select new target thing is going to be. Yep. Everywhere. Pretty ambiguous. Yeah. So you charge the ghost keel and none of these guys. That's right. Yeah. Alrighty. And then uh, you're going over here? I am going over here. Are you declaring the breachers as a target? Yeah. Okay. Then, I, yeah, I will use the stratagem. Those that are going to hop in there, hop in their devilfish. So combat defarcation. These breachers are going, ah, no one I get killed, and hopping back in the transport. And... That is one CP. Yep, got it right. Good. Okay. Do we have a sniper? Oh, Ooh, Prime Aesthetic! Prime Aesthetic! <laughs> oh my god. Panda Viking guy, 
don't have any models, want to get into 40K, do it. Also think about, especially if you're looking to test stuff, look into Tabletop Simulator. Because you can get a lot of the simulator. information you want about what models to buy. I personally tried it, I can't do it's it. It's hard. Especially as a, as a, as a tabletop like it. gamer, it's not tabletop gaming. It's yeah. a computer game. Yeah, I didn't like it. It is Richard not embrace the chaos. Another sniper shot. Oh, yeah. Return the chaos. More Return. Richard style. Ho, ho, ho. <laughs> Either you can roll it. Awesome. Brandon, thank you. Still loving the content. Awesome. Remember, for five months. Thank you so much. Um, so, okay, as soon as as soon as soon your charge phase is done, we're going to have two sniper shots. Both mine, aren't One of them random. What was the other one into? Fire Warriors. They just said it's uh, gifted to Tycho because they hit the models. Then Tycho then oh. gets to choose. All right. Uh, and charging your Fire Warriors. Okay, so from these guys? Yeah. Okay, so choosing now the Fire Warriors. Yeah. That looks like, what, like a five, maybe a six? Yeah, you're just over six. Oh no! It's a failure! And you can't command point reroll it! Well, I already spent a command point, so they could actually charge. And because I've spent so many command points because and I, nothing. Because I jumped to the transport, there's nothing for you to charge. I mean you do still hold the objective that way. That's kinda I nice. Do still hold the objective. That's kinda nice. It's a good thing it's for you. Thing. It's a thing. Yeah. Alright, well, that was a failure. <laughs> Alright. Uh so now it's the end of charge base? That looks to be everything I can charge. All right, well, we have two sniper shots. This, uh, If you're just joining us for the first time, this is part of the way we, we not only support the show, uh, support what we're doing, but it's also a way for you to engage and have fun with us. It's uh, every time we reach uh, $50 in donations, you don't have to donate 50, five, two, one, two cents. Oh, my oh, Brandon! Brandon. <laughs> Feel bad for Nick. He should get two shots of Tiger for just for Jennifer. Back and forth. Perfect timing. Oh, Perfect Brandon. Perfect timing, Brandon. Oh, oh, chaos will uh, get so you. So now we have four shots uh, that are going in. The first one was designated to Tiger to do whatever I he wants. two, with. actually. Ghost Keel. No, you get one, oh. and then one is a random roll. A random roll? Yes. Of what? It said, it said it, well, one, he said one, two, three is Tycho, four, six is Nick. Mm. So the first one, you get to choose wherever you want. Ghost Keel. Ghost Keel. It wounds, and it does. Two. Two mortal wounds. The ghost kills down, down, down to seven wounds. Uh, and then it's a random roll. All right. One, two, three is for you, and four, five, six is for me. Yeah. Uh, get another sniper shot. Where's the, the ghost kill? Come on. Bat. You really want to kill a ghost kill? One mortal. One mortal. Down to six wounds on the ghost kill. And, and now then you get two shots. I get two. Thank you so much. Um, who do I want to kill? Um, I think I actually want to kill these guys. <laughs> so these guys right here, these, uh, what are they called again? They are chosen. Chosen. Let's kill some chosen. First of all, anything but a one. That is it's gonna be D3 mortal wounds. Two mortal wounds on the chosen. Uh, that should kill a guy and put a guy in one wound. No. You had a, I they, took they, you, three wounds each. You took two wounds last time. Yeah, and that's that way he's down to one. Oh. So you did two worlds, so he yeah. dies and one on the next guy. Yeah, so that's exactly what I said. Oh. Uh, then the next one, it does wound and it takes two mortal wounds as well. Uh poor chosen. All right. I barely knew Thank you. Thank you, chat. I appreciate that. Snipe train is a chaos -y kind of day. I know it's fun. <laughs> it, it, it's kind of fun. Yeah, it's, it's, it, like, it, it doesn't impact the game that much, but it, it just adds a little more spice. Well, to it allows you guys to yeah. kind of pick how the flow goes. Yeah. Sometimes so we actually, sometimes we actually put a third, uh, score tracker absolutely. in there. Absolutely. And we actually just, like, give you points for killing guys. Like, so far, you guys would be up, like, I don't know, 15 points or something like that. Well, I don't know. Is there kills? Yeah. Who you, knows? They've killed two units. Have they? Yeah. Which ones? They killed. Uh, oh no, you killed those. Never mind. They killed one unit. Yeah. They damaged a lot of units. Yeah. Anyways, uh, charge phase over. Fight phase. Fightings. What All right. Fight? So the first fight I will do. You can't interrupt, so nope. it doesn't really matter. Uh, but let's start with those chosen because they look juicy. I want to see if I can pull down that ghost kill. Good thing I killed. That would be amazing. Uh, yes, I'm not minus one to be uh, hit in combat. Keep in mind, I can deny two. Two incoming damages and just deny it to make it disappear. All right. And our sheets for the ghost kill. Bring it on. What do you got? So I have one guy with paired accursed weapons. Okay. So that's going to give him yeah, yeah. five attacks. And he will start the festivities. Okay. Uh, so here he comes hitting you. Actually, I'm going to dark pact. Uh, I rolled a three, but luckily... I brought a Chaos Icon, that flag that's been allowing you to shoot the Storm Surge at him the whole time. So I get to re-roll that. Nick, oh, if you say Chaos is fun, he is turning. If you had to pick an army of Chaos, would you pick? Alpha Legion. 100% Alpha Legion. 100% Alpha Legion. So this means that I get sustained hits in hand-to-hand. -hand. 
uh, and and critical on five. Beautiful. It's beautiful. Yeah. Bring it on. Here comes the accursed weapon. One. So that is going to T eight. Hits. Um, strength of five. Strength of five. So on fives. Of fours. Oh, because oh, you're plus one. Of fives. Ones. You're fives. Yeah, fives. Yes. Uh, so nothing. There you go. No, nothing. See, this is actually one thing that makes vehicles really strong. Like, you think, like, normally, like, oh, I'm going to go in there. But, like, you're ruining most vehicles on fives and sixes. It's actually really tough to kill them. All right. So here's going to be where it happens. Power fist time. Oh, those are just, oh, I thought those was all attacks. Okay. So <laughs> I thought I survived here. But now yeah. the power fist. The, the champion and, the, and this big guy with an axe have power okay. fists. So here we go. Uh, again, same, same deal. Ooh, Nick, you're not going to like this at all. Oh, no, I'm not at all. Because those are sane, aren't so, they? Yeah, so I'm going to get two, two more hits than I actually Ooh. threw. Oh. Four sustained. And this is strength eight, so wounding you in force. Wounding you in force, because I'm T8, yep. Yeah. Oh! I didn't say that. I had to poop the bed there. You did. So that's two. Uh, minus? Big wounds at minus two. Minus two. I have a two up to a three to a four. Boom! I got one of them. How two much damage. damage? Two damage? Oh, yeah, I love it. Down to four wounds. <sighs> that was go not stellar from turn. the Chosen. Go yeah, go skill. Nick, Alpha cannot pose his towel. Your plan's ruined. Why couldn't they pose his towel? How can they not? There's auxiliaries. There's whole armies that are based just on human auxiliaries. They could totally pose his towel. I don't see the problem. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go next with our Disco Lord. This guy's going to make me happy. He's got a talisman Long of burning Nick blood. Farious, the chaos curious bad dice monger of Alpha Legion. <laughs> Yeah, I think I think that's, an important that's wonderful. Hype Dragon. I think an important thing of list building in this are in this edition is bringing units that can damage vehicles. It, 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 you, if you guys are veterans of games such as uh, Seventh Edition 40k uh, and older, you actually there was you, there was actually a chance of not damage damaging vehicles at all. Like you couldn't even roll six. Like so, if you didn't bring an anti tank weapon, you could actually get in a scenario where you had literally nothing that could damage a tank. I had that happen to me sometimes, where someone would target all my anti-tank weapons, and then they'd roll around with tanks, and me not be able to touch them. Dark Pact on my Cornish Disco Lord. Are you sure? Are you sure? I'm very uh, sure. Very good. So, this is right going to hilariously give me a D3 extra attacks to all three of my weapons, because I have two Whoa! extra attack weapons. That's also, great. a D3 to all the strengths of those weapons as well. Very nice. Did you roll that now, I'm guessing? I think I roll it in, at the time. It just says... That D3? so I think it's each one gets rolled separately. So I'm going to start that with my confusing. It is, I don't recommend just doing it once. I, uh, Up to you, whatever you want. Uh, uh, yeah. So the start with the in chain glaive. Uh, it, no, sorry. into the into the box doesn't count. If it's not in the box. Two extra. That is, a, that is a rule here at the studio. If it's not in the box, it doesn't count. Two extra attacks <laughs> and one extra strength. <laughs> Are we going to see some sisters on the channel for season five? I mean, we'd love to see sisters. To be honest, though, when we put sisters on the channel, you guys don't watch it. <laughs> This is one of the least performing armies on our channel in terms of views. <laughs> so, yes, we'd love to put some sisters. What we do need, though, is some people that play sisters to come play sisters on the channel. So that's one channel ch challenge we do not have. All right. So the five wounds automatically because of lethal hits and corn. Okay. And then I am strength of seven um, to your toughness. Uh, on which, sorry? Devilfish. Oh, the Delfish. Oh, toughness, uh, nine. Delfish is toughness, nine. Okay, I get plus one to wound because I have Lance. So Ooh, this is going nice. to be wounding on fours. Excellent. So Only one! Two wounds total. Wait, I thought that was three. That was from the, uh, from the auto wound because he's got oh, lethal. Okay, okay. Two this wounds? Two, two at wounds. minus what? Uh, this is at minus two. First one, fails. Second one, passes. Uh, that's two damage. Two damage. Uh, it's down to nine wounds. Bladed limbs get two extra, so it's going to be six. Nine wounds on the Delfish. Uh, oh, We're going to be Admech plays coming out soon. Uh, popular Admech player. We actually I recently met an Admech player at a local tournament. Um, we might test him out. See if he can see if he can play some Admech on the channel. We'll see. Two wounds at minus two again. Two more wounds at minus two. You get both through. Uh, two damage. Two damage, all right. So four damage Oh, total. sorry, I'm a liar. That was minus one. So minus one. I failed still both. Okay. So how much damage total? Uh, this is just two each. Two each. So four more damage. No. Uh, I have five wounds remaining. Now, here's the big one. Techno Virus Injector. Normally only has one attack, but I get extra D3. Yay! So that's going to be three attacks. Yay! Uh, hitting on threes. This is the big tail, kind of like spiking into it. So that's going to be one auto wound. Okay. Uh, and one hit. 
Not a root. Two wounds yeah. at minus three. Two wounds at minus three. Oh, actually, sorry, that's three wounds because I have. No, actually, no, no, no. Two wounds at minus three. Pardon me. <laughs> Both go through. Okay. How two much? Sorry, two damage total. Two damage each. Two yeah. damage each. So two wounds. Uh, so down to uh, one wound remaining on the Delphish. Oh. Yes. All right, Prince. It's up to you. I love it. I love when things have one wound. It's amazing. Uh, Prince, oh Prince. I would love to see more knights. They look spicy and They do look interesting. I think knights are kind of fun. They look cool. Yeah. If you live closer, you'd be the sister guy for the channel. You'd be the sister guy. Okay. All right. I am not going to. Um... It's bound to be part of Sweden. You gotta make me far apart. Yep. Uh, strength of eight, wounding you on threes. Strength of eight, wounding on threes. Two wounds at minus two. Uh, why are you wounding on threes? The prince. He's tough as nine. Uh, strength eight. I don't remember what I rolled. I don't remember. What you I'll start later. all over again. <laughs> Should be wounding on fives. Sorry about that. Okay. Uh, when it's a new addition. We're learning everything. You only got one wound left, eh? Yep. All right. So Which is why gonna... it matters. I want it not to go through. I want Fine. it to live. Fine. Then I'm going to sweep. Okay. Sweep it over. Sweep it over. 14 attacks. Oh, yeah. Sweep it over. <laughs> <laughs> Do we do on sixes then? What's the strength? Uh, of this sweep? is strength of six. Oh, yeah. You get still get five. Oh, yeah. You should do this. No problem. Yeah. Hopefully. 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 All right. And hitting you on twos. <laughs> on twos. All right. A few ones. A few ones. There you go. There you go. And hunting fives. Uh, that's another dice right here for you. All right, and on five to wound, three, four, four, any minus on that? No. Okay, so I have four, three ups to make. Math says maybe. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's so close! Oh, so it's very so close. close. Now, do I explode? Uh -oh. House rule says we, as house rule plan is on a live stream, you have to reroll the explosion result. If you fail, that's a failure. Do I explode? Oh. <laughs> 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 and it is D3 mortal wounds to everybody within six inches. So your demon prince takes three mortal wounds. He ignores your... our fives. You ignore... Of course he does. None of them. None of them. Your lord discordant takes two mortal wounds. Down to seven. And is my... Ooh. Oh, yes. Your guys over here in the range are all my... Yes, and my path... Or my firewars are as well. So these guys over here, what are they called? Possessed? What are they? Yep. They take three mortal wounds. Ignore on sixes. Takes two one. sixes. Look at the sixes. <laughs> oh, wait. Look at this. It's an explosion dog. Explosions. Explosions are fun. Those are great. <laughs> um, and lastly, my fireworks also have to take D3. And they take one. <laughs> I'm okay with that. Five. And Fireware. you've got a whole bunch of breachers. I do. I have How many um, five there? left. Because you. Oh, and a, and a firework. Or sorry, kind of fire blade. Okay. One, two, three, one, two, three, four, five. So five... Two ones. Five dice and I get two ones. So two more breachers are dead. Because it's one mortal wound each, but they only have one wound each. So that is three breachers and a fire blade left. You that didn't have roll to for your fire blade, did you? I did roll six dice. Okay. So they're gonna get out three inches away and they're gonna get out over here. Wow. Okay. And that is how many wounds does that guy have? Uh he has 13 wounds. 13. <laughs> that's probably three points for you, I'm guessing. Bring it down. Yes, that's going to be three points. Oh, man. I mean, that's exactly what he was there for. Delphish aren't there to do damage. They are there to soak up wounds, block line of fire. Like, I'm okay with him destroying the Delphish. That's way better than destroying my, like, Storm Surge or something like that. Now I Storm Surge can see your Demon Prince. Unless he has, does he have Wound Opera? No. Okay, then I'm going to destroy that. Really would like to kill that guy. Hmm. Hmm. I'm gonna have to move. I don't want to have to move. But you only have seven wounds left with your Lord Discordant. And you can't move through buildings. And you can't go through here. So you'd have to go around here. I can't. Oh, great. <laughs> so that's okay. So I can just basically use my fireworks as a shield. I can do this. All right. So is it my turn now? Uh... Oh, wait. I get to fight you back. Sure. The, the Ghost Heal gets to fight you back. And how many attacks does the Ghost Heal yet? Is he bracketed? I think he might be. Oh, 100%. He's bracketed. Uh, assuming he brackets. Ghost Keel. Uh, damage one to four wounds remaining. Yep, so he's subtracting one to his hit rolls. And his melee weapons, I get three attacks. Hitting on fives. Hit you twice. Strength six. Wound you twice. It does two damage each. 
It does two damage! Ghost kill fists! Punch! Did I kill one? Nope. Ow. Oh, I wanted to kill one. I wanted to kill one! You guys should do a Michael Bay style battle report where every single mini can explode. Okay, so I actually did, uh, so one time I hosted an apocalypse battle. Uh, at my house, I had TAC there and other, many other things. And I did a special rule for that entire game that everything exploded on a two up. And it was so cool. <laughs> there was So TAC was playing an Admech army and he had all, like he had probably like 20 vehicles and um, the Warlord Titan. And then one thing blew up, and it chain reacted, and it chain reacted, and it chain reacted, and it chain reacted. It took down the Warlord Titan uh, because, or not the, the Warhound Titan because of how many explosions happened. <laughs> Does Tao shoot in combat? The battle suits are vehicles. They can shoot in combat. They're great. But in general, no. Well, just vehicles can. Yes. So, well, all the battle suits can. So, yeah. Anyways, let's go. Um, did you score any points? Uh, yeah. I scored three points for killing your devil fish. Yes, you did. Uh, I think that's the only vehicle I took down. Um, uh, yes, that's the only vehicle you took down. Uh, no, you took down my... Oh, is he a vehicle? He's a vi All my battle suits are vehicles. Wild. Yep. How many wounds does he have? Uh, well, he had eight. eight. Yeah. 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 So, so he's that... worth two. So I got a total of five victory points for my secondary. And character. you got assassination because he's a character. Oh, that too. So I got another four? Yeah. Uh, sure. yeah. I'm not counting. I control nothing. What? Objective-wise. <laughs> Uh, yeah, we're tied on that one, I think, because your ghost skill's three. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Um, yeah. Okay, so we go to my turn here. Our stealth suit vehicles, stealth suits are not vehicles. They're infantry. Um, one command point each. One command point each. I'm going to one. You're going to one. My ethereal's still alive. Does he give me a command point? He does, so I've got two. And then, uh, uh, other command phase stuff. There is no other command phase stuff. In the battle shock phase, my ghost skill needs to see if he's battle shocked. He is battle shot. Super battle shot. Ooh, it means I'm not withdrawing from combat there. Ooh. So I mean, I have to stay in combat there. It means I have to count on him killing you over there. Uh, you got and a then, bunch of crew to help him out. That's true. The crew should be able to deal with it. <laughs> um, and then over here, my breachers have to test, and they are great. Right. Breachers are fine. No one else needs to take battle shock tests. And now I'm going to the move phase. The move phase. So he's gonna stay there. Um, ooh. Skaven Nurgle like, ooh. Actually, tough. there's a wonderful new Skaven army you really want to get. I know, 40k Skavens that, to get on the channel uh, that um, Dan Miner, one of our, our fantastic patrons from way back, who's been running the best tournaments on the planet for how long has been Dan running tournaments? 20 oh, years so or long. something? So long. Anyway, uh, he is a true hobby hero and has a Votan army that are actually all done as Skaven. It's amazing. So um, yeah, we can't wait to Owen, of course, two points. Owen, two points for um, for uh, holding my home objective here. Stealth gives you minus one on incoming hits from range attacks. Range attacks only, yes. It does not do close combat attacks like unlike unlike uh, Ninth, where my stealth suits could be minus one to hit in close combat, which was great. That was hilarious, because they just had a flat minus one. Um, so these guys are all gonna move up here and utterly Murderize you, but one of the unit of Murder out time. puppies Murder is going time. to actually go over here. Oh, claim quarters. To claim the quarter. Yeah. The crew or the hounds? The hounds. Remember, I have, <laughs> I have two crew that are hounds. <laughs> oh, right. <laughs> Can you use same colored crew? Yeah, that'd be fair. That'd be really fair. There you go. Oh, I was thinking of the brown ones, but cool. Oh, here, yeah. Patch them up. That's, that makes a lot of sense. There we go. Because I have four of the brown ones. Oh. There we go. I couldn't find two of the crew hounds this morning, see, see, unfortunately. See. But the crew hounds and the crew carnivores are gonna. Yeah, sometimes it feels like the Tau infiltrate every single corner of the building. <laughs> I have a lot of Tau here. I I, every every time tau. I try to bring home, then I'm like, oh, let's play a Tau game. I'm like, okay, fine, I'll bring everything back. I need to find everything. And so, all my models live here too. <laughs> yeah. Uh, all right, so the crew are gonna go over there to try to kill these guys because if they kill them, they have a uh, feel of pain. And then these guys are gonna go claim table quarters, although they need, need to advance because they need to be outside of three inches. So three inches, that'll get them there. Three? Yeah, so put them there. I need to kill the obliterators. I'm gonna have to move with these heavy weapons, unfortunately. How far do they go? Not far enough. Um, if I move here with the, uh, I can't, I can't damage those obliterators. I tried to hide them. I won't be able to get reach them. This sucks. It's not hard. This sucks, sir. It's no good. I'm gonna have to move with things. 
Um, these fire warriors are going to move over here because I need to... Uh, how do I... I need to get table quarters, so they're moving over here. You got Vespid, too. Yeah, I want all... all I'm greedy. I want all four table quarters. I'm way behind on points, buddy. You are. I'm way behind on points. I just don't want you to forget anything. That was all. Thank you. Appreciate it. I know I hate it when I forget something that was all part of my plan that could have swung things around. That's going to go way in that corner over there. Okay. Um, so they, they can't be seen. It's not the end of my turn, but I'm just... Going to, like, hide them in the... I want to be able to shoot those guys, because sure. they have an amazing gun. But I won't want anybody else to see them, if that's possible. That's easy. Well, what's the range on their gun? 18. Okay. They're, they're fantastic guns. You want to go in cover? I want to go in cover? Uh... Doesn't you get a little conga line using the corner cover against sure, put, them? Put one guy in cover, I guess. They, I they'd all be in cover if you did the conga line. All right, I hate to do it, but I'm going to move my. Uh, I'm going to move my. Uh, Stormy surge. Storm surge, so that I can see your lord discordant. Oh my! Um, oh, he's shooting out his butt. Yeah, so it means I'm minus one hit because I moved because all the weapons are heavy. It sucks. Uh, no, there's no minus. It's not minus. You don't get the plus. But that's that's going to be a detriment. Uh, more importantly, it puts me within 12, so you can't do that crazy, can't shoot me within 12 thing. That's only Nurgle marks. Oh, okay. So he's Do you have anybody coming. that are Nurgle marked anymore? That guy? I can't see him anyway, so. Uh, and both of my cultist units. Okay. So actually, if you stay outside of 12, I can Oh, put him immediate. in 12 then. Put him within 12 then. Um. Uh, the railguns do not have an optimal target right now. They do not have a good target to fight, shoot at. I often attempt to make difficult decisions for my opponent. You have made really good decisions. Okay, <laughs> one, one good thing about 40k, if you can make your opponent make decisions, that's one of the things you do, maybe they'll make the wrong one. Mental tax is yep. a huge part. Make them make as many decisions as you can, and maybe they'll make the wrong one. And give them, like, give them hard choices. equally bad options, and, like, that's when you're really winning the game of 40k. When you like, force, my only target them. for the railguns right here are these guys. That's, that's the target. And they might kill two. But they need, I, I need, like, men need dead. <laughs> like, all of them. You have one command point, so you can't heroically intervene. There's no way for me to get this objective. I will eat you if you come for that objective. I'm going to shoot you. Great. You know what? These guys are going to advance. Because if I go onto here, I can hold the objective. So let's stay one shot away. I, I'm going to kill you is what I'm going to try to do. So these breachers are going to advance. Five inches. So I'm going a total of six plus five is 11 inches, plus the three inches go up. So eight, nine, 10, 11, so eight inches. So I should be able to go right here and be three inches away. So it's, yeah, right there. So it's five inches up and three inches. There we go. So these guys. So one guy can get there, right? They do have a, uh, assault weapons. Yeah, two guys should be in range. They do have assault weapons. And they're OC2? They're OC2, yeah. So you gotta kill a bunch of guys to claim that objective, but yeah. yeah. And they have assault. They have assault weapons. They have assault weapons. Okay. So a few shots. Not a lot. Not a lot. And then now, these... one thing I've noticed is that by the rules, if you are on a height, yeah, you obscure everything below you because it's drawing line sight from your base too. So, like, yeah, essentially, and another way around too. As yeah, if you're up top, you are always in cover. Well, it depends on what you're being obscured by. Sure. But yeah. But like even like this lip. Yeah, you will often get covered. Yeah, up above. it's yeah. weird. But and yeah. uh, plunging fire from ruins. They have to be over five inches. Yeah. So these guys wouldn't get it, but yeah. still nice. Okay, so that's all my stuff down. Um, these guys, I guess, will just stay here and shoot those guys. I really would like to shoot those obliterators. I agree, Thomas. I really hope that they expand the auxiliaries for Tau. They've got so much cool stuff yeah, in the lore. Yeah, that'd be nice. New Vespin models would be great. Actually, they could do a whole other, yeah. like, Tau-adjacent <gasps> auxiliary army. There's so many that cool... Be... Like, like, there's human auxiliaries all over the Tau force. There's so much in the lore of it. I'd love to see be able to take some guard. Kuvesa. Yeah. Kuvesa? Kuvesa. I, I was a Kuvesa for a short period. You were. You did great. I, I, I you were my part, air cast. Yes, and I drove an orca into, into a single guardsman. A single guardsman. It was great. It, it won fantastic. the game. It did. It won the game because you killed like a single orca guardsman. Orca on the charge. <laughs> uh, okay. Let's uh, let's shoot. Let's and to be clear, I, did we miss any shooting? Shooting us? Uh, I, I, I don't think not. we missed any sniper shots. If you're just joining us, we have sniper uh, sniper shots that are done by Super Chat to allow you guys to not only support the channel, but also to participate in the game. It's a lot of fun. Uh, but I just want to make sure we didn't miss any. Damien, I really appreciate your translation of World Eater uh, vernacular. It really helps us understand the true core of... <laughs> anyway, sorry, Nick. 
Talk no to worries. you for the shooting phase. No worries. <laughs> All right, on the shooting phase, uh, marker lights, uh, sorry, guided units. I don't have anything with marker lights anymore. Well, that's, that's not true. Good. Both these guys have marker lights. Um, what? How? Well, oh. Because they can take two drones. Sorry, I don't have the actual drone. I, it should do that to make it match. All the all the fireware units have a guardian drone and a marker drone. Okay. It makes no sense to have anything else. Great. Uh, it means they're minus one to be wounded. Yep. And it means they're uh, it means they get to have the marker light keyword, all right. which ignores cover. Beastman's new 40k faction. That's pretty cool. Actually, uh, interestingly, take a quick look through the chaos data sheets. You might be uh, interesting interested in uh, something you find in there, Biggie B. Ooh, Men of Iron. That could be an amazing new army. That would be okay. an intense new army. Okay, so here's what's going to happen. Bucket. Here's what's going to happen. These breachers yeah. are going to guide the... Uh, the, the um... What is he called? So Ghost the breachers kill. can shoot anybody else even though they're guiding over that way? Yes. Yes, they Weird. can. They don't get the minus one. It's he that gets the minus one. Um, so you can guide someone who's in hand-to-hand -hand combat? It's, it's basically saying, hey, shoot there. I, I see a good target over there. He's got it on the radio. Um, so the breachers are going to guide the Ghost Keel. Odd. Into shooting the chosen. Chosen. So they get he gets plus one. So it'll negate the minus one that he's got right now. Uh, but then he's got another minus one, so it really doesn't make any difference. Oh, good point. Yeah. So he's still minus one. Regardless. So you know what? He's not gonna bother <laughs> anything. Oh, I'm gonna do this. <laughs> Ghost is just gonna fire at everything in range. Votan Ghost scale. Do need a little expansion. I would love to see them less space marine and more Botan, whatever that is. Uh, Ghost scale is gonna fire his ranged weapons. Down. Everything at the Chosen there. He's going to fire his Fusion Collider, which has two shots, into combat there. Um, Supposedly, all fireworks have a marker light without the drone? They, no, they don't. Okay. They only have a marker They only count as having a marker light with the drone. Yeah. Anyways. Um, what does the marker light keyword do? It gives you ignore covers. Ignore cover on a unit that's guided. I thought that that means they have a marker light already. No. You have to have a mar marker drone or have a marker light keyword. Supposedly they have a keyword. I'll check it. Regardless, um, that ghost keel is firing at your, your chosen there. Nice. Got two shots yeah. from the fusing collider, hitting on fives. Ooh. Doesn't hit either. Zing, zing. The Melthas hit on fives. Hits once. Okay. Wait, is this turn three? Is this turn three or turn two? Still turn two? Ah, oh, because otherwise I get sustained hits. Ooh. Um, that's strength. Strength twelve. So, four. so we're done twos. So one wound at minus four. Okay. Um, D6 it. plus two damage. There you go. Vaporized. Okay, got one. That's the ghost heal. Um, I mean, they could shoot all their shots into there. That don't know. Um, shotguns from these guys. All I see is hounds. Oh, these guys advanced. The, and they're hounds. The breachers mm -hmm. are going to guide these fireworks. Gotcha. So they're going to get plus one to hit. Gotcha. Um, they're going to shoot into the, uh, the chosen possessed, whatever these things, it's creepy things in the center. Possessed. All right. So there's three breachers. They're going to get three shots each. So nine shots hitting on threes by defaults. Uh, hits four, five, six times and wound you one, two, three times, but a reroll all failed wound rolls because you're on the objective. Yep. Three times. Minus one. Uh, we talked about this cover oddly. Uh, so threes. These guys are fully in the cover. So, like, these are, these are fully in the in the terrain. Okay. So, uh, if you take it on those guys, but you have to take it on those, you have to take it on that guy because he's taking damage. But part of, yeah. You have to take it on the guy that is taking damage, which is this guy who's out in the open. Uh, okay. So, I take one damage. Take one damage. Down to one. Okay. And then the fire warriors here are going to fire into there. So, they're going to hit on threes. They're rapid fire weapons. So, these I have 20 guys shots. Get covered. Oh, sorry. And the fire blade I got to do first. Uh, he hits you once. And he wounds you once. T5? Your T4? Oh, your T5. No, doesn't wound you. And then the Firewares. Let's double check that because this is a new addition. Five. Ten. Five. Ten. Twenty shots. Ah, I'm a liar. It's T6. Oh, okay. Well, <laughs> definitely didn't hit you. Uh, hitting you on threes because of marker lights. This will ignore your cover because of being guided from a unit that has a marker drone. So no cover. So you're T6? T6. Wow, on fives. Uh, three. <laughs> three, no minus, but no cover. You drop one and shake one down. Oh, that was a terrifyingly bad roll there. Um, 
Oh, I get to ignore on sixes. Actually, okay. I can ignore five of these on sixes. Kay. Hey, Banshee Zeno! I've made a Pathfinder kit bash out of Necromunda Eshin Clan for a human detachment for the Greater Moo. That's pretty cool, actually. Those look really good. I would like that very much. Um, yeah. Um, okay, so... Frontline Gaming. Um, Spartan Battle. Yes, there's a sponsor for the channel uh, for this episode. It's Frontline Gaming. Frontline Gaming. If you use the affiliate link in the below, it supports the channel, but also it lets you um, it lets you get some awesome stuff. Like this, all this terrain, the mat was from Frontline Gaming. Uh, they do pre-painted, pre-packaged. Uh, they have, even have a painting commission. If you want these colors, it's uh, Krylon, teal, and yeah. white and red with an airbrush. Uh, lots of taping. Oh, this paint job on yeah. this terrain uh, took... Um, about three times as long to tape off yeah. as it did to actually paint. <laughs> yes, and uh, Banshee Sinew with those, that 20 pound uh, donation, that actually puts us at, I think that roughly Ashen. turns at like $35 Ooh, yes. Canadian. For the great uh, Which puts us at really $10 away from the next sniper shot, which is really close. And he said for the greater move, so unless we have some contradiction there, I think that's a, that maybe a tower uh, shot there. Um, anyways, um, Shooting, still shooting. Did you, so you didn't save any of those? Or did I did, I saved two, so oh. there's another guy back with one wound. Get out of here. You know what? Take some railgun shots to the face. Okay. So this railgun is going to be spotted by... I have nothing else to spot for it. Everything okay. else is dead. Okay. You can spot with the... Um, the ghost kill's already fired. I can't do it. The the storm surge. Yeah, you can, you can spot. No, because then he can't be guided. Oh. So the, the our, these guys aren't going to be spotted by anybody. Fair enough. So these guys are just gonna fire in here. Hitting Four on. shots from the big railguns. Hitting on fours? Hitting on fours. Three hits. Sixes are devastating wounds. Strength 12. Ah. Uh, three wounds. Three wounds at minus four. Uh, okay, I have a five up in ball. You have five up in ball. Demon. You make one. Take one, take two. Uh, I believe it's D6 plus one damage. Oh. Ooh, can if I need oh, two have sixes one. for this yeah. guy to survive. So he dies, and then the other one, I just rolled a three. So three more damage. Okay. <laughs> Did you really just roll another six? I rolled one six. Get out of here! Let me double checking that it is D6 plus one. Range weapons, that's a breach team. Uh, broadside battle soon, range weapons is decent. One. Yeah, got it. When all the factions are, could you make a tournament with all the factions? That'd be fun. We could. It's, uh, tournaments are a massive undertaking. Yep. So actually, we are making a tournament with all the factions. It's happening in Alberta next week. Yeah, this is true. Yeah. Um, twin plasma rifles. Hitting on fours, hit them both. Strength of eight. So wounding on threes. I don't know why I just become British, but two wounds at minus three. Sorry, what's happening? Two wounds at minus three. By, by who? By the rest, rest of the shots. This is plasma shots. Oh, and onto my... Onto the same guys, yep. Fair enough. Um, two wounds minus three, saving on fives. Take one. Three damage. Three damage from a plasma gun? Yeah. It's always been three damage. Damn. Uh, okay. Saving on... Or ignoring on sixes. You vapor. This guy. Got one more. And then uh, then they're... I'm going to try to shoot their one-shot missile weapon, because why not? Hit them both. This is the Seeker Missile. It is strength 14, so two wounds at minus three. Take them both. Uh, so the first one is D6 plus one damage. So that's three damage. Come on, oh, no, D1-6 here. Oh. Kills one, D6 plus one damage. That's still four twos for every single D6 weapon. That's another three damage. Killed another one. Whittling them down, and then the missile pods from the drones. Now these will hit on fives guys really have a lot of firepower. They you do. have plasma and missiles and... They have rail guns, then plasma shots, and then they have a one-shot missile, and then the drones offer more missiles. But don't I got you, double ones. So you have to pick between some of these? Yeah. You get two secondary weapons. Wow. And one main weapon. So I chose the one-shot seeker missile and the twin plasma weapon and the rail gun, and then two drones that have missiles, plus two uh, shield drones to give them extra wounds. Clear what we've so far? There is mud. All right. <laughs> so uh, I didn't wound. I got double one to wound. Okay. So yeah. Um, so now we're gonna go with Storm Surge, who's gonna be guided by this unit of, of firewares, and they're gonna be guided against the Lord Discordant. Gotcha. So I'm gonna shoot the Storm Surge uh, at the Lord Discordant. I'm gonna spend one command point so he can fire at something else and not uh, have to have the minus one. Okay. 
So I don't remember what the stratagem is. I'll look it up really quickly so we get the name of it. Because you guys are learning along with us. I'm sure you'd like to learn how to do do this as well along with us here. So stratagems for Cayune. It is, I believe it's coordinate to engage. Uh, oh, sorry. No, it's the observer unit that gets it. I'm sure. Point blank ambush. Um, oh, let's just improve. Oh, man. I guess I, I, I stroke, chose the wrong one. Oh, well. Uh, so I don't get that. So if I try out anything else, minus one hit. Biggie, you can have as many characters as you like. You can't have more than three of a single data sheet. You also can't have more than one of a particular um, heroic hero. What's called? Uh, uh, heroic, uh, yeah, epic hero. Named guy. You can so, have you can have multiple epic heroes. You just right. can't have one, one, more of the same one. So you can have Harkon and Abaddon, but you can't have three Abaddons. Yeah. Uh, but you can have Harkon, Abaddon, three Chaos Lords, three Chaos Lords on Discordance, and three Terminator Lords. I believe it's six of Battle Line. You can have six, yeah. You can have, if you yeah. if you battle line, you can have up to six. Yeah. Okay, so we're firing here. But I don't think there's any battle line characters. At least I haven't yeah. heard of one yet. Uh, I still am going to go down to one command point though, because that uh, that coordinated engagement thing, coordinate to engage uh, allows these these fire warriors to get plus one hit. So even though they're observer, they get plus one to hit the target too. But this guy doesn't get to split fire. Well, he, he can split fire. I just minus one hit anything else. Right. So I'm going to fire the two big giant guns, his mm -hmm. giant missile and his gi big giant gun on top at the Lord Discordant. Gotcha. I'm going to fire all of his missiles, his uh, cluster and the seeker missiles and all the rest of the stuff at these guys right here. Gotcha. Okay. With me so far? We're good? Uh, yep. Yep. Okay. Good. Bring it. Grand. Big giant missile. The destroyer missile at the Lord Discordant is going to do it right here. It's going to be all I need. I cower in cover. You better cower in fear because <laughs> this thing's coming. The storm surge is coming with his destroyer missile that hit on a three. Kind of like I couldn't find any data sheets online. <laughs> you know what I rolled? What? You're the one. I yeah. love the one. Yeah. I don't like the one. Fine. <laughs> uh, then I'm going to focus his pulse blast cannon because it does 12 damage then. Uh, look up Warcom data sheets. I hit once. Kind of like, I only hit once. Tiger, I only what? hit once. Oh my god. It's strength 24. That's nice. It wounded at minus six. <laughs> I have a five up in vault. You better not roll this. I went risky getting the high strength weapon. It does 12 damage. Don't get the five up. Don't get the five I up. I really need this five. Don't get the five I up. Really Don't get the five up. Don't get the five up. Take 12 damage. Well, I can't do that. Uh, do I explode? <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, regardless, I'm going to roll it anyways. Do I explode? Where'd he go? I lost my hernias. He does not explode. Oh, and I forgot to use it because... Oh, and I forgot to use Spirit Thief. What does Spirit Thief do? Oh, this is huge. What does Spirit Thief do? In your phase, are you within 12 of me? I don't know what's going on. You're doing things. Start of my enemy's shooting phase. I want enemy vehicle within 12. Yeah. Invisible. Yeah. Is that, that's your big yeah. guy? All right. So uh, I'm going to force you to take a leadership test. Okay. And what has happened to do? If you pass, you get minus one to hit. I'm already at minus one to hit. If you fail, not eligible to shoot, period. What? Can I, can I, and I can't use the same bravery on that. This is a little bit, this is a little bit cheeky to be springing this to me after sorry, I killed I, you. I, that, it's like, this oh yes, happen. I suddenly <laughs> have a thing that makes you Once not hit. Turn. I pass. He's fine. All right, I'm dead. Die! Do you explode? No. Oh, can't explode? Okay. Fine. Get out of here. Um, and then the cluster rocket system into <laughs> these guys over here. Oh yes, I suddenly cannot make you shoot after you kill me! 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. I'm going to save my possessed, too. <laughs> oh, the possessed are fine. Possessed are fine. Uh, 10, 14. So 14 hitting on fives now because of the uh, because of the shooting at a uh, not at my spotted unit. Oh, that's a lot of fives. Woo! -hoo! And then this is strength five on your possessive six, so on fives again. Loving it. Uh, one, two, three, four, five at no minus one damage. Oh, one gets through and he can ignore the six. Okay. All right, one more damage there. And then the uh, smart missiles that ignore your cover, hitting you once and winning you nothing. So that's the Storm Surge. Storm is really good for killing one thing. It's a really hardcore sniper. Damage 12 is... I only get two shots if it does that, but it's really cool. <laughs> Strike 24. <laughs> uh, I, like, to be honest, this would be a way better target for all, all its other guns. It would just like, right. pick up the floor with them. If I could, could have got line of sight on them, I would have tried to kill them. 
I would have popped a command stratagem so that made it you couldn't shoot at him. So these guys right here, unfortunately, I wasted a command point there, but at least guaranteed. But I am in range of shooting those guys with half of them? Maybe. Right. So it looks like six of them. So I'm going to shoot into there with six of them. Four, five, six. Fireworks. No rapid fire. They don't get my. They don't... No, they don't get any minus. Okay. So just hitting on fours. And that is three wounds, three hits, and two wounds on the cultus. Two wounds. I have a save of six up. I'm in cover, so five up. Uh, sure, take it on that guy. It's five up. Yep. It's no minus. Sorry, how many? It was three? Just one. Uh, just, just one. Just, sorry, two. Two. Two? I thought it was three. Might have been three. I don't remember. Three. You can say whatever you want. <laughs> save one. Okay. Take two. <laughs> and then those... A little those, teamwork and we'll make it, folks. Those best fit back there into those cultists at the back holding gotcha. the objective. No cover here. Yes. So Vespid in this game are so good. I wish you could take them in big units again. Um, but basically, they they hit on fours, but their weapon is is high strength, so strength six. Uh, it does minus three, two damage. Wow. So this is not the optimal target for it, but it's kind of fun. Uh, only hitting on fours, though. And uh, wound you twice. I got three ones in that. Wound wow. you twice. Um, no save. No save? Minus three. Or no minus. Sorry? No minus or no save? Oh, minus three. Good yeah. lord. Sorry, two down. Two damage. Yeah, no. that's better. Fun! Cultists only have one wound each. Sorry, minus two. Sorry, it's minus two. It doesn't matter. That's only strength five, but it still did the same thing. <laughs> strength five, <laughs> minus two, two damage, but it still did the exact same thing. Uh, the result was no different. <laughs> okay. But it could have been better. It's amazing how often you make mistakes in Warhammer, and if you go back and like redo it, it comes out to the exact same thing anyway. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> um, okay, so that's finally all my shooting. Ooh. Combat phase. Combat phase. Um, I take the first on going. No, you get to charge first. You get to charge. So these crew are going to charge you. Okay. The crew carnivores are going to charge you. Over here. Two inches. They make it. They make they might, it. They might stuff the, the hounds. The problem though. with this is that the hounds, they're going to have to go all the way around to help. Yeah. And it means that I won't be able to get very many of these uh, crew carnivores in. Yeah. So Because you can't go on that objective. So currently, three are fighting you. I was really hoping the entire unit could get around and fight you. Yeah, and go over the objective, yeah. but no. Nope. But because of two, I can't land on the objective, which means, I mean, I could probably pop one through. I could yeah. three, so I should be able to do two more on it on you, but that's it. Uh, this guy would end up on the objective, which is no-no. I, I guess, no, I could, I could do this here, and then I could do this here, and then that guy there. Ooh. So I get maybe four more. That's it. That's, okay, the crew carnivores, the crew hounds want Going to charge you. All the way around the ghost they need to go. Who knows? We'll find out. They need to go around. That's not enough. Five. No oh, no, they fail. There's no room. That's really disappointing. Aww, and I can't even roll. Sorry. Can't even roll. You love that Voxcaster thing. <laughs> Vox interference is what it is. All right. Well. Vox static. Vox static. I don't even use Vox. Like, <laughs> Reroll. And they're like, I don't care. Carnivores don't use Vox. Yeah, sure they do. Okay, it's just loud hailers. I don't know. What is it? How do you talk to your crew? They go. You just go your mind control. You see uh, Lord of the Rings with Gandalf uh, whistles for shadow packs? It's like that. <laughs> <laughs> can't even do it my lips are not moist nice. um okay okay oh, oh, oh. I, oh, okay, you know like okay. these don't take that long but there's something about live streams not only are they a ton of fun but they do take a lot of energy they do, they do. after a live stream i am wiped i am wiped out more after a two hour live stream than i'm at than a six, six hour, hour shoot. shoot yeah i don't know what it is nope. well it's because like you're kind of like on the entire you time are, yeah you're no nose picking people. there's no there's no breaks there's no yeah um okay so that was abysmal. I was really counting on this crew to come in and kill you, but I don't know if I'm going to be able to. So, uh, fighting. Let's fight with the crews. So pile through. This guy can get Yeah, he should be here. And I should get another one there. Actually, I was going to do this guy to oh, here, right, right, which right. would allow me to put that guy in there. Sure. So that, that, that's still there. But basically, this guy to here. And, and then, this guy can touch him. And then I can go like this to get a few extra. So you have a total of six, it looks like. Yeah. Okay. Only two failed. Yeah, that's, that's better. But still, that sucks. One, two, three, four, five, six. Um, one, two, three, four, five, six. So they get two attacks each. Hurrah! With the crew. What did the crew hit on? What did the crew hit on? They hit on fours, I believe. Crew carnivores. They hit you on threes. Ooh. Hey, good job, crudies. Little crudies. And they have a strength four weapon, and your T. Uh, four. Four? So on fours. I hit, wounded you five times. Wow. Five times. No minus. One damage each. I'm good. Yep. 
All right, find me back. Ongoing, your turn. All righty. Well, I think there's only one fight. Yep. So, um, the dual ch dual weapon will fight your crudies, and the power fist will fight your ghost keel. Fair enough. With and I'm Give going to dock pack. Nick, you need to hand in your geek card right now? Oh, yeah. Who whistles? Who are you talking about? Huh? Gandalf. Who did I say? I don't know. Gandalf whistling for Shadowfax? What? Who whistles? I think you guys need to watch your uh, Lord of the Rings a little more closely. I think I said that pretty appropriately. Okay, so, Go, uh, Nick, for the greater good. Sustaining you, on fives. Because I dark else. packed him. So you're, this is against the crew? Yes, and yeah. I'm sustaining on fives because I dark packed him. Good for it. Good for you. So, lucky for me, I think. Do I hit on twos? Did you take a Bowser test? Uh, I will, but I don't take it until my turn. No, for the dark pacting. Yeah, it did. Oh, okay. Not a battle shot test. It's a leadership Corn, test. corn, blood for the blood god. Corn, 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 corn. How many times are you going to say corn? Corn. How many flakes do you Ooh. need? Okay, sorry. Chosen, do hit on threes. So do hit on threes. All right. Three, but I get two sustained. Uh, yeah. That's a tough game here, Tycho. There's a bit a lot dead. Uh, that's going to be four wounds on your recruits at minus one, two. Four wounds on my crew. Minus, uh, just going through. They don't have any save. Uh, one, two, three, four. But I did take the objective away from you. Uh, yes, quite. Quite. Um, trying to kill the ghost keel? Trying to kill a ghost keel. Let's see if you can do it. Uh, three attacks, four attacks from my power fist. What's the most defensive close combat army? Defensive close combat army? Sorry, defensive close combat army? Uh, okay, well, I, I'd probably go with Iron Hands or something. If you think about close combat army, you can build nearly any army outside of Tau yeah. for close combat. Um, that's six hits from four dice. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. <laughs> the ghost kill might be going down. Uh, All right. Uh, wounding on fours, I believe. T8. Fives. So, yeah. Uh, yeah. Fours, fours. Sorry. Oh, uh, wait, wait. Double check. Because last time we did this and... and I'm strength eight. Wrong. Your toughness. Bra ghost kill... This, he can't remember. Ghost Keel is T8. Of course. That's going to be three at minus two. Three, two, two to three to four. So three four ups. And how much damage does it do? Two piece. Two piece. So I need to pass two of these. I got him. Does the Ghost Keel explode? Ooh. On a six. For the greater god. It does not explode. However, ah, thank you. <laughs> I like chaos, but it's not world leaders without suns. Take your shot, Nick. Seems like you need it. That actually does push us over, doesn't it? I think it does. Oh, nice, yes. Nice. Thank you, Ambrosia. I need that. Oh, um, boy. Uh, but, uh, but we, so it failed explosion. However, if you're a veteran of these live streams, you know that explosions have to be re-rolled if they fail. This is called the Nick house rule? Yes. Because he just oh, rolls dice until things explode. Pretty much often. <laughs> uh, it doesn't, it doesn't explode. <laughs> but the ghost kill goes down. I punched him in the face. You know what I haven't used yet? What? Oh. I forgot to use his drones. I haven't used his drones yet. So I you're down to two I and two boom, attacks. So you have two wounds left. I can't. I cancel out the two attacks in the game. But you took three. You took six yeah. damage, but you take away four of it. Yeah. You're left with two remaining. Thank you for thank you for letting me do that. No okay, worries. so I have two wounds remaining on the ghost kills. Ghost is still alive. We are playing by intent, folks. I and what that means is you're trying to let your opponent use all of their rules because this is such a new addition. People are gonna forget stuff. <laughs> no. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, yeah. Breakdown. No, he hasn't used it. Uh, so three attacks from the ghost kill back into you. I hit you once. Okay. And. I do not want you on a one. All right. Um, so the hey. tussle continues, but that is stripped from me. Does that give you? It does. Points? It gives me. Um, it gives me. What should I call it? Uh, gives me joy and appreciation. I have four points from engagement fronts because I have all four quarters here, 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 and all these guys. Um, and then I have, I believe it's four points from the other secondary uh, overwhelming force, or is it capturing both posts? Secure. What is it? There's a, there's a rule that I get for points. Just believe me. <laughs> it happens. It's called the Nick gets four points rule. I can't find rule. the card. <laughs> but, but just believe me, it's four points. Oh, yes, of course. <laughs> it's not overwhelming force. It's, it's not. It's I'm a so rule. glad you joined us, Hyper Dragon. Uh, Hyper Dragon. Uh, I'm really glad you're in I got it. to take a picture of it, but Owen, Owen failed in his duty. He couldn't Owen. find the picture. I'm blaming Owen. This, this is the first failure of an Owen. It's some sort of variation of overwhelming force or, or something or other like that. It's basically take enemy, uh, take objectives away from the enemy. 
Oh, start. Storm Hostile. Yes, that's the one. Okay. It's Storm Hostile Objective. So what is it? How many points? Is it three or four? It's four. It's four. Okay, so four. That's four. So that's four and four. So I get a score total of eight points, still making me losing the game. Four and four? Yeah. Four, four for engagement fronts. Oh, right. Because I have all four quarters. Right. And one. four for... Is that, are they are they claiming this quarter? Yes. They're up too near the middle? Okay. Yep, yeah, the middle's right here. Uh, they can't be within, what, three inches of the middle yeah, or something? Yeah, that's it, yeah. yeah. And I move six out from the side. And this, these guys are far enough? They're far way? in that yeah. way. And, and crew. That doesn't make me win the game, though. <laughs> I'm still losing there, Teko. <laughs> Justin, uh, bad experience. Oh, no. Beating other players over the head with rules. That sucks. Oh. Maybe you not want to play. That's fair. You know what? It, it, yeah. it is a big problem. Secure in... hostile objectives. We yeah. both got shoutouts on our first stream. Hype Dragon. Of course you get a shout-out. Yeah. I'll give anybody a shout-out. Who wants a shout-out? Who wants a shout-out? I, I, uh, everyone gets a shout-out. <laughs> everyone gets a shout-out. You get it. Panda Viking guy. Panda you know Viking guy. Those, those goats make me happy. Yeah. My, my wife calls me her goat. <laughs> All uh, right. But I, I, I wanted to... <laughs> To address Justin's uh, issue there. And you know what? It is a big issue with people getting a little overbearing, rules lawyerly. Uh, or and gatekeeping. Gatekeeping, yeah. yeah. And that's, that's, that's really rough. And I think yeah. one of the best ways to handle it is to basically essentially consider that person uh, needing of a win more than you. <laughs> uh, it can be really difficult sometimes to just let yeah. somebody cheat or otherwise make the game less interesting for you. But oftentimes it's not worth the hassle and you should find somebody else to play with. Glad you're having fun with it. Uh, I'm not having fun. And actually, have that's that discussion with your opponent. That's something you should express. You're like, yeah. man, the way this game is going, I'm not really enjoying myself anymore. Can we find a way for that to? Yeah. yeah. And yeah. most reasonable people will allow you to do it. And yeah. if they're not reasonable or not willing to talk to you about it, it might be time to find another opponent. Yeah. And in a tournament situation, like it, it's even yeah. with the like the, <gasps> the big. Wait. wait. Uh oh. We have a sniper shot to go. Oh. Whose is it? Well, it, it said for me. Oh, of course it did. What well, they I did? Be I believe it. it. Did. <laughs> okay, mister, but I, you don't get to shoot I me. said, of course, you know? I believe you, Nick. Yeah, right. <laughs> I'm allowed to have a little sarcasm behind it. It's allowed, it's allowed. Of course you do. He's going to shoot into, he's going to shoot into these guys. Oh, no. To those guys right there. The uh, possessed Not chosen my, my person. Chosen. It wounds, my... and it does oh. three more oh. Take it. Weep it. And then it's Tycho's turn. It is now finally turn three, Owen. It only took us what? How many? What time is it? It's like, it's <laughs> it's like really taking us two and a half hours to get third three. Because <laughs> we're having too much fun with you guys. We are having a huge amount of fun. Amount of fun. And thank you so much for watching. This yeah. is going to keep I hope fun. you're having fun too. And yeah. I hope it is a boring Absolutely. stream. We, we, we're, we're trying hard to make it entertaining. Make we it really fun. Are. Make it, make yeah. it a joy to have come watch with us. Yeah. Um, so we do go to Tycho's turn. And yeah. Tycho, you do control your home objective for two I points. I do. Um, I they can't one. fail Battleshock. Nope. You do not hold this one. Yeah, sure I do. Why? Because I have OC like one, two, three, four, five, six on it. Did you want to take a Battleshock test? Not yet. There's like a bunch of guys. There's six guys there. Started at eleven. That. It's fine. It's <laughs> fine. You get one, two, plus I ten. I got ten, twelve points. Oh my goodness! I'm never gonna catch up to him. Twelve points for Tycho, please. Twelve points. Twelve for points for Tycho there. Twelve points for me. Yeah. Okay. And then do your move face. Do my move thing. Oh, look, there's more snipers. There's three more sniper shots. No, close your eyes. There's three more sniper shots for me. Oh, no. Uh, they're all going in. No. <laughs> Do your move, guys. Up to see oh, yeah. each of us. Yes. So two. I'm at two myself. Oh, wow. All right. Vespid, I don't like you anymore. See, like, the state of the game is yes, you're up on points, but, like, my army is doing well. Like, I'm actually holding on pretty good. And that storm surge is essentially storm untouched. Surge being pretty good. I don't have really an answer for the storm. Adam! 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 Oh, come on, <laughs> Adam. He barely survived. You want to kill him? Thanks, uh, Adam. Got him. Let's see. Don't get a one. I need a three. So it's a D3 mortal wounds on the ghost keel from the sniper right here. Oh, look at that, Adam. Adam. Oh, yes. Oh, but, yes. But just for that, he has to explode on 3D6. All right. <laughs> Which means we get to do this. Okay. One, two, three. Explosion! Wow, it was like nicely timed. It too. was. We it actually like good. came together yeah. in a cool way. Yeah. Okay. Woo, I went to a car accident and came back and only on turn three. <laughs> Sorry, Matt. <laughs> well, Matt, thank you for your service. I hope the car accident was uh, uh, not too terrible. Uh, 
That's oh, right, a really rough job that you do yeah, as a first Spartan, responder, yeah, having first been there. Thank you. Cool. Um, Matt has the coolest jobs. Like, to be honest, and his, his history of jobs is pretty darn cool. Yeah. Is it gambit time yet? Technically, it is gambit time. Um, no, it's not gambit time to the end of turn three. Oh, um, I went so the wrong way with you. This guys. means that the ghost kill explodes for... Uh, what is it? Damage. Uh, where is it? Abilities. Deadly Device. D3! So your, your one guy takes... So you have a chosen there. He takes one more lord. <laughs> My crew take two mortal wounds and die two and my ouch puppies take one mortal wound so my ouch puppies have taken one and i'll place this guy over here to make it easier to remember who it is and two of these guys are dead and go skill go down skill da go skill down uh take a battle shock test for this guy about over here oh yeah this right here take a battle shock test oh it's oh, a failure oh, oh, is it Oh, oh just for the dark tax ability. Yeah, get You've got here. an icon, but... Yeah. So you have to... If you fall back, you could kill yourself, but you might probably want to stay in combat enemies. Since the ghost kill's gone? I don't know. Let's see. I don't have a token for battle shock. We need battle shock tokens! All right. But we don't need battle shock. We probably will not... Oh, this, is what you, this is a video that'll be up forever. You can go watch it after. You just go to the live tab on the channel and you can watch all of our live videos. Uh, except for the exclusive ones, of course. Uh, we're not planning on editing it this, because how we shoot this is a lot different than how we shoot an edited game. An edited game takes six hours and has a gimbal and a script writer and graphics and all that kind of stuff. It's really tough to do that. So Yeah, you're looking at a lot of hours in post. Yeah, so... it's, it's not possible to change these into an edited video. Yeah, and that's a lot of skilled hours. It was, it's not just minimum wage, 80 hours in post. It's uh, Nick is an incredibly skilled editor well, but cool. uh you can't edit it at all can you you know that's why we have <laughs> several editors okay okay so that's that the new flyer transport rule for 10 that's interesting flyer transports have used the uh the the incoming um the stratagem to bring them in on turn two in your opponent's movement you can actually use them in turn two which is hmm, a possibility that's handy I will say that the one problem I have with 4K is that the kits are just far too expensive, especially when they're all injection molded plastic. GW needs to cut the price so more people can play. <laughs> I'll agree. I, I mean, you can have different opinions on the price, uh, whether it's fair or not, but to be honest, like, there's a lot of used models out there if you want to go cheap. Not, not to mention, you don't have to use Games Workshop models. The only tournaments I've ever heard of that care what, where your models come from are the actual GW sanctioned, and a lot of models squirt through anyway. But yeah, uh, find what like, makes fun for you. Yeah. Like, they're, they're, I bet you in your local area there are veterans that have too many miniatures that'd be willing to part with some for a very small fee, if not for free. I've definitely given away my fair share of bottles because I was like, I'm never going to paint this. <laughs> Nick is pretty unique, too. I wouldn't expect free bottles from anybody. But, uh... but if you go to eBay or if you go to your local Craigslist or Facebook Marketplace or equivalent of your local area, I will not be surprised to see people selling miniatures for a fraction of the price you'd buy in GW, especially if you're okay with it being paint, that, already painted by someone else. And that's with GW miniatures. Yeah. And you can find other miniatures for a lot less than that. I, I invested in a whole bunch of uh, guard models that were, I think, from uh, Victoria miniatures. Those aren't cheap, though. Victoria oh, miniatures are about the Victoria. same price as GW miniatures. Was, they're expensive. These were World War II uh, Russian soldiers. Victoria does great. No, this was, uh, wasn't was in Victoria. It was... Anyway. But Victoria, okay. I've looked at Victoria miniatures. They're not cheap. Okay. They're great, but they're not cheap. Fine. Yeah. Death to the space fish? Why? Death to the Why space Logan? fish. Yeah. Ooh, I have a great. demon prince. I almost forgot about you. Yeah, I wasn't able to shoot him. Oh, you hit him very well. Prince. This building is annoying. Can I just blow it up? I love that building. Like, so all about that building. <laughs> Difficult decisions, Nick. Yeah. But I kind of want to take away your ability to score that secondary. So Fair this enough. demon prince can fly around at 14. Yep. I think he's going to go take on that squad. Okay, come on do in. Do you mind flying up him to danger close? All right, as soon as you do that, I'm going to overwatch you with this Storm oh. Surge. I guess I could charge to where... I guess you could... No, you couldn't shoot him if I charged to somewhere you couldn't see him. But I guess I've already moved uh, to be, uh, Yeah. Uh, I don't know. It'd be really hard for you to put him in place if I couldn't see you. I guess I get cover, but... technically I can shoot through this window. All right. Uh, you don't get covered sure. here. Right? I'm sure. sure. Any Fine. part you of the cover. Obscured. You can have cover against a minus six weapon. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> so my big giant cannon is gonna do. I'm gonna be stupid and do the the two shot weapon that does 20, 20, strike twenty four. 
Because I should do the six shot weapon, but I don't want to because I want one six on a. Give me a six! No! Uh, but it does have the destroyer missile, which fails. This puts you down to one command point? Left. One command point. Yeah, one command point for me for Overwatch. And then 46 shots from the cluster rocket system. Five, six, seven, nine, 10, 11, 12. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12 from the cluster, cluster rocket system. Uh, the... Two sixes. Should jump. I no think hoops. the combat patrols are as they are right now and will be for the next little while, at least for. Uh, oh, tenth flamers. Edition. The the combat patrols for Space Marines and Tyranids six, are the new box set. Four, five, six, seven. Uh, one wound so far. No AP. You're wounding me on sixes. With, I'm wounding on sixes. Things? Okay. I am toughness of nine. I don't know. Oh, maybe, maybe it's maybe it's five. Two more sixes from the smart missile. One wound out of all that. One wound. One wound and no AP from all that. That was it. That's all I can do. I'm okay. That's all I can muster. I rolled a five. What can you do when you roll normal sixes? Yeah, Overwatch is good, but it's really good on flamers. For flamers, yeah, that's where it really shines. You look, look, look oh, what I rolled. Look at that. That would have been the six shot weapon. Oh. Or have three sixes, oh. you would be dead. Oh, really dead. It's still strong. It's just not. 12 that damage strong. strong, yeah. You just need to get one of those big bad ones. It's through. turn three! You're <gasps> right! Sustained hits! So that would have been two extra hits for the, the missiles, but okay. it's not a lot. I mean, it's one more wound. Sure, okay. take one more wound. One damage! I eat it. Down to six. Down to six. Actually, I got a five up the door. <laughs> sure. Yep. Down to six! Cool. Because he's got an elixir. Yep. Now, I wonder if the elixir has to wound to battle shock things. Actually, it won't really matter. Disappointed. Why are you disappointed? I'm disappointed. Nick? I really wanted to kill him with Overwatch. It would have been fun. That would have been fun. For me. Yes. Yeah. yeah. All right, what do you got? But you know what? Fun for your opponent can be fun for you too. There is something to be said about making armies that are interesting <laughs> and fun to play against as well as with. Uh, okay. Bring it at me, bro. Ha. 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 Okay. Interesting. Interesting. Uh, oh, I forgot to move one unit. Pull him back so I can see if he deadly demises. Do it. Do it. Do I? Why would I pull him back? Well, I want to see him roll a one or two and die. Oh, okay. I think I just need to push my advantage in here and make you really. What are you thinking about? Walk well, I'm thinking about moving off of the center objective. Oh, yeah. I mean, you've got the point lead. I do have the point lead, and this way I can make it so you can't take it back easily. Yep. And I have a plan. So. You have a sneaky plan? Uh, it's not a lot of sneaky. It's pretty straightforward. It's go and bash them. <laughs> That's a good plan. Uh, yeah, works it's pretty good. a great good. plan. Uh, do you mind helping me line up the uh, possessed just right Rawr! Now? Rawr! 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 Uh, they move nine, so that's a normal move. They move nine inches? Yep. They're fantastic. They are fa I, I Yes, I totally agree. I've always been scared by them. And to be honest, I think they're actually even scarier than they were in this Yeah, edition. yeah. So. DJ Kazuma, thanks for joining the YouTube membership. Uh, hope you enjoy the exclusive stuff in there. Come join our Discord, it's a lot of fun. Why is Nick never late? Because he's always in the nick of time. Woo! <laughs> You're out of here. Everyone's left. Bye. Everyone's left? It's three o'clock. They didn't right. feel like working. <laughs> Raining. Turn that turn three. Yeah, <laughs> we're all at the top of turn three. <laughs> okay. Depends what happens here, I may throw in the towel. We'll find <laughs> out. <laughs> all right. So I am going to. Uh, I think that's everything that needs to move. Move. Yes. Yes. All right. I think he was short on the objective. I think so. Yeah. Yeah. Cool. So you've abandoned the home objective. Abandoned the middle objective. Like Technically, I own it right juice. now. Um, not for long. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> At least if I have anything uh, to say about it. Uh, <laughs> so let's Fly start back. with the master of possession. I'm going to use a right of possession and his sacrificial dagger because that's fun. Sure. So uh, sacrificial dagger. Sorry, what's I do going one on? mortal wound to my unit. Is this shooting phase? Yeah. Right? Yeah. Is okay. shooting phase? I'm just checking. I think so. Yeah. This so guy he, shooting? He I take a mortal wound. This guy shooting. He does a mortal wound to his own unit. Down to one. 
for one one wound on one of the guys there. Uh, one of the JC guys here. He stabs him with the dagger, and this is going to uh, add one to the hit roll and then one to the wound roll for my right of possession, which it's, is... It's uh, Chaos Space Marines. It's not demons. You're playing Chaos Space Marines. I am playing Chaos Space Marines. Mm -hmm. I'm going to right of possession, you focused witch fire, which is hazardous. Dad, you want for late lunch? I want the late lunch. Aww. Getting hungry here, too. Oh, man. Uh, two Where's shots late lunch? into your broadsides. Two shots on the broadsides. Got it. Uh, what's the toughness in your broadsides? 20. Cool. Uh, I'll fight that. Uh, broadsides. Miss. miss? Great. I miss. Doesn't matter. Don't They're worry about T6. it. T6. Uh, and I did do the focused, so I uh, might get hot. I do. <laughs> so I take D3 or just flat three? Flat three. Down to one wound remaining on my master possession. Excellent. I'm going out in a limb. Actually, I get to take three ignores. More one of them, so he's down to two wounds. Excellent. But that was a really... Uh, Time to throw in the towel. Silly... I mean, I am behind on score, but like to be honest, like, I still got an army left. Oh, well. well. I mean, for now. You're going to uh, take apart a lot of this just now. Oh, well. Yeah, I'm going to try and dismantle a lot of this. Right to be here. honest, at the end of this round, I'm, at the end of your turn, I'm probably just going to have the broadsides and the ghost heal, or the storm surge left. That's my dearest dream. Okay. So... Moving right along, over here, my cultists. If we weren't Walk the top turn three, you could come for hot too. All right, Tycho, you win. Congratulations. Have a good day. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> Only one, two, three, four, five, six of them can see. All right, I'm going downstairs because they can still hear me in the chat. Bye, Nick. I'm going downstairs. Shooting hey, at your best friend. Where are you? I'm coming. Let me out. Oh, he's already left. Uh, okay, the so game. the cultists shoot. Fine, I'm going back up the stairs. Two hit uh, I wanted hot bots. That sounded good. Did you miss him? I missed him. He's already gone. Oh, sorry, Nick. <laughs> I hit you twice with focus guns. What's the toughness on a Vespa? Four. One wound. Uh, one wound? Yep. Okay. Nope. Kill the Vespa. Take one off, please. There you go. Thanks, man. And the pistols over here. Oh, there's more. And a flamethrower. I know you're always hot. I am always hot. I run, oh, five hits. Did, did you see the uh, no, uh, comment from your wife? <laughs> no. She commented on, on the, the Death Guard reaction video. Oh, no. She say, and she said, <laughs> what did she say again? It was, it was something really cute. I can't, I can't remember what it was now. It was something really cute. One like, wound of the flame. I'll have to check that out. Nope. Feeling my best, man. You want to make the charge harder? Sure. And some pistols. Hi from Australia. Thanks to the channel for helping me learn how to play Warhammer. You are very welcome, Adbear. Yeah. Hopefully I pronounced that right. We're learning two right now. Oh, look at that. Two wounds with pistols. Two wounds with pistols. How many pistols do you have? I had. Killed another one. I keep losing Vespid to pistols. Pistols. That was fun. No, it wasn't. I have maybe a little bit. <laughs> All right, what are those crazy obliterators you want to kill? All right, so the what obliterator in the front here and his pal can see these guys up here. Ooh. So the two in the front. You know what I'm going to do? You're going to... Yeah? Ah! Did you All get right. that ready, Owen? Did you, did you time that? Yeah, you did. <laughs> Owen's on it. Oh, baby. Because he's got a switcher back there. He can switch back and forth between the Ooh. camera angles. He just, like, nailed it. I knew he would do that. Nice. I, saw, I looked at his hand. I was like, oh, yeah, he's got it. Look at that. <laughs> All right, so the ones in the front. Are any of you tournament players? And if so, which army did you use and where do you place in tournaments? Well, to be honest, I just did a tournament two weeks ago uh, for ninth edition. And I I uh, got best you overall. You won, yeah. Well, I guess it's kind of winning. I didn't win all three of my games, but I did win two of them. Uh, if anyone's played a few we, games we, in 10th already, how does the game feel in terms of lethality? Um, I mean, well, what it is is specialized damage. You have a lot more units that can do more... There's some units that can do more damage than before ninth, but they can do it only to specialized units. It's really different. To be frank, anyone telling you that they know it's different, like I, I think the lethality in melee has gone down a lot. Yeah. Uh, movements have been dropped a I little, mean, which makes melee generally less across the board. There's a lot less AP. There's a lot less AP, but higher damage on guns. It's really hard to say, and because the defensive stats have changed around so much, it's really, really difficult. But one thing I can say, if this were a ninth edition game, there'd be way more dead by now. It's true. Prince is going to bolter up your fire warriors. Boom, boom, boom. Uh, strength five, two wounds, I believe. AP? Uh, one. 
Ah, uh, you killed two then. Bye bye, two. Boom, boom. Um, hey, Max here. <gasps> Look at that. I didn't mean to show it off. Show off. Show off. Okay, fine. I'm showing off. Look, I got a medal. So, Nick, how many tournaments have you actually won? I don't know. You don't know. It's been that many. That's. <laughs> oh, I have won a couple. Tax won holding up a finger. <laughs> I've won a couple, but I don't remember how. My favorite was when I got second place in a big GT that, that by beating Tack with a towelist. <laughs> I know, you dropped me, we, from, we dropped me from potentially first to eighth. I, I, yeah, <laughs> yeah I, I dropped Tack from first to eighth by using a Yavara. It was nice, fun. Nice. Okay. The rest of the split fire, this obliterator into them. Okay, and this, this I will just pick up because this is so easy to kill. <laughs> you sure? There's, there's three guys that are T3 okay. with a six of safe. And this obliterator into them. Yeah. I am not going to dark pact. You can just kill them. It's one obliterator. I guess it's DC, DC, D6 plus three shots, strength five minus Minimum four one. shots, hitting on threes. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, right. you, you have a fine time killing them. So the first two into your... How do you feel about the Storm Surge? It seems like I take my other shot. It actually feels great. I'm really liking it. He's strong. He does a lot of damage. I haven't been able to shoot at optimal targets with his side guns, but his main gun has killed anything I wanted to shoot it at. So, yeah. I hate when they do that stupid super chats affect the game bullshit. Oh, I'm sorry. Sorry? You can go watch a different stream if you want. <laughs> well, I mean, I, I heard. We're trying to make this more fun-oriented than specifically competitive, so. Yeah, like, we've never been a competitive channel, and and not only not only that, but, like, it's it literally helps us keep the lights on. You leave guys are literally supporting us doing the 40K and 40Ms that, I'm, that most people tune in for, so thank you. If you don't like it, you don't have to watch it. Well, and, you know, I, I get it. And, like, I think we, we can have find room to make some streams that are a little bit more oriented towards... You just went on standby. Thank you. We do every so often do streams that are not that as well, but we generally focus on let's have a fun time hanging out with our with our people that want to watch. <laughs> Anyways, uh, wounding on... Is it minus one to wound them? Nope. Okay. So oh, sorry. oh yes, five. sorry. All my infantry are minus one to wound. Like, not the crew, but yeah. They, they are minus one to wound. Okay, so strength five normally be on threes, but fours now. Yeah. Ooh. Ooh. All right. Four, five, six, minus one. One, two, three, four, five, six. Six and minus one. Uh, I did okay, but then you killed three, and the and the fire blades all by himself. All by himself. All by himself. Per, 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 per. Yeah. Can't uh, wait to see you next, uh, next week in Calgary. You're going to be next week in Calgary? Awesome. Nice. I'm going to be there. JT's going to be there. And Michael Buckthorpe's going to be there. We're going to have a lot of fun. Plasma pistol to a crew's face. Hit him. Wounded him. Minus some. To the crew's face? Uh, yeah, yeah, don't save it. Plasma so side there's one it. crew left. All right, let's see if we can back. He's going to go first. It. He's going to kill you because you have two wounds left. That's, That's right. You, you got two attacks. All right, you're going to charge somewhere? Uh, I am fin finished. Oh, you're going to finish shooting. <laughs> <laughs> all right dark pact let's what do it what does it change i'm most happy about i love the new overwatch i need new global stratagems i feel it's so much smoother how they work yep yeah. combat patrols will have alternate data cards to help with balance they will and uh, yeah combat patrol is uh, essentially uh, a separate game yeah we'd love to talk about combat patrol and we will very soon that's one embargo we have to wait for all right so i'm going to be doing sustained hits uh, into on fives into your broadsides. Okay, right here with my venom crawler. Okay, bring it on. Ooh, all right, needing three. That's a pretty bad roll there, Tycho. The other venom crawler might still be alive. He didn't do very well at all. That was a terrible shot. Uh, so one X. Yes. Yes. And wounding on. Never played a Dorn army, just a long time lurker. Don Magnus. Well, thank oh. you. Nick, where do you get the blue plasma bullet coming from your barrels? That is one of our sponsors, actually. Uh, Deadly, Deadly Print Studios. Uh, they make effects that you can 3D print, or you can order it from their website directly and just. You like T7 or something? On these guys? Yeah. T6. Oh, that's four wounds then. Four wounds. Um, minus one. Minus one. Uh, I saved three of them. Two damage. Two damage. He's down to three wounds down here. And uh, yeah, you can. You can Purchase them already printed for you, or if you have a 3D printer, you can print them yourself. And that's also what these explosions are for, from, too. They're fun. I really, he makes cool effects, like the... He makes some cool, like, jetpack stuff. Yeah. Venom Crawler will charge your Cadre Fireblade. Bring it! Charge! Ooh! Get to the objective, right? Yeah. Huh? 
What's that, a nine? Oh, yeah. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Venom Crowley. John Luke Hodgman, welcome to the Play On community. Welcome to the, welcome to the community uh, welcome, YouTube membership. Check out the stuff. Hope you enjoy it. Super Chat can skew games and make it hard to tell how strong a thing it is, but they are the best thing for engagement. Aside from the actual people in the tree. Yeah, well, that, that's, that's why we do it, right? It's just, like, it's... Yeah, we, 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 try, we try to strike a balance between making it impactful, but not too impactful. And it's a balance, and we don't always get it right. No, we don't get it right. Sometimes we've had it where it has, hasn't had any impact, impact on the game, and then people feel bad for donating. Right. And then sometimes we've had it too impactful, and the game's almost over in turn one. Yeah, yeah. We had yeah. collapsing terrain one time where just, like, everything Yeah, that was, was pretty bad. <laughs> <laughs> the sniper has, has proved to be a pretty balanced way of doing it. It That's allows really... it to be impactful without it really changing the game yeah. that much. Yeah. Obliterators will charge your crew. Oh, that's a pretty long charge. Nope. Okay. And the cultists will charge your vestment. Okay. Six. Ooh, I hope so. I hope so. Oh, I hope in. so. It's about seven inches away, so. Yeah, you're in. Come on in. Oof. My army's being taken apart. Either you got a favorite unit from this game. Yeah, the debris game. Yeah, that was pretty rough. Matt remembers that one. <laughs> <laughs> it was fun, but it was uh, extreme. <laughs> Charging of a demon prince into your fire warriors. Uh, yeah. Are you moving him in for me? Uh, yeah. I was debating doing uh, debating doing you a minus can, two to your charge, but oh. I'm not gonna bother. Oh, I can't do overwatch. I already did overwatch. Oh right. Yeah. Some armies have ways that they can double up on stratagems and yeah, get free stratagems and stuff like that. Yeah, the debris game was ridiculously nuts. The sniper was fun. We we had a lot of fun shooting snipers. Where is your ethereal? In that unit right there that you're Oh, fucking. excellent. So if you can kill him. Yeah. Oh, this is a great use of the stratagem for Oak Strike. Or it Heroic is. Challenge. It is. Yeah. Yeah. I love seeing that in play. Yeah. But uh, are we at the ch done charges? No. Okay. Possessed. Don't do it. <laughs> no. <laughs> no. No. They're already dead, Tycho. Nerfs. All right. Got them all in. Yay. Well, let's fight. Uh, that was something else. This is a possessed. Yep. All right, what do you got? Okay. You do not have enough to interrupt. No, I do not. So... Why would I interrupt, though? I'm Tau! Uh, you know what? Let's try the funky strategy. Okay, this is a cool strategy. This is one of the base strateg new base strategies in the game. It's called Heroic Challenge. Heroic and, Challenge! And, uh, basically... A character that is about to fight can declare it and use a command point, and basically all their weapons become precision. It's not heroic challenge. It's epic challenge. Epic challenge. <laughs> there we go. And uh, that means you can strike all your blows against characters. Oh, Colin! Colin! It's, Col it's actually a little bit weird. You strike the unit, but the damage goes so really hurt. Colin is choosing to uh, to cement the discussion back and forth right now by introducing a sniper shot. Oh. And that's going to happen right at the very end of the, the phase we're in. So it's going to happen after your fight phase. And where, where, where's it going? But Colin, you decide where that's going. Yeah. Where do you want that to shoot? Yep. So Prince is going to start the festivities going ham on your poor ethereal. FM, yes, it is. Out of ethereal, yeah. So uh, epic challenge. See epic kill, challenge. See if you can kill the ethereal. Sweepy, sweepy, sweepy. Bring it on. Oh, actually, Dark Pact. He's okay. <laughs> uh, okay, so that means that all of these are sustaining. Okay. Okay. And then the okay. ones all miss. Yeah, he's got a lot of hits. And I don't think I'm gonna... And four yeah. versus six, so that's two more. Okay. And my strength is six. Your toughness is a lot less than that. <laughs> so I'll be back to you away on twos. Demon Prince! Oof, oof, oh, oof. good lord. <laughs> All right. Your ethereal. <laughs> I have a five up in Roll. Good. Yeah, okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. Wow. <laughs> Casual With 14 these attacks, Casual these he did 15 wounds. So, uh, I saved two of them. And how much damage is each? One each. One each? Okay, I actually have a five up feel of pain. Wow. I stopped a few more. Do I have more than one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine wounds? No, I do not. The ethereal is dead, and then it continues on and kills all the guys. One, two, three, four, five. So you have actually killed. He has three wounds. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Hey, you killed the squad. Yay! Squad dead. Prince of Doom. That was fun. You no, know, he's dead next turn, right? No, I'm, you're, you're going to miss. 
I'm gonna miss you say. <laughs> Bring it. All right. Uh, Venom Crawler. He's all yeah, set with you. He's gonna chew on your. I don't, I don't see it failed. He gets it. seven attacks because he ate your soul. He's got three wounds. Well, um, <laughs> here we go. Moderator can pick the sniper shot. So that's Owen. Owen, oh, where's the sniper oh. shot? Go? Oh, take shot with Commander Farsight. It makes him viable. Because right now, Commander Farsight kind of sucks a little What's bit. What's your toughness on the Cadre Fire? Uh, tank shot's awesome. Uh, three. Six wounds. Minus one. One, two, three, four, five, six. He dead. Oh! Two apiece. Two apiece? Yeah, he did. Yeah, he did. Oh, and Dick. below, roll 86 on odd roll sniper works for chaos. Even roll attack. Wow. Ooh, so we got one Brando and we got one. Ooh, and now he's double sold. Sorry, uh, Owen, what did you say he was going? Uh, you wanted, you, he said you choose. Oh, I, I choose. Um, what's the range of the Carter? Uh, Carter's dead. Oh, it's dead. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> Why, you're too late. Well, the Venom Crawler killed him. Oh, okay. Uh, That's the closest. Bro what role does Broadsides uh, do? Possess. Broadsides are almost oh, better than Hammerheads. The Possessed are getting act, shot. Get more shots. Sorry? The Possessed are getting shot. Do, okay, we're interrupt right now? Sure. That's where Owen decided. All right. And then, okay, so Possessed get shot. They do get shot, and they take three more, two or more, two more to wounds. Kill another one. Oh. And then we've got one more sniper shot coming in from Nick Malone that we have to roll after the fight phase. Okay. Where's right. the two? There it is. All right, so are the possessed going to try to kill all those fire wars? Yes. <laughs> and they lost one right before the fight. There you go. Too Perfect. Bad. Well done. That's terrible. Farsight would be great with tank shock. She's in with tank shock, and he would kill a lot. That's a lot of possible mortal wounds. Yeah. Yeah, I, I, yeah I'm surprised by how few damage, how little damage Farsight actually does. I think he needs a little bit of something there. But really? tank, tank shot actually does make. What's what's wrong with far side? You got like no no attacks. No. Yeah, so like most of the close combat units that were good before, they're okay now. Right. It just doesn't seem worth it because yeah. he doesn't have, because it only has one range weapon. Yeah. So. Yeah. Mortarian's damage has like been over half. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, all right. He's not what he was. So kill him. Okay, unholy bloodshed. This means I have What did you just say? Wounds. Unholy bloodshed. There. That's what the best <laughs> I love it. I love it. <laughs> all right. I have to make a dark pact. So I'll make a dark pact, because I like dark pacts. So I'll be Beseech doing... Beseech the dark gods. So I have devastating and sustained one. I... Oh, oh, failed. But failed. I have a flag. So re-rolling. I don't see... Oh, there's a flag. <laughs> it's still into a Eric failed! T3 mortals. T3 mortals! One. Oh, Do I ignore it? I don't. You're down to one. Thank you. Yay! So that is what? Four possessed and a master of possession. There you go. So, four possessed. Do four attacks each. Yeah, very likely we'll see Monka, Farsighting Claw, Lone Clay. We'll probably see Viola, Tau Tep, all those kind of things. Oh, we'll probably get like five to six attachments. Uh, I'm looking forward to seeing that, seeing what they do. Because we can try out different kind of army style play styles. So they will give you new attachments, or so new stratagems, new enhancements, new uh, army rules. Be fun. Nick, what do you think of the Tau changes overall? Interesting here from a fluff and gameplay point. I think they play pretty fluffy for the most part. I just think the, uh, I think the biggest thing struggling for me for playing Tau is they don't play how I'm used to, how I want to play, because they only gave me the Kayun ability which is the slow, patient hunter. I want the aggressive, overwhelming force. Yeah. Oh, I love sustained hits. Logan, you're welcome. I'm glad you're in the hobby. I have a strength of... We're just waiting for Taika to figure out if he's killed all these fire wars or not. Yep. I think it's taking like 20 minutes to figure out if he's you killed all these what? fire wars. <laughs> strength five. <laughs> Toughness I'm just going to roll to tell me three. to pick them all up. <laughs> All right, so that's six mortal wounds. Okay. Oh, these are minus one to wound. Okay. Minus one to wound, that means I wound you on fours. So six mortal wounds and six saves. That minus anything? Uh, minus one. Kill them all. All dead. Bye-bye. Yay. Bye, fireworks. You know, this Dark Pax thing, I know a lot of people were poo-pooing it on paper, but cool. hot damn, does it make the units spicy. You can really yeah. like pump them up when yeah. you really need to. 
Yeah, it does. And like, you don't have to dark pact if you're not doing the thing you want to do. So it makes it, it's got some play. I like it. I like it. Okay. Now, now you need to kill those Vespid back there. Yeah, Vespid. Piling in. Yeah, 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 yeah. How are you finding the data sheets for the convenience and the rules? Oh, way better. It's a way better system. Yes. I love it so much more. It's so much easier to find the rules, to read the rules. I just wish we had the actual cards. We were supposed to get the cards weeks ago. Wow. They're upset with you. A little bit. And wounding on five. Oh, I have like two Vespid left there? I hit you. I wounded you once. You killed oh. another Vespid. Wow. I just Actually, I screwed up. I have five more attacks. It's always great when you screw up for yourself. Hoping Cal get Monca, Monat, uh, yeah, that'd be awesome. I would, we'd mind. Christopher Clayton, thank you very much for the donation. Two dollars is awesome. Helps go towards, go towards everything uh, we're doing. No more. You've got one, one vested box. Okay. Excellent. Excellent. Uh, <laughs> uh, ongoing combats. That you get to pick the first one. He's gonna try to kill you. He hits you twice. Oh, here we go. Come on. Who wins you once? Did you take? Fight her back. All right. Fight him back. Have them renounce when Forge World point staff to be revealed. Yes, very soon. Fisting the crew. That's all said. Two hits. Yeah, Forge World gets their own index cards that have that are released later. Wow, the crew survives. Is your OC one or Zero. two? Zero. I am. Ooh. I am. I'm, I'm, yeah. I'm the objective? Well, you're going to have to bake a battle shock death, yeah. but yes, you might. All right. Then that Vespid back there tries to hit you. And it didn't hit you. Two attacks. Nice. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. No, I better check that because they, that, that guy used to have two attacks. Oh. Does he still have two attacks? This the Vespid killed an orc. Has one attack. No. So it failed. No, 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 no. Filled hit. I just wanted our folks to know that we are trying to get this right. We're trying. There's a lot of new rules we're learning. This is only my second game with the Tau on 10th edition, and everything is different. So I got to relearn everything. And I'm learning, I'm learning how some units are great and some units are not so great. And I, my price of suits may not be great. You know what? Still, I, need some, I need some more I need we some have more testing. No idea. I need some more testing. They did just them. die and I could have placed them a bed better. <laughs> yeah. All right, cool. Uh that's the turn. my turn? Yes. What what do you score points wise? Oh, um I don't think I killed any vehicles. You did not kill any vehicles. I uh, did I kill any characters? You did, I did. Kill, you did kill my ethereal. So that's four for him. Oh and you killed my fireblade. Oh that's four for him. So I got an eight. You get eight more points. And then it goes to my turn and Good I score 40. I currently hold two points for this, yep. but I'm gonna do a battle shock test for this ethere this fruit. Hey, oh, he's good! He's good! He holds the objective Bam. five points, five giving points. me five, six, seven points. Owen, oh, please. Uh putting my score, it's still losing. And you're still getting <laughs> you get two command points. Still get the command points. I'm at two command points. To Tycho's two command points. Yep. And then basically I'm just gonna stay still. To all these weapons are gonna stay still for heavy weapons and try to kill things. Makes sense. Oh, the Vespin in the back. Is he battle shocked? He oh, is. Quite. Oh, if he wasn't battle shocked, you know what? I'm gonna spend a command point for insane bravery. Oh, he's insane. Because he moves so far, he's gonna go take that back your back objective. Boo. How far does he move? 14. Wow. <laughs> Certainly. Oh, not range? I'll eh. give it to you. I'll give it to you. Um Sorry, I'm, I'm moving him already. Yeah, that's fine. The crew will stay in combat. <laughs> Why not? Um, and he's okay. Yeah, he's fine. The storm surge is gonna split fire everything. Cause he's going to split fire. Split fire. I love the uh, little riff I did. <laughs> did you do that, or did you steal that from the internet? I totally stole it from the internet. Um, <laughs> You're not a guitar guru. No. Well, to be honest, I licensed it from the internet. So do I you play any that. instruments? Oh, I played violin. Really? I play drums. Wow. Uh, I played a tiny bit of bass. I can Actually, play the cello, and I can really make a lot of noise on a trumpet. But it's noise. It's not music. <laughs> I have a very uh, decent singing voice. I was in a lot of musicals yeah, and bands. Yeah. I was in a heavy metal band. I was in an emo heavy metal band. You were also in a lullaby band on this channel yeah, very recently. Yeah. Gro groveling poet. Groveling poet! Groveling poet! Thank you very that's much for the donation. Cool, Do broadsides and hammerheads excite you more intent? Uh, broadsides look awesome. Hammerheads are okay. I, I miss that ignoring inbone, but I understand why they got rid of it. The amount of firepower these broadsides put out is is a little scary. Yes. For example, we're gonna do that right now. The broadsides <laughs> are gonna fire everything. Um, I have nothing to spot or anymore, so nothing's spotting anything. Okay. The broadsides are gonna fire their rail guns into this venom crawler, and they're gonna fire their um all the rest of their guns into these guys right in front. Okay. 
So the rail guns into this Venom Crawler. Pew! And they hit you twice. And they will... Oh, no, they're heavy. They hit on threes. That's three... Uh, that's two wounds. No, wait. Uh, what's your toughness? On the Venom Nine. Crawler. Nine. Nine? Okay. So only two wounds. Two wounds. Two wounds at minus a billion. Uh-oh. Uh, D D6 plus one for each one. Ah, I'm dead. Four, five, six, seven, eight damage. Do I go boom? You do not, but you have to reroll it first. Life. Oh, I go boom. You do. Are you six inches away from your guys? I don't know. You have to tell me. You are. I am. Uh oh. <laughs> you explode into these guys here. That is an ah. Uh, That's a big it's boom. John. Oh boy. Oh, three more wounds. <laughs> this guy. I can go on sixes. I can go on sixes. I don't. And this guy is taken two, so you're down to one over here. Yep. Excellent. I love it. Oh. Uh, and take that Venom Crawler away from here. See, but I don't want are pretty to. Uh. Broadsides are now going to fire the rest of the guns, as I said, into these guys right in front. Whatever these are, possessed, chosen, fingers. Plasma shots. <laughs> Hits once. I think he's got a little KT, uh, chaos PTSD. Wounds once at minus four, three. And not minus four anymore. It's minus three. <laughs> Fine. You are? I got a five up as well. And then the missile drones. Hitting on. Oh, I missed them all. Oh, that sucks. They did okay. Um, Storm Surge. Storm Surge is going to fire his destroyer missile here. He's going to fire... Uh... See, the destroyer missile is really all I need to kill him. He's going to split fire. I am going to split fire. <laughs> the cluster rocket system is going to go in these guys right here. I think only one more invulnerable is an assassin with one per game known to... Huh? I don't understand, Thomas. Okay. Flamer, oh, in Flamer into these guys. Um, cluster rocket system here. Hmm. Smart missile system here. Destroyer missile here at the Demon Prince. Big blast cannon. Oh, I really want to kill the obliterators, but I can't. So blast cannon to these guys. Big blast cannon. Two shots. I'm going to do the two shot weapon. I know it's stupid, but I'm going to do it because I just love it. And I hit it both times because it's a heavy weapon. And it's strength a billion. It's strength 24. One so move. Still got a one. Why? <laughs> okay, fine. One wound at minus six. Oh, so. 12, me, 12 me, flat damage. Check my prince. 12 flat damage. Oh, actually, uh, Nick. <laughs> Look at that face. Look at that face. I do get lethal hits. Uh, no, I only get lethal hits if uh, I only get lethal hits if I'm guided. I believe it's a sustained hits. I guess. Oh, oh Tax is teasing us from afar. What is it? Food is good. Oh, I forget what it is. <laughs> I think Nick's hungry. I am. I am. I'm hungry. I want food. Necrons look super tough. Um, he's dead. Death Guard are jealous of Necrons. He's not dead? Huh? He's I not dead? It. Destroy you've got, you've got Destroyer missile. shot. Okay, I'll see it. Four up in ball on Demon Prince is rad. I, to be honest, that's all I could do. Because what's going to happen is this guy, because I failed to kill the Demon Prince, what happens is these guys go up here and charge me here. He goes here and charges me here. And though he doesn't able to kill it, probably with the added shots there, that is... That is the game. Um, if I managed to do this, like wipe up both of these units, I actually probably could clean you up in turn four. Probably. I wouldn't be surprised if I still had a pretty hefty uh, points lead. Oh, yes. The point lead is massive for you. Because I think I could get back to my objective here. I could sticky this one up, which would be a yeah. problem. I'm going to take that back. But what I'm it. saying is no, neither of us, I think, would be tabled. No. Um, and if this was a ninth edition game, one of us would already be tabled. Yeah. 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 yeah I think the lethality overall is definitely down. Yeah. Because this will probably take you two to three turns to, to kill him. Oh, he's yeah, well, probably more. 22 yeah. wounds? I mean, I'm only doing six big attacks. Yeah. Sure. Uh, do one run of fight against attacks in it. Do one run of attacks uh, in it. And we're going to... If I pass my... T12, I believe it is. So that would be... Yep. Yeah. Mm -hmm. On the storm surge? T11. I'm going to pretend I've already done my dark pact. So yeah. I can't kill myself with it. Um, I am strength of only... Oh. It's, it's T11 is strong. Yeah. Eight. Joanna Huisman? Looking Huisman? for fives. Jo jo Jonah? Jonah Huisman? Hope I'm pronouncing it right. Thank you so much for joining the Patreon. Or the YouTube membership. Thank you, Jonah. We are well we're... I'm going to get these names so wrong in this edition. Yeah, Jonah. me too. Me too. You have a whole table of fish fingers right there, Nick. Are you referring to these? <laughs> <laughs> I don't get it. <laughs> oh, it's, never mind. Uh, only one move. Okay. So I, I think you probably would have just blasted the Whitney. And then next turn I blast him away. Yeah. Your dice failed you at some key moments. They did. They did. Yeah. Um, I'm okay with this army. Like, I, I think, I think I had. You haven't, a you haven't figured it out yet. 
But I think there, there's more tactics. I think I could have, in the first term, hidden a bit better. I was a bit loosey goosey. I was expecting, I was expecting my crisis to be like they were a ninth. They're like, oh yeah, they could tank anything because like all these drones and all these things. No, you picked them up in one round of shooting with one model. That was wild. That I was wild. Really well on both of really them. Yeah. Venom crawlers, I think, were my stars. Yeah. They are so good. 12 inch movement with shooting like that. Yeah. The dark packs make them really, really, yeah. really cool. And uh, you were able to take a commanding lead in your points. You were able yeah. to take board control, which was huge. And that's actually, Tau's going to struggle with that because you don't really they have assault are. troops. You got breachers, they which are. double for it, but you actually don't often make charges with them, which is that, that yeah. extra bit of movement. Well, that's, what, that's why I brought that big crew blob, right. and, but they didn't really do much. Well, and like that's one of the problems I think with unprotected infantry is yeah. they, they evaporate really quick. In terms of like yeah. actually anti-infantry fight yeah. or shooting, it's all the same. Yeah. I like seafood that can't fight back. <laughs> so okay. We're so, all sushi fans. Long and short of it, do I think Tower broke in a no good decision? No, I don't. I think they have a lot of play. I think there's a lot of strong things. I think there's more combos for me to figure out. Maybe I, it's more breachers and fire blades. I wonder, yeah, if the storm surge actually hurt you because you I was able to not present it with clean targets. There was a lot of times where I didn't have optimal targets for fire. Right, so if you had like but two more devil fish full of breachers, could be. you could have caved in a whole bunch yeah. more of my line. Sky rays look a lot of fun. I want to try sky rays. I think more stealth suits would be good. Yeah. I think two stealth suit units would be really good because they get, give you reroll ones to wound. Also, they huge. can start in scoring positions. They can. I stealth think, suits can. I think I got to figure out the optimal way of how to play this game a little bit more because everything's so different. Where was Nick's dice touched by Steve? A little bit. A little <laughs> bit. Yeah. Um, so I'm, I'm not tabled though, and I still have some strong units left. You do. But we are going to end it there because the game is running away from me score wise. This would be the perfect time to do a gambit, but because I only have two units left, most gambits require you to have four model, four units to be able to do I a think gambit. They all do. Uh, I think they all do. Yeah, which so. means actually means I I I would be amazed to actually hear of a real gambit victory. I I, I yeah. want it to happen. Yeah. But I fear that it's gambits are really tough to do. I love small. I love I love what it means. I yes. love the thought of I'm losing this game, but I have but a chance. I have a chance. Yeah, I love that idea. Yeah. So, thank you everyone for watching. Oh. Thank you very much for uh, joining us for the stream. It was a joy to have you here. I hope you enjoyed it, and I hope like that one guy, you weren't feeling this was an awful stream to watch. <laughs> <laughs> we attempt to be entertaining. <laughs> we attempt to be entertaining. We're doing our best. We're trying to bring you along for the ride and let you have some fun playing, playing with us, because we can't have you, obviously, in the room with us. But we hope you feel like you're a part of our little club here well, and well, part of our group. We have had some of our patrons hanging out in, yeah, in the room for fun. streams, you know? Dr. Vancouver was yeah. hanging around for one of yeah. them. And, Long yeah. and short of it, we're excited to just play more games with him. We're enjoying we all of our games. All of them have been a lot of fun, been really good learning I, games. I think this is the least close game we've had. This one it right does now. feel like it and even then like we're still going into turn four and it's still within like 20 points yeah less. like well, I, I and that's the, without me scoring a bunch of points right just now. Yeah, yeah exactly right like so i mean i i think actually this game is is i think i could have so i think i could have way better secondaries that's probably true yeah that's probably true so there's that too yeah so i think yeah i, I think there's a lot going that i need to figure out how to play this army better so i like my secondaries and actually it's kind of heartening to hear that i can choose sort of kill secondaries yeah because that it was always I, I, I like. You didn't like doing actions. I like being. You hated actions. I hated action so much. <laughs> oh, you know why? Because I just always forget. So it was just a, like a, yeah. ha, ha, you don't get to do stuff kind of. Thank you, Fresh. Standout units, breachers with fire blades in, in, in devil fishes, uh, broadsides, um, storm charges, um, uh, stealth suits. I think I need stealth suits. More stealth suits. I need two units of stealth suits. Mm. Yeah. Uh, For me, Venom Crawlers, Obliterators. Yeah. Um, actually, I really liked my cultists. Yeah. They didn't actually have a starring role, but sticky objectives are such goodness. So, yeah. yeah. So, I, yeah. So, if you're getting discouraged by the, the tap performance in the second half, be, please, please re re remember my dice weren't great. I chose poor seconders, I think, and I didn't do a great job of deploying. And, and on top of that, I think that melee-oriented chaos with a smattering of shooting is actually a pretty hard counter. You don't have any defenses in melee. Like, you, you don't fight in melee. No, no. So, I, I, the move to jump in the transport was fun. It was fun. Like, it actually saved the breacher's lives and actually scored me some points. Like, yep. I was able to take the objective away from yep. you at point. So, it's cool. There's cool things we can do. So, we're going to end it there. Thank you very much for joining us. As I said, this has been Nicholas. 
We got Tyco over there. We're playing on tabletop. We make battle reports. We do live streams every so often. Uh, please consider joining our Patreon or YouTube membership. You get access to exclusive stuff. And there's you get, lots uh, of good stuff. There's some good stuff in there. We do live streams for you guys. We do uh, exclusive battle reports. We do early access and our Discord, which is an amazing community. We love you guys so much. Oh, um, and check out some of our impressions videos. Uh, this is a little bit of an early impression stuff, but we got some. Uh, interesting takes on some we're, of the try, we're trying to go through all of them yeah. we'll see if we get through all of them to be honest we might have to skip a couple because there's just so many armies there are so many armies and uh sadly yeah we, we couldn't yeah. get steve pinned down to do the uh, rest of the power yeah. armor so. but what an exciting time to get into 40k the points are out the data sheets are out get out there play some games roll some dice that's the only way we're going to learn this game <laughs> and until we see you next time oh one last thing mm. Uh, if you're considering, uh, have to shout out the sponsor because that's a great thing to do. Frontline Gaming, they sponsored this video as well as you. There's an affiliate link where if you're looking for train for yourself or battle mats battle or mats. gaming aids or miniatures for yourself, yep. great place. Yep. Affiliate link also supports the channel. Yep. But until we see you next time, take care and play, play on. on.